we are back with my second time on the Frankenstein machine. Now I'm starting to understand this game a little bit better. So let's drop another hundred bucks in this bad boy and see if we can get another great game out of Frankenstein. Okay, so the Frankenstein icon, the classic face, we're gonna see that only on reels two, three, four, and five. In the first reel, if we get the it's alive or that other phrase, that other like Frankenstein phrase, and we get the, 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 those are all wild, so that whole middle row where that guy, yeah, where the, like the big, the big zoom in on the face. Those are wild. So if we can get that words, then the paces, we can go into the It's Alive game. That is really what I want to experience today. No guarantees, but some days we have the luck and some days we don't. And last time we played this game, we had it. So I like the mystery. I like the Halloween vibe. Frankenstein is, is a classic. It's a classic story. One of the best of all time. So let's dive into this eerie world and see what the slot machine has in store for us. <laughs> Dr. Frankenstein, your evil genius is too much. Oh, what's that guy again? Oh, I remember thinking about that last time. I should have looked it up beforehand. His assistant, Igor, maybe? Or is that just like the name of all people who are hunched over? <laughs> I mean, not everyone who's hunched over is obviously named Igor. That's, that's a huge stretch, but I just, I, kind of my brain is thinking that, that his name is Igor. Oh, there's four wilds accumulating in the bottom right corner. There's more wilds in the middle. There's a lightning power up. What does this mean? But we... Oh, yeah. Okay, so if we... I don't think that was the right phrase to be in the first row to, to make that trigger. I'll let you know if I see it again. I just can't remember what it was exactly. Nothing there. Nothing there. Free game. Would have been, okay, maybe... It, so maybe if that free game is in the left and then we get two Frankensteins on the right. That power up is one. But but we need the Frankenstein in reel number two and three to make that work, I think. Oh, but you can see how close we were. You can see we're getting close to it. Um, nothing there, but maybe... Uh, 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 come on. Spin it to win it. Spin it to win it. $78.45. I forgot how cinematic this game was. I wonder if there's a Lord of the Rings. Oh, three free games? Does that give us a free game? That might be a free game. That's $1.20, but do we get a free spin? Eight free games won. Multiplier locked in. Let's take it to the next level and bring Frankenstein to life. Oh, no. We live in a windmill? Why is it on fire? Doesn't seem very Frankenstein, but I like the graphics anyways. Multiplier lock, touch to start. We have touch. Oh, and we got expanded reels too. Igor's everywhere. Frankenstein's everywhere. Howling moons everywhere. It's alive. That's the one we want to see in the left. And now we could really use them in the right. We're not getting it. It's alive. It's alive. Oh. 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 In the bonus game, it works a little differently. Big win, big freaking Frankenstein level win. I wonder how high this is gonna climb to. I imagine Frankenstein sitting up right now from the table, ripping himself out of the straps because we forgot how strong he can be when he's put together and given the electricity he needs. $19.60 worth of a lie. Wait, did we just... Oh no, we're still an expanded screen. Three more three more freebies? Oh my gosh, we have so much going on. Look, there's an It's Alive in the first run. Oh, and we have Frankenstein's in the second, third. This is going to be a big thing. This is going to be a really big thing, I think. Nine dollars there. Twelve. Oh my gosh, twelve hundred. Five, one, and sixty. Ooh, we're gonna be way up. Do 
Dude, this is the fourth day in a row. I'm above 100. What is going on with my luck? Look at Frankenstein. 31. That's on top of the 20. And I'm only, I've only spent like 23. Wow. 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 This is great. It is alive. It is so alive. It is so alive. What? Dun, 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 dun. Total that up, baby. Let's see what we get to. We are bringing the $15 miner and a $12 win. Stacking that up to $80. Seven dollars? <coughs> oh my gosh, my, I'm sorry, I'm getting, people are looking now. See, see, see that guy, got, that guy was watching me for a minute, I was getting a little too crazy. Here is my total win, it is insane. $88.19, I only make 60 cent bets. That's crazy. I am at $166, we are clearly in the win zone right now. I, I am shocked. $164. Wow, Frankenstein, round two, you did not disappoint. That was just as good as the last one. That was crazy. Oh, love it. Oh man, I don't even, I, I'll play, I, I'll play this down for sure, but like, wow, that was a nice win. Come on, it's alive. If we get a Frankenstein in real two and three, I'm gonna flip out. I'm going to reanimate my, I'm gonna need to, I'm gonna need reanimation after that. Put me on the table, shoot some, oh, we might have it, oh, no, we don't. Dude, I almost thought we had it. That third it's reel would have hit. Oh, wait, do we? Yeah, an exciting, it was an exciting 100 credits to win. Yeah, I, th I thought you had to have it in two, but yeah, it looks like as long as you get to live in one, then the second one counts. Oh, wow. What was the name of the uh, author of this book? Uh-oh. More power. More power. Uh, I should definitely know this, but Shelly, I think, uh, the author of Frankenstein is. We should all know this. I'm sure you know this. Drop it in the comments so I can think about how dumb I am for not knowing it anymore. I want to say Shelly or something, but I know that's Mary Shelley or something. I don't know. Anyways, it's a classic book. She's an amazing author. Obviously, you know what? The other thing I like about Frankenstein is it's not just about the horror aspect. It's about the, like, what is it to be alive? Like, when do you sort of emerge into an entity that, like, thinks and feels and, like, if you have different components? Have you guys ever heard about how if you had a, a ship, like a boat, like an old boat made of wood, and you replaced it piece by piece, how it would always be a boat? But if you replaced every piece one at a time, it would be like a whole new boat at some point. Isn't that crazy? Okay, I just had to, just had to see if that was going to turn into another. Who knows with this machine? I might walk out of here with $1,000. I'll be jolted alive by that. $145.96. Keep on spinning. We got some wilds everywhere. Some Franken wilds. Free game almost. I've had some free games already that have really stacked up to be some big wins so far. We got free games on free games already. Let's keep on spinning. Maybe I'll run this one down a bit more. Uh, come on. Frankenstein, we're getting hot. We're getting electrocuted. There's It's Alive. Give me a while. A free game. No. Okay. Got close. It's a fun machine because that first reel is like kind of OP, you know? Like, if. Oh! No. <laughs> I like the way it's designed. I get all hyped up on It's Alive. Oh, two. oh, it does count those wilds over there. Nice. Stack those up. 75 and 150. I'll take it. That's two dollars and 25 cents. Tech that on. There we go. It's alive again. Come on. Let's get some wilds. Some Franken faces. Franken faces. Franken faces. Oh, Igor. Oh, there, there's our Franken faces. Why didn't they come last time? You just never know with Frankenstein. You never know what you're going to get. Okay, we got some free games. Free games everywhere. Frankenstein over there. Hmm, 
Let's see if we can break out of this. There we go. Power up. What's that going to turn into? Power me up. Lightning strike. It's alive. Do you guys know what a Faraday cage is? What? Ooh, double power ups. I'll take that too. Faraday cage is a little box you can be in and have crazy electricity around you, but it will go around you instead of into you, so you can be like in the middle of a lightning storm and not be dead. It's very exciting. I mean, I've never been in one, I just know they exist. Faraday cages are like those things that remind me of what you see in the Frankenstein slot machine where the lightning is like coming at it. Um, it kind of like, if you ever see those people that go in those cages and like see sharks, it's kind of like that, but imagine the sharks are lightning bolts. And they hit you and they go around you. It's very cool. Um, all right, nothing yet. I'm gonna not play this. Should I play this to 100 or maybe just... I'm just gonna play this a few more times. I think we got a lot out of... Wait, never mind. Why do I say those things right before? I always say those things when it's, the timing's wrong. Power up. Ooh, I have 100 times 2x on that. I should keep playing maybe for another minute. Another power up? That's it. All right. I had a lot of fun. We're leaving with some profit. We'll be back to Frankenstein's second time on this game. There will be a third. Thank you, Mr. Frankenstein. Come travel the world with me today. We are leaving the United States and we are going across the seas. We are going to experience this Asian machine and I could not be more excited. I am ready for some novelty. Ooh, look at that Chinese lamp. That is beautiful. Love to see that working. We have $100 in this bad boy, and I'm feeling like that is going to get brighter and brighter and brighter. By the way, this is my first time on the machine, but I'm already feeling like I'm digging it. I just got good, it's like very responsive, I think, and it's very colorful, very engaging. I'm definitely loving all the symbols. Some of these flowers are super romantic, and I love the lamp. What are those little fireflies just like boop, flying up there? By the way, I read this book uh, that was all about fireflies and how they can blink in unison because they all become like, all the men become super competitive with one another and then they're like all struggling to beat the other to blink and they all blink in unison. Fireflies are very competitive. And you know what? So am I. I am competing today with this machine. It's a mind over matter type thing. Obviously, we actually all know how slot machines work, but you know, I'm not, you can't beat them by using your mind over matter. But that doesn't mean I can't pretend or engage with the machine in a way that can increase my luck. And that's what I'm doing right now and see how that directly resulted in more and more fireflies going into that lamp. Brighter and brighter. Come on, come on. Ugh, not this one. Maybe. Oh, what the was that? Hey, look at that lady, that little lady coming into that frame there. Look at this wins. What are we doing? $909. I am down with that. Let's get some of this cash back. I am loving seeing those ladies. I'm loving seeing the line wins on the jacks. I see more lanterns, which always gives me faith that thing is going to get bright enough. The boom. Jackpot. You know what I mean? That could happen. Asian jackpot. Oh, there she is again. Let's bring her back. Very beautiful woman. Very fiery on the edge. Come on, let's get another spin in here. This is... Oh! Man, what is this? Oh, why did that turn into the... That was a three. That was a, that was a whole column. Double column. See, that's what I expected. All right, at least I got it this, this spin. Look, there she goes. Let's try to get that fire woman back. Come on, fire woman. Come on, lantern. Come on. Okay, we got our lantern. Not bad. Moving up, moving up. Come on. Ooh, double lantern on that one. Can you imagine? Could have got a third. That would have been nice. I could have seen that happen. Nothing. All right, once again. And nothing. Dang it. What is going Oh, okay. We got our lantern. I'm happy with that. Oh, hi. We got our lantern and our lady. And we got this, like, glowing basket thing at the bottom. Feeling some energy. Look at her. She looks so... You can tell, like her face, I can tell her face is brighter now than it was. Look at that thing. Remember at first it was kind of like in the shade. I could just be making things up. I know I'm making things up, but like, I think it's getting brighter. I'm feeling brighter. What is this? More of those triple ladies, but not gonna turn into, into anything. Gotcha. Actually, don't gotcha, because that was another loss. We're already down to $28. That actually went pretty fast today. I'm not even betting that big. I'm still low. Whoa, what do we got here? We got 
six little beautiful baskets of pearls or something. Nine dollars. Um, I guess it just feels like what have we been filming for like five minutes or something, and it's already down to twenty-five. I mean, I've certainly had worse. You guys know I've had worse, but somehow luck just doesn't feel like it's in my favor. Seventy-five cents, I'll take it. Got my fire lady. Maybe on the next bit. Let's turn this luck around. Oh, oh, there's a lot of whatever that little awesome artwork is. That didn't mean that was nothing. What? Oh, I thought that would have been some kind of a win. What? What? All right, this is where we mount our big comeback. We're gonna. We're down to nine dollars, five dollars. Now we are down to maybe our last spin. Big comeback. Big comeback. Oh. <laughs> like, you're faking me out with that, but that's not a win. I'm out of money now. I found the most colorful, cartoony, animated slot machine on the floor today. It was calling for me. It gives me Angry Birds vibes, so I was really attracted to it. But it is called Crazy Chickens. And unlike Angry Birds, we could win $10,456 if we get the grand prize, which I have never got ever in my life since starting this channel so maybe this machine will help us do that for the first time so hundred dollars in you're doing the usual let's get started feel some of this good cartoon bright happy energy and make this farm pay the bills all right so we got a 150 egg not gonna pay us anything oh look at these cool animations what happened there oh so we got, it looks like a three bag game. It looks like we're piling up different colored eggs. That's a cool dynamic. Ooh, bunch of different line wins there, but didn't give us too much money. Still up to $96 though. Nothing, no big losses yet. No big wins either, unfortunately. Okay, a couple line wins, animated chicken. I'm down, or rooster actually, I think that is. 100 going to the middle egg column, nice. Oh, king line win. All right. Nothing on that. Hope those cow that cow looks way too chill. I hope we get at least one entire row of those cows just to see their animation as they light up. Okay. All right. Piling up the eggs, getting bigger and bigger. I wonder what happens at the end. Do you think they all hatch or the eggs just crack or it just jumps off the eggs and we go into a bonus game? Oh, I bet this I really would like to see a bonus game on this machine. Oh, whoa, 200 2,500 credits on that. Oh my gosh. Line wins. Line wins, line wins. There is a lot of ways to win on this machine. Interesting. Okay, 75. That helps us a little. Nothing on that spin. Nothing on that spin. Oh, you look over there in the corner. 50 lines on this game. No wonder there are so many line wins. That's, that's a lot. There we go. Once again, get the queens. Moving up in different directions. Multiples. Ooh, I like that uh, wheelbarrow full of flowers, of farm, farm flowers, farm fresh flowers, I guess. Chicken coop up there. It's a cool icon. Uh, all right. Not, I don't think we really need the blue as much as some of the other ones. That one looks like it's still pretty far away from like popping or blowing over or whatever happens when you get the pile of eggs high enough. All right, couple oinky things. Oink, 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 oink. Four oinks. Okay. Uh, yeah, the wheelbarrow. That's not bad. Oh, somehow I feel like that one was going to be something big. All right, 200 for the egg for yellow egg. Uh, but it didn't pop up. 200 for blue egg. That one's good. What's this say? Bird awards multipliers feature. Let's get one of those blue birds on the screen then. I am down to see what that, what that one gives us. Come on, egg. Jump up there and build up that pile. Oop, there we go. 250 on that one. Nice. Flower wheelbarrow is paying off. Yellow eggs are showing up. I'm still feeling the good energy from this machine. Ooh. Ooh. <gasps> What's going to happen? There we go. There we go. He's going to fall off. I know it. I knew something was going to happen. Wait, held up that little stick. I had an instinct. <gasps> now look what's going on. What are we in the farm? The farm door? The barn door? Congratulations. You have won the jackpot feature. Press play to start. I will be happy to press play to start. And here we go. Okay, the grand pumpkin is something 
Looks like we have 250 credits floating over here. A couple 200 more credits. Ooh, the mini. I'll take... Dude, I would love if that thing paid off. Well, actually, sorry, the mini's not as big. Not that big. But anyways, uh, we got another couple... 250, 250, 200. Let's keep building these up. Nope. Bunch of... Bunch of faded out ones. Got more eggs over there. Come on, let's get more eggs on this spin. C eight collected, 15 to win the grand jackpot. So our goal here is 15 in two spins. Probably unlikely, but what if, what if, what if? One spin remaining. All right, we still got enough to get some wins. We got a ha like, happy bird over there. The major, who? The elusive major, never had one of those. The mini. Mini, ten dollars. I'll take it. Press play to spin. Okay, gotcha. Count it up, man. We got a couple bucks there, a few bucks there, a couple bucks there. Thirty dollars. That's great. Throw that on top of my seventy-three, and we're pretty close to getting back to where we started. That means pretty much free slot play, or like very minimal losses today, which is, in a sense, a lucky day too. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Killing it. Thanks, bird. You look a little confused with the way your eyes are moving there, but whatever. Oh, okay. That was an abrupt ending. All right. Back to reality. That was fun. Glad we got to experience one of those bonus games. What'd you guys think? Let me know in the comments below your thoughts on the bonus game for Crazy Chickens, if you liked it. As much as I did, I'm, you know, obviously I like the Goldfish game. I like the cartoony games. I like Planet Moolah. Um, these, these are the kind I, I gravitate towards. So I guess I'm just a big kid at heart or whatever. The machines seem a little more Disney-like, I guess. But I like this one a lot. Plus, I never go to farms anymore. I like, I definitely have a craving to, for like farm life, countryside. I could use more of that. I've been listening to country music recently and just like imagining like driving my truck out on some like muddy road and stuff, but oh, that would be nice. Feeling the farm country. Some chickens, cock a doodle doo. Although I don't need those roosters waking me up at the crack of dawn. That is not, that is not how my bedtime rolls. I am a get up, not super late, but like 9 a.m. kind of person. Oh, let's see, is that gonna, of course, that's the smallest pile of them all. It's probably not gonna do much. Um, blue, okay, second biggest pile, I'm down. But really, we need the one on the left there. Oh, look at all these line wins, piggy pigs everywhere. It is bacon time. Oh my gosh, by the way, it's hard to think about eating bacon because pigs are way smarter than people give them credit for. $3.40, thank you pigs. I recognize your higher level intelligence and I appreciate you for it. Um, a couple line wins there. Sometimes I think about the psychology of animals, so I think to myself, like, I wonder what it's like to be a pig, or a rooster, or a mouse. But then sometimes I try not to think like that too hard, because I'll get kind of upset, so I don't do it all the time. Alright, back to the game. Sorry, I went off kind of on an existential tangent there. We're back, $87.44. Let's see if we can get to another bonus game. I would love to see that happen. Um, nope, nothing on that run. Nothing on that one. Ooh, 100, can we build up maybe to a bonus game? Blue pile's not bad. Ooh, lots of, ooh, lots of jacks on that screen. How did that not turn into a couple line wins? No, nothing. And... What do you think? You think this game should be called Old McDonald? That's really the vibe I'm getting from it. How... Let me know. I don't know uh, if any of you played Farmville back when that was really a hot thing, like a decade ago. But I, I didn't play it, but I had friends that did. I was very aware of how the game worked. I watched my friends play it and talked to them. And I listened to them while they talked about it all the time. So if you played Farmville, the social game on Facebook, I think even before Instagram was around, way before TikTok was around, did you enjoy it? Do you remember it? How big did your farm get? Were you fond of the farming, the digital farming lifestyle? 
That game was gigantic for a while. Hmm. Dude, the youngest generation will never know what it was like to have those pixelated radishes growing, maintenancing them. Pure pleasure. Pure pleasure. I'm um, down to $67.50. I will probably play this to 50 or so, and then I might cut it, but we'll see. There's plenty of money. $15 still to go before I'm going to call it, and... Let's see if we can get to another bonus game. Maybe win a grand jackpot. Take home the whole farm. I know, I know, it's a bad joke, but why not? Take, bring home the farm? Isn't that a saying, like bring home the farm? I don't know. Uh, okay, got some, some fun characters on the screen. More pigs, couple line wins, lots of those cows. Oh, I remember, I Betsy the cow. I wanted to see a lot more of her. I was hoping to get an entire row of Betsy's. I would love to see that line win. See if something exciting happened. Maybe fill up a screen with like eight of them or something. Sorry, I don't know why I thought that might be a thing, but it wasn't, obviously. Uh, oh, there we go. There's all the... Oh, six Betsy's. That doesn't give me anything. Six Betsy the cows. This game is way more about lining up the symbols in a row in a line than it is about like how many show up on screen. You know, like, you know, some games are kind of like, boo, you got five on the screen at the same time, boom. And then others are more just like, are they in a row? That's all that matters. This is one of those row games, but I guess with 50 win lines, that's the see, mm -hmm, there you go. Perfect example. Uh, one last spin, I think, uh, one, one and a half more. Okay, I'm out. Hour of the Phoenix today. I'm getting Grand Phoenix energy. I'm ready to get $14,914 as a grand jackpot. That's what I'm ready to do. Let's throw this cashola in the machine. Make the Phoenix rise from the ashes. Oh, it is a good day in Las Vegas. I don't know why, but the sun is just shining and the money feels like well worth putting in. I'm here like earlier than usual today too, so that's kind of nice. Like it's earlier in the afternoon, feel like I can accomplish a lot more, more time for winning. That is awesome. Plus they're gearing up for the Super Bowl around here. That traffic slowed me down just a little bit. I'm at the new Durango Casino, which is beautiful by the way. If you come to Vegas, God, if you stay on the strip, you're probably not gonna even think to go to Durango, but if you're a local, you'll know it's like the big new Summerlin thing. Uh, nice, we got a bunch of little fans there, that's sweet. But if you do make it here, you should give it a try. It's like one of the few slot floors that has like a nice big window over there, like uh, actual sun coming in. Really nice. Food court is not bad, but it's a little overhyped. But it's not bad, but overhyped. Wait, we're in a jackpot feature. I gotta pay attention. Why do I not pay attention? Okay. There. Um, pick that one and that one. Ooh, maybe we'll get a little match poo on that. And maybe a little super duper match over there. Mm, maybe that one. Bottom right. We'll, we'll treat it like Connect Four. Tic Tac Toe. I don't know. No! Oh, mini bonus. $10. I'm down. Throw those coins up in the air, everybody. Hit that comment. Hit that like button out of excitement. We got coins flying onto the screen. Although it's only $10, and I know a lot of you have been saying in the comments, like, bet more. Look, you were all here at one point with me where you didn't want to spend a lot of money. You wanted to get a lot of a lot of slot play time in. That's where I am, okay? And that $10 feels great because I'm at $103, $102.40. $101.52. Oh, it's going so fast. Oh, wait, wait. Wait. Look at how many of those painty scroll things we've got on screen. Three, six, nine, twelve, thirteen of fifteen symbols all showed up. Mad scrolls. That's what I'm talking about. One hundred plus coming in at me. What is going on? Oh, loving it. Keep that money coming in. Let's go. Keep rolling. $121.77. Nice. The Phoenix doesn't even need to rise from the ashes. It never went into the ashes in the first place. It just flew high and then just even flew higher. And that's 
how the Phoenix actually likes to roll. It's a misnomer, the whole Ashes thing. Okay, okay. $118. Couldn't be more happy. Couldn't be more sunny. Sunny in Las Vegas. Uh, but yeah, I was going to talk about the Super Bowl because that's all anybody around here is talking about right now. They uh, had the guy from the UFC like over at the stadium announcing how exciting the pre-village uh, tailgate party that starts an entire week in advance advances. And it was cool. Like... The Super Bowl here is going to be great. We have the hotel capacity for it. We got our new stadium. Uh, if we only had a team good enough to play in it, it would be perfect. But this is definitely going to be great for Las Vegas. After F1, it's fun seeing sport. This is a sports town. It's becoming a sports town. Look at that line win. That whole bottom row covered and copied. Cha-ching. $110.14. Oh, bats. Filling her up. Let's see if we can get that thing to spill over. We'll see what happens. Ooh, look at that persistent 18. That other 18 going up there, filling that thing up. Is locked for two spins? Oh, oh, cool. That's why that's persistent. Gotcha. I'll take a couple spins on the bats. Put those golden bats in that pot. Let it flow over and let's fill her up. Oh, we did actually. Holy crap. Featured, triggered, the Phoenix. We filled up the bowl with gold, and now we have featured, triggered, Phoenix. Take me into my bonus game. Take me into my special feature. Let's count up all of these little monies. Uh, but we do the um, up, up, you'd say, I guess, top up feature. Oh, here we go. So we get, is any of those things win for a fortune check? Like, I got you. So we have multiple spins down here, working through our spins. We'll keep the persistent coins on there. Make them all pile up. What do we got there? 92, 130, 190K. That's a couple bucks, but more free spins to go. And we are still in the leads. Let's see, collect eight. Oh my gosh, they are piling up over there. Come on. Let's get some good luck in here. Nothing. Oh, there's not enough numbers on them, but they're gonna. Oh, they're gonna pull in from all the others. I got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Yes. Ooh, that's gonna be great. Look at that. So you got two, four, six, eight, plus a bunch of others. So yeah, we're looking at about ten dollars at a minimum right now for the win, which will be great. That'll put us at one twenty at a minimum. But yes, suck them all up. Dude, I love the way that works. Like when you get a blank one and it pulls from all the others, especially because there's so many on screen right now. Come on, let's get another blank one. Blank and pull, blank and pull. Give me a blank, and then pull in those numbers. Okay, so 320 plus, all of these guys should drop in. We should be at like 15, maybe even 20 by the time we're done. Maybe not 20, but 15. Yep, $15, eight cents. Pile it on. That's gonna bring me up to about $125 Renos. That is more than I started with. That is a great day here at the Durango Casino. I told you it was this afternoon energy. It was this good luck. I knew it was going to be good. Ah, oh, love it. Love it, love it, love it. All right, let's keep those, keep those spins going. We got a screen full of queens. What else? We got some phoenixes over there lining up in that column, but we need an entire row. We need a line win to kick in. Mm, aces all over the screen, loving that. Yeah, hey man, look, we know that thing can burst open, so let's keep filling up that that uh, bowl. That whoa, yeah, those bats are flying in there. Let's do it. Dun -dun 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 wow, that was a lot. 88 and 18, 30. Yeah, yeah, you guys flying in. 120 dollars. We're playing with house money. That phoenix, like, I'm not exactly a bird person. I mean, I'm not saying I don't like birds, but I'm just saying, like, when it comes to pets I plan to own, it's pretty much only dog with a maybe on a cat. I'm not going to own a pig. I'm not going to own a bird. But that phoenix, that phoenix, maybe. If I had that bird, well, of course, or, like, the golden goose, that I'd probably own that one, too. But you know how the curse goes, so maybe I'd have to be careful with that. Don't want everything I touch to be gold. 
But that golden phoenix just looks so cool, especially just sitting there. And so I need a really elegant birdcage, one that looks like an old Victorian mansion or something. Like a tiny little birdcage version of a Victorian mansion. You know what I mean. I'm just saying that phoenix just looks sick. I feel like that phoenix and that American eagle that represents America would be like... Ooh, would they be enemies or friends? No, I feel like they're teammates. The American Eagle knows what it's like to be down, fall over, but still, dust yourself up, get back up again. That's the metaphor for the Phoenix. So the Phoenix and the American Eagle, I suspect would be friends. All right, I am uh, thinking if I get down to 100 bucks, might want to call it for this video. I'm definitely gonna film more than one today. This is too beautiful of a day at Durango not to, but I say it's about time to switch machines if we get down to 100. That little boost helped, but will that give us a real win, or is this our last spin? It's probably our last spin. Leave a comment below if you enjoyed this video. Let me know how you feel about birds, the phoenix, etc. See you in the next video. All right, my curious friends, let's get curious about diamond hunting. We are at the diamond hunting machine, which is going to be quite the experience. I love throwing money into the diamond hunt because you never know what you're going to find. This machine is all about how many diamonds you can get to show up on screen at the same time. There's also some orbs. And if we're lucky enough to get three of those to show up, we can go into a bonus. But And then there's also these uh, these kind of like almost like Pokemon looking cards or like character cards. If we can get multiple of those to show up at the same time, that also, uh, not a bonus game, but that can have some big payoffs. Like that girl on the left over there. If we get her full form in multiple reels, then like, ooh, that's nice too. And of course we got those, like those jacks right there. We got our line win potential. So lots of stuff, but hunting for the diamonds. Is, see, there's one of the orbs on the first reel. We would need to get three of those. Then we would have some good stuff going on. Um, there's a diamond, bottom right. We need many of those to show up on screen. Let's keep on hunting. Every button press is a, ooh, look at that. Right away, five diamonds we have just uncovered. Ooh, I already feel like my arm is tired from throwing that pickaxe against the wall, just chopping those things out of the rock. That is a nice diamond finding. Four more over there on the left. Let's keep the diamonds flowing. Diamonds, they say they're a girl's best friend. Diamonds are forever. Do you guys know about the De Beers marketing thing? Like, there's actually enough diamonds, from what I understand, that if they flooded the market, they would be, like, not worth... Ooh, we have, ooh, I almost thought we had three orbs there. That they wouldn't even be worth that much. It's like there's one company that owns all the diamonds, and they artificially... Wait, what is going on? Four, five, six. Dude, 80 credits. Nice. Uh, yeah, I think you know what I'm talking about. But, like, basically, they have to kind of let them out carefully so that it doesn't get overloaded which is so corrupt if you think about it diamonds are so artificially propped up and that whole thing about like buying a diamond ring for wedding like don't get me wrong i'm gonna i'm definitely gonna get a diamond ring but still like that's marketing that got into the american culture and they they manufactured that everything's fake everyone but that doesn't take away from the beauty and the power that is a diamond hardest substance on earth all of those atoms lined up perfect. Ooh, two orbs, almost got, almost got a nice bonus screen there. We one more, but those perfectly lined up atoms, that's what makes diamonds so hard. Diamond tipped, you know, drills. And stuff. Whoa, look at that. Four, eight, 10. Could we even get more? Oh my gosh, 10 diamonds? What's that gonna get us? Oh my gosh, there we go, $2, $3. Four dollars. Ooh, nice. Ten dollar bonus. Yeah, we are. We have found. We found a store of diamonds. Diamonds are around here. We can smell them. Let's keep on chopping those things out. Oh, wow. I wonder if we're gonna beat that by the time we run out of money. That'll be crazy. We're still pretty much back at a hundred. Two bonuses. Can we get another one of those orbs, please? Three. Uh, almost got our lady to line up there. I'm really liking these maps of the universe or the solar system. Like, that's a cool, that's a cool uh, symbol for the real. I don't really get the theme, like why that's on this diamond one or whatever. Oh, maybe diamonds are made in space? Is that true? Or are they, I mean, it takes a lot of pressure to make a diamond. Wait, what happened? 
Bonus triggered. Look, we got three of those orbs on screen. Oh, let's do this. They're not orbs. They're radars, actually, now that I look closer at them. Oh, now we're going into space. Now it all makes sense. We're taking the diamonds into space in that cool helicopter spaceshipy thing. There we go. More diamonds coming in. Bins. Let's see what we can get out of these freebies. Ooh, diamonds are spinning on her hand. I like it. Dude, maybe we'll get a bonus in a bonus, get even more free spins. That could be a possibility. Uh, a couple line wins there. Does that help us much? Not too much, but still, it's something. Diamond, diamond. Oh, we got a full lineup of the lady friend there. Oh, and a couple diamonds. Ooh, there we go. Nice row there. We got six on screen, everyone. Stack those up. $3.80. I'll take it. Oh, there we go. Five right off the... Ooh, could have had so many more, but we just got one more real full of them. That would have been great. Eight. Oh, three. I'll take it. How many more spins? One spin left. Okay, let's do it. Our last free spin. Can we get a multiplier with some diamonds? All right. Not insane, but that put us back above $100, so that was fun. We got to see a cool bonus game. We got the excitement going into space. Ooh. Ooh, we just had two of our lady friends line up. If we would have had three, that would have really been something. That's unusual. Having three, though, is super unusual, and you get paid a lot for that one. Um, our little radar orbs, they they seem to be around. We might get more of those. Ooh, seven, eight, dude. Wish I would have got that during the bonus. But eight is still going to pay us something. Let's see how much this turns into. A couple bucks. Nice. Eight diamonds, two dollars. I'm down. Hmm. Come on, bonus radars. Let's get some more robot. Oh, whoa, there is three. Here we go. Oh, my gosh. I, I haven't even recovered from the last bonus. Okay, 10 free spins. Let's see. Dude, we're at $99. We have not really even spent a dollar from where we started. And we're back in the 10 free spin bonus. Diamonds right there, right off the bat. I'll take that. Seven diamonds on our first spin. We still have nine to go. Perfect lady lining up, and one diamond. Oh, that counts? Oh, that counts as four diamonds. All right, so that's a fiver. I guess the lady is also diamonds, too, when she lines up. Oh, okay, so we have more ways to win than I even thought. Nice. So there's three diamonds, assuming that lady's the diamond. Um, ooh, nice. Nine, there we go. Ooh, that's right up to $10. We still have four spins left. Yep, there she is. More, oh, I wish some diamonds to go along with her would have been great. Mm, nothing there. Two more spins. There's six. That'll give us something. Get up to $11.30 there. Uh, six more. That'll throw a couple more bucks onto our total. All right. Hey, look, we're above $100. There is nothing to complain about. And you have seven more diamonds for our final spin. Awesome. Here we are. $13.30. Add that cash stack, and we are at $112. That, ladies and gentlemen, is luck in action. That is good luck and good fortune coming from Space Diamonds right down into this machine. $111, and I've been playing for like 10 minutes or whatever. This is great. I appreciate that lucky lady there. I appreciate that cool scroll map of the universe. Look, maybe more diamonds, some more bonus orb radar target things whatever we want to call those ah dude awesome got some jacks rolling in what's your favorite planet after earth yeah. write that in the comment below i would be curious if most people are going to say mars you know the whole pluto thing i know a lot of people have the pluto thing where they're like you know it used to be a planet not anymore but it was my favorite but you know that just happens or if you're a jupiter if you're a gas giant kind of wait i mean oh yeah i got some diamonds there if you're a gas giant kind of person you know you're all about jupiter if you're into rings then you're obviously a saturn person if you're into europa which is one of the moons that might have habitable life then you're more of like a sciencey biologist guy so i can learn a lot about people depending on what planet they put in the comment below. So uh, obviously I don't have that many subscribers yet, so I'm happy to conversate with you down there if you want to throw something in the comments. But if not, no problem. I just appreciate you. Be oh, oh, two bonus, ooh, two bonus orbs. 
we almost had two bonus radar orbs in the first two reels. What if we would have got a third? We would have been right back into that bonus game. Four diamonds showing up on the second reel. Loving that. Oh, we got a full lady on the first. Remember, if we get three of those, we go into a very special. Ooh, diamonds. Diamonds are, are forever on that reel. Bonus uh, orb. Nothing coming from that. Ooh, six diamonds. That's a little bit of a win. A couple bucks. Is that what that adds up to? 80 cents. All right. It's twice what we're, what we're spending on the bet. Mm, diamond just rolling right down the middle there. They're coming. They're coming in groups. That might be good, good luck. But... Because we got so much out of this, if we get down to 100, I'm probably going to call it. <clears throat> Let's see. Yeah, you know what? We've had our good luck. We we ventured around the solar system. I think I'm going to call it for now. See you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye. What's going on, my curious friend? Today, I have brought us to the Grand Tiger. We are playing the, hope I say it right, Kinji Bao. Chi, I think that's how you say XI. I don't know. One hundred dollarinos is what we're gonna be feeding this tiger today. If it wants to accept, which it does, time to eat up, tiger. We are ready to play. We're gonna keep it, you know, low roll in. Well, I'm still under a thousand subscribers. If you wouldn't mind hitting subscribe, help me get to that one thousand subscriber mark. That's my next goal. All right. Off to the races. Nothing on that spin. Let's give it another try here. Oh, yeah, we got our bats flying in. Let's see if we can get it to spill over. I'm ready for it to spill over. Ooh, Tiger Grand, very, very authoritative right there. I am, a, ooh, nice. Not quite above 100, but still, I'm always happy with some gains. We'll keep that going. All right, what else we got? Let's get some tigers up in here. How have you guys been? Uh, I filmed a couple of videos ahead, took a couple of days off, and now I'm back. So I'm just gonna feel out the groove right now. <clears throat> uh, I came to Durango, if you guys have been here in uh, Las Vegas. It is one of the nicest hotels, actually, and it's off strip, but it's super beautiful. Oh, uh, ooh, almost on that one. And going in. Um, but yeah, like I recommend it not not because you're gonna be like wow This is the greatest experience ever or like some crazy fancy hotel, but it's just a nice off-strip hotel It's one of the only slot floors where you can see the sunlight Oh Wow six or more of our golden bats and we would have gotten to a feature Not quite six, but three definitely gives us a little bit of energy a little bit of excitement to go off of All right, yo, there we go. Yeah, it's see that thing pot man Single pop, single pop, pop. Oh, almost. Oh, yeah, because those act as wild. So we got plenty of our other golden icons. Cool. $95. Mm, couple chances there to pop. Oh, my gosh. I don't know if you guys saw that video on Mama VLR channel, but it did not pop the fish game. We were playing goldfish, and it was grueling we went hundred after hundred after hundred and uh, it didn't pop and VLR Ma was like we're done and then she was like we're not done because after we were done and turned the camera off because it ran out of power she started playing again and I was like oh my gosh all right let's see if we can you know you know it's about to pop if you've been playing it that long and then she played it off and boom three hundred dollars but Man, did we have to wait for that one. We waited and waited and waited. It was painful, but good persistence from VLR Ma on that one. All right, 90. Yeah, $93. Okay, so we're getting like some little wins here. Let's get our golden bats to drop into that machine. Yeah, I'll take that. 38, 18, and 8. Thank you very much. Pop, pop. All right, let's in on that one. I don't know if you guys watch VLR Mom, but I'm starting to get to know a Roxy better, and she is so wonderful. Like, cutest, happiest grandma you could ever hope for. Daniel is very lucky to have her as a mom, and it is really fun playing with her. She's super sharp, too. Like, she can just sense the machine and, like, interact with us when we're chatting with her. Like, she's a veteran, man. I love it. 
Okay, drop it in there. Uh, it would be fun. Dude, there's so many, like, famous slot channels that would be fun to, like, get to know better. You know, through the Don't Sweat It podcast, I've got a chance to interview uh, Vegas Matt, who was amazing. That's how I first met Daniel. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's being persistent. Let's keep dropping some money in there. Nothing. Keep going. Oh, oh, I love when I get those persistent plays. Um, I was learning about advantage players, too, and how they can sometimes, like, see machines where people didn't realize that there was persistence on screen. That is something I did not understand when I start, first started playing slots, so that's really exciting, too, just to have kind of a, a sense for how some of these slot machines work. It's getting more and more fascinating as I learn more. Ooh, lots of tigers. Would have loved to see nice line win on that. Come on, persistence. Let's go. Can you drop some more coins in there, please? Nope, nothing on that. All right, there it goes. Going into super mode. That's like super seance. Drop that in. And didn't spill over, but that's all right. We have flags in all directions. Oh, yeah. So the, the gold, if we got six of those... Uh, what do you call those? Like coins with the character on them. Then we go into the trigger, the feature, which is exactly what we're hoping for right now. We would love to see that feature kick in. That would be so exciting. All right, dropping in our coins, dropping them in to our bowl. Ah, tigers everywhere. Flags everywhere. Well, there's two of them. Can we get a third? That would have been so cool to have six of those hit on the screen. All right, lots of drums, though. That's going to give us a little bit of extra moolah. Back to $72.75. I appreciate, uh, appreciate that. You know, the other funny thing about filming with um, my Vegas Low Roller Mom and uh, with Daniel was just I'm so used to playing the pennies that when I think about credits, I just think about cents. You know, so I'm like, oh, $3.50 because I just won 350 credits. And then when they started playing with two and five cents, I didn't. I would be like, "Oh, cool! We just won like fifty bucks." They'd be like, "No, we won like a hundred bucks because you forgot it's two cent denoms." I'm like, "Whoa!" I just don't have the oh, wait, no, nothing. Yeah, I do two of them in the first row got me kind of excited. Uh, but yeah, but I was like, "Wow, it's crazy how the two denoms, like two cent denoms, can like really amp your bets up." I mean, of course, Vegas Matt knows that, and those guys that do the crazy. Like $75 per spin, $150 per spin. Like, oh, that is just, I couldn't even imagine. I mean, maybe if I had a channel that big, I could imagine it, but wow, I'm pushing the limits on that for sure. Uh, all right, come on, Tiger. Let's get cat like and sly. You guys looked at uh, cat videos on YouTube? Oh, well, actually, hold on. Before I get into my cat video thing, is this gonna pay off in a big way all right maybe nope uh, oh sorry yeah look at that we got the wild plus all the shields cool we got something on that all right not, not bad we got a little something something not a ton but a little something something um oh no i lost my train of thought what was i just about to ask you about oh another line win well that's gone I was gonna, if you, if you want to rewind the video, you can tell me what I was gonna ask you to make a comment in below. But now I got queens all over the screen. Oh, too much ADD. I got too much. It's just getting me coins in. All right, what's next, Tiger? What do you got for me? You got some flags. We got some tigers. I should have acknowledged that that screen full of queens before. That thing was solid. All right, nothing on tigers, nothing on queens. Oh, we got a couple in the end there on that last row. That would have been nice. And nothing on that one. Ooh, two right off the bat. We get the six. We're going into bonus feature. Lots of tigers there. Happy about seeing those guys on screen. Um, what else do we have here? No, no line wins on that. All right, I feel like the luck of the tiger has given me all that it has. <laughs> All right, hit subscribe if you uh... get ready to play the ultimate Firelink Cash Falls. 
Look at how fun this machine is built. We have reels of different sizes. We have over $10,000 potential for the Megabet, the ultimate fire link cash falls with this big spinning LED thing above it. I have been looking at this machine for a while now and today is the day. You, you can't play this machine with a weak heart. You have to come in here with a lot of energy. You have to come in here ready to fight. We are gonna be very aggressive today. We are putting in our $100 with confidence and we are going to make this ultimate fire cash link fall to our will. All right, I'm ready. Game face on. $100 in, 75 cent bets. Boom. Take a deep breath, collect yourself, focus. Nothing there. All right, fire link, let's get this going. We have so many reels here. Look at how much money is there for potentially being sucked down into those gold bags. The way this works is these fireballs stick around for three wagers, and if you can fill up the entire reel of them, they all fall down into your bag. So we are really looking to get that one on the right full. If we can get one more fireball in there, that whole stack is gonna fall down. And you can see that there's three, four, five, six, seven, there's like $10 there ready to like drop into that bag. But we have to get it on this spinner. We're gonna lose the ones that were there before, so they're all gone now, dang. Dang, that one was close. That was the big reel too. Oh, that was so close. I can't believe that didn't click. It's all right. Now we have a lot of potential here on this reel. Let's get, let's get the waterfall effect to happen here. I want that fire. I guess you call them a firefall, fire cash fall, whatever. Um, we got potential here on the left too. We just need one of those fires to show up there. Ooh, fire link one looks extra special. Is that gonna bring us into a bonus game if that one falls? Oh. Get that fortune cookie out of there. Let those things drop in. Over on the left, we have our first waterfall feature. Boom, they all fell in, couple dollars. I'm down with that. But there is a lot of money to be made on this fourth reel. If we can get that to drop, we just did. Oh my God, that's it. Is that fire link counts, right? They're all flying in. Oh, they're going up here. What? Look at that fireball. This is awesome. Oh my God, flying fortune cookies in space. 14 more to unlock, two more to unlock. Yeah, let it run, man. Let's get these fireballs everywhere. Three spins remaining, let's go. Two spins remaining. Come on, fill up those fire, put fire everywhere. Fireballs everywhere. We just need them to line up, keep going, go through there. Oh, come on. Three spins remaining, two spins remaining. One spin remaining. Maybe we maybe we don't need the waterfall effect in this feature. Let's see if it all just works. Come on, let's go. Fill that up. Let's see that screen. I see the mini up there. But what I would like to see is a couple majors show up. Maybe fill up an entire reel with, with majors. That would be amazing. That's too much to ask for. Let's just fill up the screen right now with some of these fireballs and see how much money we can total into this bonus feature. Oh, feature complete. Okay, so tallying me up. What's going on? Okay. Oh, I didn't even notice that one up in the top right is a $20 one. 44? 46? 47? Yeah, it's going to keep it. Dude, we're going to make $50 on this. Dude, this is as big as the miner. This is bigger than the miner. I don't even need the miner when we're going to win $53 on a bonus feature. Oh man, see, I told you if we came in here with our game face, we were gonna be leaving with money. Wow, big win. Whoa, this is cool. Look at that, diamonds, coins, flying in every direction. The pressure of the heat, the fireball of the sun can make diamond. That's what it takes. Now we've got diamonds and gold everywhere. Look at him dancing there, I'm loving that. Throw that money in the air, let it fall back down, total up those wins. $53, wow, so that brings our grand total to $145. Started with a single Benjamin, thank you, Firelink. That turned out amazing. Like, I was pretty disappointed in that reel on the right, but I am over it now. That win was spectacular. Ultimate Firelink Cashfall, one of my new favorite machines. This is the first time I played this machine, so I 
I'm excited. I'm not going to come back to it right away, but one day when I'm feeling challenged again, we're going to be back here. But for today, I'm going to play out some more of this money, where I'll at least play it down to $100. So let's keep going here. All right. More fireballs. More. You can't get enough fireballs on screen. And it looks like some of these free games are starting to, to add up here, but it's not enough to actually click into the feature. So they're off the screen now. Maybe we get some... I'd like to get a nice row of fortune cookies. That'd be cool. Maybe just because I really like fortune cookies and I'm hungry right now. But... Ooh, wow. Kind of delivered on that. Thank you for that. Four at the same time. Oh, we got a full row. Drop it in. Look at that. I see two two dollars there plus a bunch of 50s. Five dollars, 75 cents. Real number four is our lucky reel. And it pays off once again. Filling up that bag. Even more money for our already stacked winnings. Love it. All right. I'd love to see that. A couple of those minis pop in there. The fire link. Oh, I'm okay. Now I get it. So the fire that has mini on it is probably going to drop in and pay that out as it goes into the bag. So when earlier when we had that major, if that would have dropped all the way into the bag, that would have been all the money plus the major, I think. So that would have been exciting. But now we keep an eye out for it. Go. We got another row over here. Just a couple bucks, but still dollar twenty-five. I'll take it. Always fun to see that row clear out. Love that waterfall feature. It's a that's a fun that's a fun design for a slot machine. I'm really liking the waterfall feature. All right, let's see what we got. Uh, free game, but not enough to pay off. What are what is this little bento box or something? I don't know. Opened up for us. What is that? I have teapot, maybe tea tea leaves. I don't. Know. Ooh, like that turbo charge over there on the right reel. Even though it's only got one dollar sitting there, but whatever. Um, all right, what else do we got? Nothing paying out here. Let's try some more spins. And getting close. If we could just get two more fireballs in this third reel, that would be a great payoff. Hmm. Nothing yet. Keep trying. Okay, and... Oh, we lost that whole row in the middle there. No, no big deal. Maybe we'll just build them up again. We know what it's like to start from scratch, go all the way to a big win. Done it before in this video. Oh, that one is looking close to real number four again. That's our lucky one. Plus, it's got that free link to drop in. I would love to see two more fireballs show up right there on link number four. Ooh, what's happening over here? We're getting some isolation. No, we're going to run out of spins on that one. Dang it. They're gone. All gone. Oh, there's the two we needed before. Where were you on the last spin? That would have given me the whole row. Ooh, oh, it's not the whole row. There's the one at the top. Reel number three, please. Just this This is the one. We have to hope for that to show up. No, nothing. We have another potential on reel number four at the bottom. Can we just get one to drop in? Oh, we did. There it goes. Nice. Oh, that was one of the taller reels, too. Hey, $2.75. Bring that waterfall of money right down to my pot of gold and calculate that up. Thank you. Nice. Okay, we got a four over here, but that's a hard reel to fill. We need three more, two more now. Of course, that would be amazing if that pays off, but I'm not going to get too excited yet unless... Okay, no, don't get too excited yet. That's what you said you were going to do, but you didn't do that, Dylan. Stay focused. Don't get too excited, okay? They're gone anyways. Um, nothing. Ooh, looking pretty empty right now. I'm not seeing anything that looks like it's going to pay well. Free games aren't really adding up. Okay, reel number three looks like our best bet for now. Um, reel number four, what doing? doing me dirty? And there's nothing going on over there. Come on. All right, reel number three. It looks like our best bet. No, we lost that one, too. What are we down to? $113. It's fine. We're still up. This is still... We're playing with free money here. Came in with $100. we are still in the positives. Hmm. Maybe I will end it at $100, though. I have, I have seen crazier things happen before, but maybe we'll get another big win. Maybe we can get these things to line up. Let's try. Keep your fingers crossed for these last few spins. If not, I am going to be out. And here we go. Nothing. All right. 
Remember that game face mentality, Dylan. Go in there. Be tough. We are slot curious. We are warriors. We are curious warriors, and we are going. There we go. Boom. Got that. Got that reel. Drop that money in. Easy. Four bucks. Now we're gonna build on that. Mo See, you can tell this machine really responds when when I bring when I bring the 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 the, the heat or whatever, like the toughness, the confidence to beat it. It responds well to confident people. So we are gonna be confident players right now. In the comment below, write uh, something confident <laughs> to help to help us get another big win on this machine. Okay, look, we got potential here. Real number two. Fortune cookie, man. Get in the way. We need another fireball. No, lantern. Thanks for lighting it up, but it's not, not needed right now. Not a lot of fireballs either. I mean, the, the reason why this game is so well designed is it makes it hard to walk away because you know that once you have these fireballs on screen, they're going to stick around for the next three spins as long as you keep the same denomination, which is what we've been doing this whole game. So I keep wanting to leave, but honestly, like, then we're going to throw away these reels that have already, already been kind of positioned. <sighs> This one on the left, too. If we just clear that up, then maybe I'll just take that winning and then go. No, oh, so close. Fireballs. What do we need to do to get you to come back down? Drop those into the reels. I need some... Oh, there we go. Now we got a lot on screen. Maybe, maybe, just maybe we're going to get one big last win. Oh, reel number one's looking close. Only 50, $2.50. Cent. Oh, there we go. Got it to drop at least. I mean, only $1.50, but still. I like when those things drop. We're we down to $103. Okay. Just a couple more spins. This is it. Oh, look at how many just showed up. Of course you would do that to me. You sneaky little ultimate fire cash link falls. Look, we came. We won. We conquered. We played. Now we're done. If you're watching, comment below, hit that subscribe button. See you in the next video. All right, guys, get ready because if we get 15 footballs on screen, we win the grand jackpot here at the Super Bowl Link, the most hyped slot machine of the year. This potential machine could be giving us $10,000 for a grand prize. We need to fill up the screen with footballs. We need to pick our football team. And we need to go out onto the gridiron with our $100 bills and show exactly how tough our spirit is. We're going to be doing that right now. Slot machine time on the NFL slot machine. Can't wait. There is a ton of great football coming up this weekend, so I am stoked. There we go, right off the bat. Get some wilds in there. We're playing as the Tennessee Titans. This is Avalon's favorite uh, team. She's straight from Tennessee, so that is why we're playing it today. Oh, there we go. Now, my favorite team, which I'll play in the future, is the Las Vegas Raiders. I grew up in Utah, so I did not have a favorite football team. Sometimes I lean a little bit towards the Broncos, uh, sometimes some of the California teams, but realistically, now the Las Vegas Raiders are my home team. They're the first team that I've ever been passionate about, that I've ever rooted for at all times. So no bandwagon fan, I'm just, I'm just all Raiders nowadays. Oh, but the Tennessee Titans are showing up hard in today's game. $1.50. We are down to $94.34. Let's see if we can win some big money on this big NFL machine. Oh, check that out. We got some threes and some twos, but they're not going to drop for us. We got a whole column of wilds. Is that going to help us out? We got some kings that that makes. Nice. Uh, what do we got here? Some threes, some ones. We got the NFL logo coming up in a few different places. Oh, yeah, there we go. Three NFL logos. What's that going to win for us today? Uh, two bucks. Oh, we're going into a special feature. The Tennessee Titans are coming into their own. Five free games. More wild stacks. Let's go. Free games, one of five. I hope the Titans are going to take home the glory today. Nothing on that spin, but we got more to go. Three of six. Ooh. 
dude, I love the music on this. Nothing like the NFL horns, man. They're the best. Wilds and Super Bowl rings galore. A, a quick story, if you go to the pawn shop from Pawn Stars here in Vegas, you can buy a Super Bowl ring. No cap. All right, let's get back to it. I just couldn't believe when I went in there. I was like, some NFL player won the Super Bowl and sold their ring to you? I think it was 120 k or something. Like, obviously that's really expensive, but also that's crazy that if you're just rich, you can buy a Super Bowl ring and I guess rock that on your day to day. <laughs> All right, we got a bunch of Tennessee Titan logos showing up here. We are in a nice wind bump here. Six Titans logos. Tons of wilds, and those are matching up, looks like, for multiple line wins. Oh, there we go, $10. We're gonna be right up, actually, we're gonna be above the $100 mark, so we are making money on this slot machine today. $11.85, and we still have more free spins. Whoa, we're back up to nine? Wait, six of 10? Oh, extra spin. Nice. Seven of 10 spins have been used, but plenty more, plenty more. Hmm, what do we got here? Some Queens, Titans. Nice. Eight of ten. Anything else? What else do we have going on here? Dun, 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 dun. This is warrior music. I love it. There we go. Some more Super Bowl rings. Pile them on. I'll take a bucket full of those. Bucket full of Super Bowl rings. Imagine that. That's how you rock a million dollars. You let that thing hang off your neck. It'd be crazy. Extra spin. That's 12 we got now. 12 of 12, let's see if our last spin pays out. Hey, we got some money out of it. We are back up above 100. It might not be well above 100, but if we want to lead with a W, right now if the game ended, we would have that. But the game's not over, we're playing more. Let's do this. All right, keep on spinning there. Got some queens showing up. Let me know the last football game that you've been to in the comment section below. Uh, have you been to a Las Vegas Raiders game? If you ever came out to Vegas, why don't you see your home team when they're here? That's the funny thing about our stadium is half the time it's half of the other people because so many people travel to Vegas. So we almost never seem to have the home field advantage that most that most football stadiums do. But as we become the Super Bowl home this year, a lot more people will discover us. Maybe more people will move to Las Vegas. Maybe more people will follow the Raiders here and we will get bigger and bigger crowds all right there we go we got a whole column of wilds oh and there we go got that that helmet that helmet face on six in one spin that'll bring us down to ninety dollars but give us a one dollar boost what do we got coming up next oh got the, the what's the guitar doing in here that feels like the wrong symbol to be in this slot machine hey look at that wilds are paying off in three different shapes three different line wins Nice, got football helmets everywhere. Okay, that guitar, now I can't not see it. They need to get rid of that guitar. What is this, Taylor Swift or something? Maybe if it, maybe if it was the Chiefs, but definitely not for the Titans. This is too masculine of a team for that, that teenage guitar angst stuff. Ooh, there we go, Queens and Wilds. We'll take that extra couple bucks, maybe more, $2.03. We are down to $80.65. Come on, let's see if we can get up. Yeah, we got our, uh, well, we have our football helmet. What do I call that one? Like the straight, that there's a football helmet in the middle. And then I'll call that guy, like the guy, football helmet with a face in it, or a helmet on a, on a man, on a football player. <laughs> uh, I don't know, I need a better term for that one. All right, off to the races. I uh, got a couple footballs there with a two and a one. Nothing's gonna hit on that. Ooh, lots of Titans and Wilds playing out there. Super Bowl rings and helmets. Nice football combo. You guys uh, like offensive teams or defensive teams more? They say defense wins the Super Bowls, but you know, it's hard to compete when somebody just keeps putting points up on the board. Especially when they got the run game going on. I was watching uh, Packers a couple weeks ago, and I just felt like even if they weren't the better team, sometimes they would just have so much confidence just running it right down the middle, like seven or eight plays in a row, just like three or four yards every time, but keep getting the first downs. Like 
some reason I really like that kind of football where you, you can just tell the defense is like, oh, here comes the run, but he's still going to get five yards on me and then another five and then another five, and they're just tired. That's like tough football. But nothing nothing quite as exciting as one of those long bombs going down the down the field also. So I don't know. Or those side those crazy sideline catches that boom they fall out that like that one's crazy plus it's starting to be super bowl season right now and it's kind of fun it's really fun to watch those snow games like they only seem like they happen every couple like once every couple years or something but man when it's like a blizzard and i know people in the audience are just thinking like oh why don't we get a covered stadium and it's always better for like i guess tv to be able to like zoom into the football or whatever but i just think it's so fun watching people like out in the snow fighting for yards and like slipping and the like, run game is just crazy and you throw it and like the wind blows it and nobody can make a field goal it just it's exciting not a lot of sports are tough enough to play through that you know but football football we do it 40 cent win down to sixty dollars and 82 cents on this slot machine oh there oh i thought that'd be a little bit bigger we 75 cents on it still i'll take it $58.97. Uh, let me know your favorite. Let me know. I was going to play the Raiders probably the next time. But if you, if somebody, I don't even have that many followers yet. But if you are a sub and make a comment about what your favorite team is, first person to do it, I'll play that game next. Whatever team you want me to play, I'll play the NFL machine again. In fact, I want to play this one a lot. It's, it's one of my favorites. I mean, you know I like the cartoon ones, with Planet Moolah, Crazy Chickens, uh, what's the other chicken one? Yeah, uh, Hens or Rich Hens or something. Yeah, but anyways, we're going to be playing more football. I'm going to cut it at 50 just so I can save a little bit of money, play some more slot machines, come back soon. I'm glad we got a chance to play that bonus game together with those extra cash stacks. Gold, $10,000 grand jackpot, feeling the Mustang, feeling the Mustang spirit to the point where I'm willing to bet one penny. And if you knew how my day was going, if you saw the dragon video that I just uploaded, you'd know that it wasn't, wasn't going really good. So we're going to use the rest of that voucher, the rest of that money on this nice, relaxing experience into nature. The, the excitement of slot machines, the beauty of the Mustang spirit. I can feel it already. Let's go with those coins. Let's go with those Mustangs. Let's go with those wilds. I mean, what what else can you want from a slot machine? I'm, you know what? I might go up. Well, no, let's keep it in a penny for now. But I could see myself going up if this energy stays up. What is this? Win one. Oh, I knew I should have gone to two cent bets. Why? You know what? I feel that energy. I have to listen to it. That's what I have to remember. But I'm still not going. Now it's over. What if the energy is over now? So I don't know if I should. You know what I mean? Uh, three scorpions. That's a good thing in this case. Usually that's a really, really bad thing. All right, got some wilds. We got some tens. We got some Mustang spirit. Got the eagles and wolves. And I feel like I'm, I'm out in the country right now. Did you know that the word Mustang comes from a Spanish word that's, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna butcher this, but it's like mestigo, which means wild ironically we just got on the screen or or like but i mean like wild or straight but that's what mustang means like wild you know it's a wild spirit it's a wild energy when i see the word mustang spirit i think wild spirit there we go three four five of them on screen as we speak look at those mustangs so majestic so strong so hardy so ready to win today so ready to push through the downs for the big thrill, the big upside, which could be coming any spin now. And that's what keeps this so exciting. We have $64. Maybe we're going to walk away with a big win today. There's a win. There's a little win, but a win nonetheless. And that's keeping us in the game. So imagine if that keeps building. And then it's $10, and then it's $50, and then it's the grand jackpot. And then I... I Dare myself to bet more than one penny, which I'm probably not going to do, but maybe there's three wild. Why didn't three wilds do anything for me? I Because I guess they're all in a column, not in a row or something, not one of the line wilds, but whatever. There we go. Three aces. Thank you, wild. Thank you, ace with dice. Very pretty. Even more. Three sets of three. We got our jacks. Come on. Let's get some more Mustangs. Let's get some more coinage. 
Let's get some more wilds and birds and anything else you want to throw at me. Let me know in the comments below when you see and you think about a Mustang, nice win there, what does it symbolize to you? Like, does it, would you feel your, like, your independence, your freedom, your, like, wild stallion nature, you Mustang spirit fan, you? Ooh, I never noticed Mustang kind of smells like musty, which is not the same in any way. All right. Head in the game, Dylan. Let's stay curious. Are you guys slot curious? I'm slot curious. And we are getting curious about cactus. We're getting curious about scorpions, wild stallions, and coins. Let's do some more 50 cent bets. We have $56 to spend. We can go for a while with this kind of luck. So far, we're really staying strong. And Oh, there we go. Look at how many wilds on screen. I love when I see the queens line up like that. So exciting. Oh, that'd be, oh, that would have been great if we had one more queen on there. That's all right. What? Oh, dude, somebody next to me just got buffalo. But I'm not playing that game, so it doesn't matter to me. Oh, I am playing triple scorpion or triple wild, double scorpion, super line win. Again, that wolf is looking a little scary in the corner. I can get him off the screen. Three nines. And my coin. What else we got? More wilds, more tens. Nothing big there. Oh, so close. Can you imagine? There's a couple more of those. We would have had something there. We got some nice lines there. Maybe if I just keep pressing this button, we are going to tame the wild Mustang today. Come on, 500, nothing useful here. Okay, how about 150, even less useful, nothing. 250, but some more of those would be good. Give me another Mustang. Come on, baby, let's go. Can we get some, oh, eagles almost, but that doesn't matter. Come on, maybe, maybe this time. Coin, wild, wild, nothing. Stallion, wild, super dollar sign. Coin, wild, everywhere. Ooh, that's a nice one. Look at all those nines. That's lining up nicely. Dude, that mini game. That'd be sick if we went into that. I hope we get into the mini game. You know, I, that's another thing. I haven't had a bonus. I haven't had a mini game. I haven't had a jackpot for a while. What is going on? Like, what is going on with my luck? Oh, uh, nothing. Nothing actually totally wrong about that something something really good. That's right. The dollar sign is taking up the entire column Ooh, Okay, that was great. Didn't see that one coming Okay, we got a bear showing up haven't seen the bear for a while But maybe maybe the bear is gonna be the secret weapon we have huh? Maybe we can get four of those that'd be a great row to get uh, yeah, a lot of animals showing up. Oh, dude, these wilds, though, like, I have had some great luck with wilds. I gotta say, like, wild, 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 wild. Look at that, three more showing up in the corner. There's wilds everywhere. I am telling you, I'm the wild stallion is with us in spirit. The birds, the snakes, they're all here. Okay, let's see what we got. Let's keep on spinning, guys, down to 43. Nope, we are moving up. 80 cents, okay. Yeah, we're still 43, 66, not bad. I'm gonna stick with the 50 cent bets. A couple of wilds there. You know you've been kind to me, I'm into it. Definitely feeling feeling like we're going into a bonus game soon. I feel like we're going into something special. I think we're going a $10 win. Maybe with the help of wilds, maybe the bears come back. What do you guys think? Tell me if you think the bears do. Look at that one. Let's get that Mustang energy going. We need to get a couple wins in here. I'm feeling it. We got our gold coins. We've got more wilds, like always. There we go. It's a small win. I'll take it. The wild stallion is such a majestic creature. Hopefully, we can get some kind of majestic, you know, some kind of a majestic slot run, meaning everything is just beautiful. It's smooth. It's when you walk in and you see that machine on the slot floor. You go right to it, you sense that energy, you know it's just getting hotter and hotter on every spin. That is the kind of energy I'm trying to funnel into you right now, Mustang Spirit. Feel my energy, you feel it coming in, coming through into the slot. That, oh, there we go, up to a dollar, two, three, come on, three dollars, let's keep going, maybe three, twenty-five. All right, it's something, I feel that uh, that energy is starting to make a difference here, maybe we're getting hotter. I really like in the cactus symbols. I'm hoping we get a like a nice row of those that would make my day. But scorpions, scorpions and wilds are coming in. So maybe maybe instead of that majestic energy, I need a more intense uh, scorpion attack. 
I don't, you know, listen, here in Las Vegas, there really are scorpions around here. So I get a little uneasy when I, oh, nice, three queens. I'm liking that. But I get a little uneasy because I actually worry about them. Like, I've heard of friends of friends of friends, like, getting stung, actually. So if you're in Vegas, you know, stay, stay in the casinos, you're going to be safe. But be careful, especially if you go hiking up there in Red Rock or something. In fact, one time my girlfriend and I were doing a camping trip and we were just going for a walk and we were using a black light flashlight and they glow those scorpions and you see them like off the side of the path and it's freaky stuff man like no sandals around there i i think that things are gonna like jab me in the toe or something but all right anyways back to back to the machine like seems like our luck's not doing as good as it could be right now um those gold coins gonna help us no they're not gonna help us <gasps> what do we got winner mini bonus we've got a mini bonus what does this mean we've got definitely something happening here there's one dollar two dollars three dollars keep going looks like we have some dollar signs over in the right we got the mini going this could be exactly what i was looking for eight nine keep those wins coming Oh, what do you think? Should I should I write it out? Or is it getting hot? Or was that like the little boost that says, hey, time to go find a new machine. I don't want to take all your money. You seem like a good guy. You let me know in the comments below what I should do. I kind of know what I'm going to do, which is just probably move on. But let me just try a couple more. If we go down to 40 or 35, maybe then then I need to be done with this before I lose that. That was a nice win there. Okay, so getting a little quiet down to 40, but now we're back up again. Just only a little 60 cents. I'll take it. Okay, a couple more runs, maybe. I'm seeing my Mustang Spirit. You can only handle so much Mustang Spirit in one day. We had, we had some of it. I had enough of it for now. I need to let that settle. We'll be back to this machine. Hello, my curious friends. We are going to be playing Dancing Drums today at Sunset Station. I have played Dancing Drums once before. No, actually twice before. This will be my third experience on this machine. I liked one of them, didn't like the other. So we're going to split the difference with these $100 Renos and see if this machine generally falls in my good category or my bad category. So, Mr. Benjamin, if you want to go in there and sweet talk those drums, get in there, find some rhythm, we will put $100 in and we will see where this goes. Feeling the beats. All right, that's a little something, some jets there, get that straight. And off we go again. 10, 9, King. Boat. All right, let's fill that thing up. Maybe we'll get a spill over and a pop. Oh, that's actually. Oh, that's a bigger win than I expected. So we have four flowers plus two wilds, four bucks, taking me back to ninety nine ninety five. Ninety nine ninety five. That sounds like the price of something I would buy at Target. I'd be like, how much is this? What would be a hundred dollar item at Target? Mm, a patio chair. Ninety nine. 95. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> so, so zoned out there. $12. Thank you for all of those, uh, not coins, but those metal gongs or whatever. I'm at $1.09. Good, good jive in here. I was like really lost trying to imagine the layout of my local Target. That was weird. I uh, almost kind of went into a daydream there for a second. $107.64. More of our favorite little gigantic coin shields and gold things nice win so far yep go ahead hop on up there there's your little... so now i uh now i realize which one the wilds are and i'm gonna hope some more of those flowers show up that would be great jack wild and boats Ooh, almost enough on that maybe enough on screen to get a win but i guess not if I remember right, there's uh, it's like 240 ways to get line wins on this. And it's one of those, that, like everything's adjacent machine. So if um, I have, let's say, our little boat there, and there's one boat above it, or to the side of it, or I think even diagonal of it, then we might be looking at a winning combination, um, as long as it's going all the way from left to right. So uh, yeah, I guess we'll just see how this vibrant, Asian themes, symbols of drums, golden dragons, ships, coins, flowers, 
and uh, traditional card symbols, also known as pips, by the way, if you ever wondered about that. The, or actually, sorry. They're, all the card symbols are like one through 10, and then the pips are the four suits. That's, that's what you can call the four suits. Like a gaggle of something, how it's like a group, that's a pip. Like the pips are all like heart, diamond, spade, and whatever. So yeah, there you go. A little bit of information, hopefully true information, <laughs> partially remembered from my infallible brain, or from my fallible brain, so it could be a, a fallible, you know, bad information. Oh, all right, 50 cents on that one, down to $84.12. Today on the dancing drums, I am ready for another big win. We have $82. I think we can get a lot out of this. Making 88 cent bets will give us plenty of spins here, plenty of chances to hit something big. I would love to see those wilds keep piling up until that thing spills over. Oh, there we go. A lot of those, as Vegas Crazy would say, little gravy boats. One, two, three, four, five, six. That gives us 200 credits, a couple of bucks. And we have had good luck with our flowers before. I love our golden flowers. Beautiful theming on this machine. Maybe a little gaudy, depending on your style, but like, I definitely feel rich just playing it. That's probably, even though it probably takes my money. There we go, got some drums up on screen there. I'd love to see those start thumping away. No more drum, we, we haven't, we, it's, drums have been really scarce though this game. I mean, there's one in the second reel, but like not, to the point where I would expect the game to be called Dancing Drums. Mm, 25 cents, recovering a little bit of that 88 cent bet there. There we go, plenty of gravy boats, 72, 78. Yeah, our flowers are paying off again with that wild. All right, making a little bit of money on that spin. Keeping us going, little bonus there, staying alive. Nothing on that one. So I was uh, talking to this guy who works for a slot machine company, one of uh, Dan's friends a couple days ago. And he, ooh, oh, oh, look at how many, seven, nine, those flowers are showing up, $3.60. Uh, but yeah, he, he knows like slot machines in other countries and he was saying that in Germany, wow, I gotta keep, I gotta keep talking about this guy. Every time I try to go into my story, it's like cha-ching. Wow, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, gave me 12 bucks? Yeah, those things have shown up before. Dude, we are in this. We are we are not grinding down. We are getting nice little jumps here. Uh, $82, wow, that's good to be back there. Uh, anyways, before I lose my train of thought, this guy said that the machines in Germany, play. they pay very, they pay like out bigger and they have more multipliers but they have way less of those half wins like where we just get little line wins that are like half our bet quarter of our bet i guess people in germany don't like that as much they're a little bit more just like nah I lose all of it on every spin but then when i win i win bigger uh but i guess here in the united states we kind of like to just be like like here's a little win keep on playing here's a little win, keep on playing and over there they're just kind of more about like grinding through it so i thought that was interesting i assumed these machines were kind of all I don't know, like preset the same, but there is definitely differences in different geographies. So I guess be aware of that, or I don't know, it's something fun we can learn about. Let me know in the comments below if you know anything else about the geographies. I think I think I kind of knew that they changed them based on the ones that are like here in Vegas on the strip, and then the ones that are like I'm at Sunset Station, which is off strip, and like places where the locals go a little bit more are a little bit more like chill you know but if you're just like playing straight up like win machine facing the strip then like oof. Oof. i don't even know if it's just that the odds are lower or that you're actually gonna have like more volatility too and just like lots of losses and then one big win i don't know but hey there we go flowers have shown up once again for us to put three dollars back in our coffers 72 dollars 45 cents i'm liking it i'm you know, this machine, even if I don't, even if I walk away with like 50 bucks or something, I'm still gonna, I'm still gonna like this machine. Dancing Drums is, it's not like my favorite, but I feel warmly about it. I think I will come play it 
once in a while when I'm kind of just feeling like, oh, I want something sort of familiar and fun and easy. Nice! Our boat's showing up in real one and two. Again, showing up in one and two. I know it's not a pirate ship. That must just be like a cargo ship because of how big the sails are. It looks like a classic. Well, maybe... Ooh, kind of, I mean, it's definitely more Asian themed, but it kind of looks like a Viking boat. And I, you know, I think you got... The, I, I mean, I go off on my, like, I'm a Viking tangent sometimes, but my ancestors were Vikings, so, you know, I feel like I'm very much ready for the ocean. Also, the name Dylan means son of the sea in Welch. So my name literally means that I'm born of the sea. Like, my mother and father are the sea. You know, according to my name. My mother and father are just humans. But in my name, Dylan, D-Y-L-A-N, the Welch version, that's what it means. Son of the sea. By the way, it doesn't bother me at all, but some of you guys, when you say good job, Dylan, which I super appreciate, by the way, I love that you spell it D-I-L-L-O-N, which I don't care. But, like, it is D-Y-L-A-N. Just so you know. I don't want you to be embarrassed, not that I care. I'm thankful for any comments that I get, any conversations that I have. If you guys recommend any machines I should play, especially knowing my Viking my Viking ancestry, let me know. I have never seen a Viking machine, that would be amazing. Is there like a Nordic one or something with Thor? I have been thinking about growing out my hair to look more like Thor, but I don't really have those kind of muscles, so that's uh, not gonna really be the same look, even if I have long hair. Look at our gravy boats and our little shiny thing showing up at the end here. I think I'm going to be happy with this video if we just play it down to $50 and then I'm going to go find another machine so we can do another video tomorrow for you guys. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so. I would super appreciate that. I would love to build this channel up so I can like make a living doing slot machines. That would be such a fun life. That's the goal. Thank you very much. See you soon. They say that fortune favors the bold, so today we are playing Fortune Bags, Dragon's Law. How cool would that be to hit the grand $8,727? Oh, we haven't ever hit one on a video before. I've never hit one personally in my life. That would be so exciting. So we'll start with this magic $100 bill and see what we can get out of it today. How has your week been? Let me know in the comments below. Let me know if you think there's any other machines you'd like me to play. If you feel like you've got something that you know would be like the one of ones to hit that jackpot. I would, I would love to hit the major one day. In fact, we should take a bet. Like how many videos will it take before I, I finally hit that? I'm going to guess like... Gosh, maybe even, maybe even a hundred. I don't know. I think, I think there's about, I'm at about a dozen right now. But anyways, thanks for keeping and watching. Channel's growing, feeling good. Just got myself a little yin yang symbol there to fill up that bag. We wait for that to spill over. I love the icons on this. Beautiful peacocks, beautiful characters. I love the golden star. And I am ready to make some wins. And let's, ooh, we got a lot of characters on screen, but I guess nothing that matched up right. Um, when I was reading the instructions before, I know if we get five of those fish on screen, we're gonna have some wins. Some of the other characters are five or six. Nope, speak of the, oh, these are a bunch of different line wins. Okay, three, four, four different line wins. Nice. Those bats, bats coming through for us. Oh, I hope those fish come through. You guys have any good fishing? I feel like I should have a fishing story, but I have not gone fishing for, gosh, decades now. Like, I did it a little bit when I was a kid with my uncle, but just isn't uh, anything I've done recently. I wonder where you even fish in Las Vegas. Maybe the pond, maybe the Bellagio fountains. Maybe that's where the best fishing is around here. I feel like enough, enough things probably live in that water. There's gotta be something. I don't know. I like the Bellagio. No hate on you, Bellagio. I'm a fan. A little too expensive for my lifestyle right now, but one day, one day I'll be a Bellagio guy. But then if I had that kind of money, I'd probably be at the Aria or maybe the Wynn. They say the new Fountain Blue is supposedly really high end. I haven't been through yet, but uh, maybe that would be the new spot to hang out. I'm wondering if in the long run they'll compete with Wynn, but they're a big brand. 
you guys been to the one in Miami, I think, or in Florida somewhere, you should let me know. Let me know if you're a Fountain Blue fan or if you played the slots down there. All right. Maybe nothing. So far, not so much luck. Seems like we're just going on a long run here of minimal... Oh, okay, that's what I'm talking about. Every time, dude, every time I get down on myself, the, I swear these machines are listening to me. We have filled up a couple of the bags. Double action, double game feature, eight free games won. Okay, I'm down. Eight free games, that's what I'm talking about. Oh, nice. It's a freebie. Let's go, let's go. We got double screens? I wonder if I get four double screens or eight total with double screens. I don't know. Either way, I'm excited. Let's see how this all plays out. And... Oh, nothing on that. Let's go for another. I like the, I like these graphics. Ooh, what is this? This dragon's got to be something good. Dude, bringing me all those stars. Lock those into place. That gives us some guarantees. Ooh, ooh, ooh. It looks like two columns up there. Dude, does that count total? What is that? 3, 6, 9, 10, 11 total. And we got more stars on the way. This is definitely going to be a good payoff. Let's see where this goes. Oh, $1, $2, $3, keep on coming, 5, what do you guys think, maybe we'll get to 10, nice, I hope we keep going, it's hard to guess, but I'm seeing line wins stacking up in all directions, that's great man, 22 bucks, hmm, still going, look there's a row of kings, oh, here comes that dragon again. I hope he drops off some more of those. Drops off more of those stars? Come on, do it. That's like the store. That's like Stork, you know? Drops off babies. These dragons just drop off gold coins. Big fan. Big fan of gold coin drop offs. Here it comes again. I think we're going to get another 20 bucks out of this. Holy crap. We're going to get 40 bucks probably. Ooh, look at that blue one too. Loving it. I like the fish over in the corner. I'm loving all the line wins. Count those things up. Keep them coming. Mmm. Nice. Man, I hope we even end up above where we started. That would be fun. A good five minutes of play and to be like above where we started is always always a good day. I'm gonna try to film like three videos today properly. <gasps> dragon is back. Rawr. I wonder if this is kind of dragon that breathes fire. Very flexible. I mean, that's a yo those are definitely both yoga dragons. The way they can move up and down those different columns, different reels. Like those things are flexible. Come on back, dragons. Let's see. Go in there and just zip around. Ooh, they only brought three stars, but still, we already had so many on screen. There's not a lot of room either, so I'll take it. Oh, this is so great. Look at those. Look at those line wins stacking up. $35. We are definitely into positive territory today. And it always feels good to be up when you are winning the dragon slots. I feel that heat. Thanks for breathing fire onto this slot machine, Mr. Dragons. $45. What? Are you kidding me? We are at $116. That is great. That's extra money to talk to the cocktail waitress and get... So, you know, you get free drinks, but obviously I'm going to give a little bit of a tip. So that'll do really well. In case you're wondering, the reason why I almost never bring the cocktail waitress over is because I'm just, like, addicted to caffeine. Like, I'm a coffee drinker, and it's not... I, you know, that's not really what it's all about. It's about keeping people drunk. It's about playing the games. It's about having a good time. I, I want to get all amped up. I'm like, hey, can I have some more caffeine? Double, double shot espresso. Can you bring one over? You know, but they don't really do that, so... That's why in between machines, I stop by the Starbucks. That's how I, I keep energized for you guys. And now I even have some extra money to go buy that coffee. So thank you. Thank you, Mr. Slot Machine, Mr. Dragon Breath. All right, back back to the grind. Ooh, we are loving those stars. Those little Captain America stars have paid off handsomely. So let's keep those coming. I've had some of those Chinese characters show up before. Those look sweet. Wish I knew what they meant. Hopefully they mean the good luck or like dragon power or something like that. Another little win. I'll take it. Not quite as much as I put into the bet, but still. At $107, we are still doing well. I'd love to see those koi fish line up. Those are one of my favorite icons on the reel. 
we have had good luck with the yin yang symbol before if you remember that's what broke open our double game bag which led to that exciting experience that we had being honest i should probably call it if i get down to 100 let me just try a few more spins because i would love to leave just break even before i go down save the money for another video maybe another machine unless this one hits this would be the one but it's not bye all right we are back with my favorite three pigs piggy wiggly and squeak you know on my second time back on coin trio piggy burst we have potential to win seven thousand five hundred and thirty seven dollar grand prize i am ready to rock and roll i have my 100 dollar bill and I have my slot machine, and I have my coffee, everything I would need to play slots at a high level, which is exactly what's about to happen right now. All right, let me just straighten this out, and one day I'll be a high roller. I know you guys want to see more money bet, but I'm just not there yet. Hey man, can you imagine if this channel ever gets big enough that I could be like Vegas man, dropping like 50 bucks on this spin, 150 bucks on this spin. Check it out, guys. Whoa. That, yeah, there we go. Look at all those money bundles. A couple bucks, I'll take it. That puts us up above 100 bucks. That's always the it's always the goal. Always feeling good when I see more than 100. The three digits over there in the bottom right make me very happy. They don't last very long, but when they're there, I appreciate them. But anything you're appreciative of in the comments below. This is like, let's make this appreciation day. With Piggy, Wiggly, and Squeak here, you know, we should just all, all acknowledge the things in our lives, like Thanksgiving, kind of. Like, what are you thankful for? Put it in the comments below. All right. Look, not, like that money showing up for us. We'll take that, 85 cents, throw that on top, $96.90 .90 in total. Another little win up there with the jacks. Oh, okay, so I'm feeling a little bit of luck coming from this. Piggy banks are all about responsibility, saving money, and Piggly Wiggly and Squeak are the same way. This is the most responsible slot machine here. This is the one that you, when you're playing it, yes, you're gonna lose money on average, because that's what slot machines do, and that's how they build these big casinos, but this machine reminds you every time you look at that piggy bank to think oh am i saving am i having fun with some of my money maybe putting it in a slot machine but am i still saving enough for retirement are you opening a 401k do you have money for a rainy day saved up because if you don't take care of that first before you come to a slot machine you know oh there we go 40 more cents tack that on Maybe that piggy breaks, that piggy bank is gonna break. I was gonna say that piggy breaks. Either one works. That piggy on the left is looking fat. And I think if it shatters open and all that money comes out, we will be going to a bonus game. Coin Trio Piggy Burst. That is it in action. That is the piggy bursting we hope to see. I'll take the sports car, the watch. Got some more coins going into our piggy banks. We have $88.65. It's actually another sort of surprisingly gray day in Las Vegas. Like there's not many days out of the year that are like, they, they, it does get cold here. It does have a winter in a sense, even though it doesn't snow, but it doesn't really have many of these like overcast sort of Seattle, San Francisco days. And that's what's going on today. So we'll see if that's good luck or not, if that's gonna help us uh, kind of be in a different place or if that's gonna hinder us. We, we don't know, but we'll find out. All right, dollar, oh, dollar, 52 dollars. Look, those money, those monies have been showing up for us. Almost all of our little wins have been because those wrapped up dollars. Yeah, there you go, 50, 15 more cents. Throw it on there. Ooh, some boats, some watches, some diamond rings. Hmm, that be? Oh, what about those queens? That should have been worth a little more, don't you think? The top hat money one's the one. It's probably my favorite symbol on this reel. I like, there's something about those fancy, those pigs wearing top hats though. Come on guys, you gotta admit, that's some great graphic design. I grew up watching some of the cartoons that were based around Scrooge McDuck and this machine just like just love it I don't know why it just gives me those like warm vibes of watching that show as a kid and being like 
go. Maybe the middle one's gonna burst. Look at how big he's getting. Wiggly, wig, wiggly, and piggy are getting bigger and bigger and bigger. Oh my gosh, what if we go into a bonus game? That's my favorite icon too, showing up with the hats and the money. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, and there's even more money up on screen. That's gonna give us six. How much does that pay out? Mmm, that one could be really worth it. Two dollars, three dollars, keep going. And that gives our, what are we at? Seventy-eight dollars and ninety-five cents right now, plus having six of these on screen is going to give us another five bucks, so we're at eighty-three twenty-five. Now, oh, there we go, the boats and more money, too. Uh, if you watched my video yesterday, you would know that it was a huge, or two videos ago, but I filmed it yesterday. It was a huge win. $300 I walked out with after coming in with 100 So I feel like even if I go down to 50 today, even down to zero, I could do that a few, couple times and still be like, whatever. Yesterday paid for it. Yesterday I was up, so look at that wiggly up there. He's getting so big. He's bursting out of his little little container there. Oh, that's our favorite one. The the hat on the money. The Scrooge McDuck vibe. I wonder who th three of them? Yeah, it's worth a couple bucks. I'll take it. Oh, come on. Is that one going to break? Nope, nothing. That could have. That really could have. Alright, got the cars. We got the cash. Let's fill up these pigs. Money is going in. Ten cents. I'll take it. Every little bit matters. Eighty-one dollars, five cents at this point. There goes more coin into Wiggly. I think he needs to burst open. But I've seen before where sometimes the one that seems smaller just like it hits a few times and just like quickly gets bigger too. So even though I think Wiggly is about to break, there might be a chance that it's one of the other ones. We just, you never know with slot machines. That's part of the drama. That's part of the excitement. That's part of the game. Oh, I was so hoping that one would be the one to break it. Like, right in the middle of that comment would have been amazing. Oh, piggy wiggly squeak. Come on. Just burst open. Do your little piggy dance. Uh, what do you guys think about pet pigs? I know Vegas Crazy was talking about that, and I was not really thinking that is a possibility for me i like dogs i think cats are also good pets although i'm more fond of dogs but pigs mm, just don't know i mean i get that they're kind of it's kind of fun or cute to see someone else with a pig but i'm just not really sure i want to play with the pig every night and stuff and like jump up on the bed little piggy wiggly squee come on in you know like i mean it would be cute but i don't know they just feel, they feel like farm animals to me, which is, you know what I mean? Like, they're just farm animals, and I think dogs are, are pets. That's just the way it feels to me. Let me know in the comments below if, if, you, if you tell me if pigs feel like pets to you. I would love to hear hear it. Uh, you know, I am ignorant. I have, I've never met anyone who really owned a pig as a pet. Even bird, you know, even birds, though, I'm not into that either. Like... Like, a, like, okay, if you have a bird that can say a word and you come over and it can, like, repeat, that's amazing. Or if you have some birds in a bird feeder in the backyard, that's amazing. But, you know, other than that, like, just birds as pets, not to just impress your neighbors, I don't know. You really get that much out of it. I mean, they're beautiful. I guess, like, a fish tank. Yeah, I guess, like, a fish tank, honestly. Sometimes you have beautiful birds, more like a fish tank. That's weird. But I want to call a fish really a pet, you know? Like, it could be... Like, fish people and bird people, they're not pet owners. They're animal decorations. Right? Is that right? All right, back to the game. We have $59.65. Sometimes I recognize when I'm really off track, guys. I'm sorry. I think it's this weather. This weather is, like, really just keeping my head out of the game. Oh, that was bad. All right, $56.05. I hope I didn't offend too many pet owners and pet decoratives. <laughs> $54.65. Come on, let's see if we can get Squeak to break open there. Put that coin in you and burst open. I am ready. Piggy and Wiggly are gigantic at this point. It is going to happen, hopefully. But I do get nervous about losing money. So I think I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna take this $50. 
and move to the next machine. See you in the next video. What's going on, guys? We are back to play the NFL slides. If you might remember my last video from Super Bowl Sunday, I only got a chance to play a couple teams. So today I wanted to put this $100 Renos in for the Detroit Lions because you know what? They were a really good team this year and they almost made it to the Super Bowl. So this is a, my almost made it to the Super Bowl video. I, in fact, I don't know if you guys have seen on TikTok, but I saw that hilarious meme that was going around where it was like from the Lion King and it was Mufasa saying, the land over there, the, the land over there, the lions never, never go into or whatever. And then it had like the Super Bowl like trophy or whatever over there, but it was, you know, where Scar and all the bad, the bad people were, but whatever. This is the chance for us to show both Kansas City and San Francisco. Still a lot of fight left in the lion. There we go, 74 cents. That's the fighting spirit. Maybe they get the Super Bowl next year. All right, what do we got? Let's get some more of these helmets to line up. Coming up with plenty of NFL logos, but ooh, wow, look at a bunch of on screen. 300, 1,000. Oh, here we go, right up the bat. Back into a hold and spin feature. This is what I'm talking about right off the bat. One minute into the video, we are already here. 300, 400, 200, 1,000 credits in the bottom left. Let's see if we can fill those up with our last two spins. Oh, we got another free spin at least, another chance, and another four. Nice, this actually could be a pretty big payout. Let's see if we can fill those last five spots we cannot but that does not mean we are not leaving without some winnings we are a winner this is for you detroit detroit lions stack up that cash Ooh, 18 19 20 are we gonna hit the 30 dollar mark right off the bat this is gonna put us well into the positives 33 dollars nice very down with that dun 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 dun, dun. 120 bucks. See, there you go. We could have, well, it's hard to say we would have got a better Super Bowl with the Lions in there because we got a pretty good Super Bowl. But we would have got one without Taylor Swift, and there's a lot of people that would have liked that. So, there you go. $2.15 on top. Wait, what is. Oh, we're going into a wild card bonus game? Then we get here. Nice. Okay, we got five. One of five spins. These are our free game spins. Come on, there's, ooh, let's cut. Does that extra spin count for us? We got it on the screen. Three of six. Ooh, plenty of rings. Plenty of trumpets. Plenty of warrior spirit right here with these jacks. We got $3.06 so far, but we got more spins to go. Where's that classic car doing? In Detroit, oh, Detroit, right, of course, where all the classic cars were built. Makes sense. All right, what else we got? Six of eight, two more spins. Let's keep it going. Actually, we got our extra spin. Yeah, so I got us up to eight. Hell, look at those Detroit Lion logos in the middle. Tons of wilds in all directions. Seven of nine, we got two more spins. I, there's still a lot of hope here. Let's get something, a lot of wilds. We get some line wins at least from the tens. All right. All right. Dun, 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 dun. It's great music. NFL nails the music thing. It's got the warrior music and shit. Okay, some more wilds are going to bring us some wins on the nine, but uh, Mr. Football up there did not give us too much. So, cool. At least we got a fun little bonus thing to experience, but only $6.52. You know, I'll take it. It's better than just not having the bonus. Whoa, what a rush, huh? Back to reality. All right, here we are, 125 bucks. Let's keep it going. This NFL slot machine, I got a feeling the payouts on it are pretty terrible because they probably paid a lot of money for that IP and all that stuff. But got to admit, man, it is fun. And it is fun to watch sports on Sunday. It's fun to watch football when I'm at the gym. And it definitely has a feel that none of the other slot machines have. In fact, here in Las Vegas, I drove by the Raiders Stadium, Allegiant Stadium. And 
Oh wait, let me just see if this is gonna hit anything. All right, a little bit. Whoa, actually, yeah, ten dollars, nice. A great combo. Uh, but there was uh, an advertisement for this slot machine. I was like, wow, that's cool. I need to play it again. I'd already played it a couple times, but you know, when you see it on the side of a stadium, you're kind of like, wow. I never thought we'd see that world where gambling. And if uh, try the NFL slot machine on the side of a stadium in Las Vegas, it just seemed like the NFL wouldn't have gone that route in the, in the early 2000s. But here we are. Las Vegas has a football team. All right. I'll have to, and I have not played as the Raiders yet. So that's something I should definitely try. I have been in the stadium. Super pretty. Very beautiful. Look at our football guy right there. Let's do this, Lions. Lions QB. 122, 60. Super Bowl energy. Let's bring the heat. Cars. Oh, there we go. Oh, I called that one. I saw that first two, and then with the wild there in the middle. Let's see how much that gives us. I've been surprised by some of these line wins before. $1.40 is fine. For a dollar bet, it's more than I spent. 20 cents, not as much as I spent. Whatever. What do we got? Let's go, Lions. I was root I don't know why I was rooting for him so much during this uh, playoff series. It just felt like this, like, I guess like they're down and out or like just the city. You know what I mean? Like for some reason, they just seem like the underdog city and it was time for them to shine. Oh, yeah. Rings all across the top there. That's great. Dun, 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 dun. Wow. There we go. Five Super Bowl rings. Wow. $4.70. Oh, you know what else I should tell you about is the um, Pawn Stars is here in Las Vegas, like from the TV show. And I've been in there a few times, and one of the things that I distinctly remember was a Patriots Super Bowl ring for sale. $120,000 if you guys want to come pick one up. We have one here in Vegas. And then you can, I guess, go to your coworkers and show them your Super Bowl ring actually purchased i guess some nfl player was like yeah i'll pawn it on pawn stars it's 100 grand meant more to him than the ring so oh here we go back into a mini game okay this time we are gonna fill it up there's the mini jackpot down there too that's great and we got some 200 we got a single 200 and a bunch of 100s now let's get maybe that 1000 again or at least some 500s on the screen and fill these spots Ooh, not doing great yet but keep going this is more of these silver footballs what do we got? Okay, a 300 down with that. Filling up the spot. It's got a lot of blanks on the second reel I need to fill in. That entire column needs to get full now. Mm, what do we got? Dun, dun. I love those fireworks in the background. That's so sick. Come on. Go in those last spots, you footballs. Oh. All right, just gotta fill in those last three. Just gotta fill in those last three. Just do. Oh, that was I thought that was a for a second. Hey, we are getting pretty close. Two spins. If we can just come on, just fill it up with our last one. Oh, see that 500 spin by. Well, once again, this game is not bad, man. It is not draining me the way I kind of ex I kind of expected to come in here and lose a lot of money, but. I don't know. I just was intimidated by the NFL machine. I was picking a team. I hate to say losing team, but the team that didn't win the Super Bowl is still very good this year. But losing, you know, they're all losers compared to the actual winner of the Super Bowl. But losers only in that sense. The Detroit Lions, twenty-five dollar win. Dun 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 dun. One thirty-four. That is awesome. That is way more than I expected for this this round. All right, one more dollar. Throw it in there. Let's get that queen line win up. Got our car. Got our quarterback. Oh, 4,000 credits over there. That would have been 40 bucks. I'd love to see that one click in. That Super Bowl ring with, uh, how is this line? There is the rings. Oh, three rings on at the same time. Probably. Gotcha. Cool. Yeah, when you get three Super Bowl rings, that's very Tom Brady of us. Let's do it. $3.52. 
Nice. Still above 100 or close to 130 for our, our, our total in. And I am down with that. Okay, dollar. Throw it on there. Got our NFL logo showing up a few times. Love to see those Super Bowl rings, but I've not seen them. Oh, there we go. One on that spin. Okay, Jack's all over the place. Got it. And that is going to help a little bit. What else we got? Some Super Bowl helmets. Got a car. We got some lions. We got some NFL logo. Ooh, that could be. Ooh, 800. That would have been nice. Super what oh, cool stuff lined up right there in that middle row, but not anything that was matching. I uh, got our Detroit car, got our Jackson Wilds, maybe giving us a little bit there. Hmm. And all right, some nines. Hey, listen, nines come through with you sometimes. We're down to 105 though. I might think about leaving at 100. Let's. See if this should be our last spin. Live to fight another day is what they say. Good to leave when you're. I mean, I'm ahead technically, 42 cents. We are playing Skunks Gone Wild, stinking rich slot machine. There's a $5,740 jackpot that we're gonna be going for today. And you know, to tell the truth, this game smells well, not particularly good or bad. It just smells like all slot machines, but. Um, but money, now that has a unique smell. And I have the smell of money going into the machine right now. The, what do you guys think about the smell of money? Put that in the comments below because... Actually, I should... Uh, I was going to take a sniff of it, but it's already in there now. But the smell of money to me is a... It's a cool smell. Like, I'm not going to call it wonderful, but I definitely enjoy it. Like, the same way I enjoy books on a shelf. Something about the paper, something about the, the, the smell of, of US dollars is just... Good. Anyways, all right, back head in the game, Dylan. We gotta get stinking rich. Let's see what these, what these skunks have in store for us. I hope that we will be smelling riches today. Looks like we have keys to riches coming up on some of our first runs. Dude, I love the way this slot machine is decked out. It is pretty unique to have, you know, like stinky shoes, onions, cake, all these strong smells. It gives me a very visceral feeling that I don't get from any of the other slot machines. You know, it's a very nose-oriented kind of thing. Uh, have you... Ooh, nice. Got a little win there. Have you ever been to, like, an airport or a mall and you smelled an Auntie Anne's? Like, the place where they give you all the pretzels and they smell like cinnamon and sugar and bread. Like, I love that smell. Like, I can find an Auntie Anne's three turns away. Doesn't matter how many square feet the mall is, I can I can locate it with my nose. Put me blindfolded in there, I could track it down. Promise you that. Also, the smell of gas. I'm curious if you, when you're pumping gas and you smell that, kind of like it, sort of hate it, neutral. To be honest, I think it smells kind of... I mean, I would never get cologne. Nice, five. Uh, I would never get cologne that smells like gas, obviously, but it's not the worst smell. I, I don't crave it either, but when I'm at the gas station, I don't mind. I kind of... I sniff hard, let's be honest. I sniff hard while I'm pumping gas. But I don't love it, I just... it's okay. I like it enough. Anyways, back to the game. Line win there. We have another... oh, line smell, I guess we'll call it. 65... oh, we've actually lost quite a bit of money. Alright, I gotta... I gotta focus here. Head in the game. Head in the game. We need to be curious about wins. There we go. Keys to riches. Four on the screen. And a looks like a bonus line right there. Keys to riches all over the place. Ooh, that didn't get us a win, huh? I would have thought maybe... Come on, look at how many are showing up on screen. Can we just get some lines across, please? Got the icons, we just need them in different order. Nothing. Come on. Down to $54, all right. We're just betting pennies, right? Yeah, how do we do this? Oh, total bets 125? Okay. Got, we gotta pay attention there. And... nothing. And let's try again. And nothing. Alright, I'm gonna harness my scent. Let's use our olfactory system on this next spin. Olfactory implemented now. Nothing. Okay. And olfactory implemented now. I 
Do you guys even know olfactory? I know it means like the part of your brain that smells. Maybe that's like the part of the brain. Oh, wait, never mind. Got some lines. Not too big of a win, but I'll take it. $3.50. Add it to the pile. Hmm, 15 cents? Yeah, okay, okay. It's not a loss. That's it's actually, well, it is technically a loss because I paid $1.25 for that spin. Do you remember Pepe Le Pew? Um, from the Looney Tunes? Like, so smelly. Pepe Le Pew, you know? That's a funny character now that I think about it a little bit older. It's like the French skunk who's all fancy. That's a clever, clever character. I'm surprised she's not as big as Mickey Mouse. Dollar eighty, nice bunch of little line wins there. Follow your nose, as the machine says. Let's follow our nose to riches. Let's follow our nose to a big win. Seen a lot of those. I'm gonna. Not, I'm, those are false excitements. Thirty cents. So I'll take it. Come on, and nothing. And a loss. And. A Ooh, lots of lines there. Four dollars. Look at how many different wins we had on that. Nice, nice, nice. Keep it coming. No. And... No. And... Oh, 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 oh. Let's get some guidance from this skunk. What are we doing wrong here? I'm done at $27. And I'm feeling like nothing. Maybe this is actually good. Is this something happening? We have a middle row. Going crazy. Trash for cash. The smell of trash for the smell of cash. I will definitely make that trade. No, nothing. Do you know why the skunk on this slot machine loves his job? Because it just makes sense. Get it? Just makes sense. Sense, like must make sense, but it's more like sense. Okay, back to the game. $17.50 left, $1.25 spin. Let's try for a something. I mean, I've been... Look, we're going to break down this wall. We've been trying to push through this stink, but once we get through it, it's going to pay off big, I'm hoping. Oh my god, we're down at $12. This... Luckily, I had that big win on yesterday's video because it felt good to put $100 in and walk away at $400, you know? That was... Ooh, that was the Tiger Machine. Tiger Machine's definitely not doing me dirty. Stinky, stinky machine is definitely doing me dirty. Down to a 10 bucks. Oh my god, I'm just gonna be done, aren't I? This is, this is it. Uh, you know, this felt like a bonus game. I wanna do something with the smell. Ooh, there's our biggest win of the game so far. $5.30. A bunch of those lady, a bunch of that lady, lady, like perfumey lady. Uh, some line wins there will give us an extra few bucks. Three dollars and eighty cents. Okay, we're down. It's kind of keep, keep teasing us a little bit. Just teasing us a little bit. That's how these machines do you. Look at how are those all coming up in columns and not in rows? I don't get it. I need them in rows. You know, like we'd probably be making all sorts of wins if they were just in rows. Fifty cents. Keep me alive. See how many more spins we can get out. I'll write it to zero. Let's just see how many spins we can get out of it. Maybe we'll have a, a come from behind big win victory. Maybe we'll just have to have to ha hang our head low or whatever you would say. Smell the bad news. Face the dirty laundry. Get that onion smell into our olfactory system. <laughs> Dude, come on. Just $1.20. I can't even get one more spin out of it. I need a nickel. Somebody give me a nickel. Uh, okay. I did not find the scent of success. Smell you later. I hope you are ready to howl at the moon. Today we are playing Wolf Run Gold. $100 in. Let's see if we can chomp down on some of these bones and make ourselves even more bones. Is, isn't bones a word for money? Like. 50 bones, please. Something like that. I don't know. I was trying to make. I was trying to make a bones like money reference. I don't know. By the way, you know how dog or how Dan, a Vegas low roller, Daniel, how he's got three dogs, Jack, Gigi, and Rose. They are tiny dogs by all means, but they chomp on a bone that is like straight up the size of a dinosaur. It is crazy. So every time one of the symbols turns into the howling wind wolf it's a while so that's new to this version of the game i read that in the instructions before we started playing so look for that see right there that wild where it like i think that's it right yeah when the howling moon 
Ooh, does it animate? Is that what we're looking for? I think we're looking for the animate, or maybe it's just when it says wild. Maybe that's just the wild they added. I don't know. Oh, you never know, these machines. Everyone is so different, unique in its own way. Each one gives you a special memory that's only for you. Slot machines are the definition of custom entertainment. I mean, let's be real. Every single spin, you don't know what you're gonna get. It's unique. It's like a video game. You know, there's just not, it's not like a movie where you just know exactly how it's gonna end. Who knows how this video is gonna end? I don't know, you don't know, we just don't know. Only the wolves howling at the wind know the true, the true story. How? Oh, some wilds. Didn't click for us though. All right, let's go. Come on now, we got tens, we got aces, we got jacks, we got a few hell and moons and a bonus. Got three tens there, but that's only gonna give us, uh, wait, what's happening now? Wolves are running across the screen. This is what I'm talking about. Moons, <laughs> moons are exploding. Oh, the moons are going in. Okay, that must be the animated howling wind that I was talking about. Oh my gosh, that was way more animated than I expected. Yeah, respin award. Okay, that's what I was like. So I'm looking for that moon to come flying down and drop. I got it. I get it now. I get it. I get it. I get it. That's that's sick. Got the wild. Oh, cool. Got the respin. Nice. Oh, that's fun. That's beautiful. The howling moon comes down. Like, like, like kind of like a meteor landing on Earth. It's like crashing down, don't look up style. Wow. Tell me if you guys saw that movie, don't look up. I know about it. I know what it means and how it works. I did not actually see it. But I hear good things about It's kind of like how we ignore stuff until it's too late or whatever, which... Honestly, that's kind of a problem. Humans tend to ignore important things till it's too late. Uh, I had my appendix burst when I was in, or I wasn't in college, or maybe I was in college, yeah, I was in college, and my appendix burst, and I was like, nah, it'll, the pain will go away, and I, like, waited for, I think, like, almost two days, and then right at, like, 5 a.m., I just drove myself to the hospital, and the guy poked me in the, like, in that area, and I was like, oh! And he's like, all right, prepare for surgery. I was like in surgery within, I don't know, probably like 45 minutes of showing up to the emergency room. And that was such a bigger deal and such a longer recovery because I just didn't, I didn't just deal with it when it hurt a little bit. I was like, it'll go away, you know? No, nope, not anymore. Now I dress things head on, you know? They, oh, oh whoa, I want to dress that thing head on. Here we go, let's get these moods flying in. Wolves are running everywhere, boom, boom. Boom, boom, yeah. I'll take these four, let's see what they add up. These are super wilds, could be respins. Oh, maybe lining up with those wolves, is that gonna give, that's gonna give us something good. Huge win, huge wolf win. That's what I'm talking about, huge wolf win, let's go. Ooh, nice, $12. Nice, nice, nice. We are burning it up tonight. $88.95. We are not down very much. Only $10. All right. Queen's up there at the top. We got some tens. We got some queens. We got some jacks. Uh, we got some, uh, they're not tiki's. What are those, like, howling moon things? I don't know. White wolf, brown wolf, uh, blue wolf. Bonus wolf, and then I guess like wood carved owl. I don't, don't know why we needed that wolf carved owl, you know, but it is what it is. Okay, uh, oh, bunch of aces on that. There's enough on screen. I thought that would have triggered something. Man, I'm sucking up the money right now. I'm on a little bit of a lull. Let's get going here. Mm, not. Oh, there we go. Got some wilds. Got some tens. Nice. I could. That's all right. Extra four ninety-five in credits. That is five dollar runies. Eighty-three dollars five cents. We have not. We've not lost too much. We've had a had some couple howling moon respins. And yeah. Oh, those bonuses are coming up though. If we can get those to line up. Bunch of howling moons there. That's nothing, huh? A whole column of them. Guess not. Guess not. Oh, what is that? We got some wilds with the owl carved owl. No, nothing on that one. 
make let's get something going here let me know in the comments below if you're a, if you're a well i was gonna say if you're a wolf person i mean they're probably a dog person dogs are wolves dude isn't that crazy isn't that great you look at these little chihuahuas and stuff and you're like your ancestor was one of these wolves like you're pathetic compared to them you know i mean you're cute and like adorable and like i love you but come on like you wouldn't they were ruthless. You're like a little toy. Oh. Ah, it's crazy. It's crazy. Now wiener dogs, like they, like just through human intervention, wolves became like wiener dogs and chihuahuas. I mean, I see it when I look at like a Great Dane or a husky. You know, even a lab or a golden retriever. I'm like, ah, I kind of get it. I mean, I mean, they're a little, they're a little removed from the wolf, but. You see the size, the shape, or the face a little bit. Yeah, like, you know, I mean, a dachshund and like a Pomeranian, Chihuahua, some of those other little tiny dogs that I don't know the breeds exactly, but I'm envisioning. There's that, nah, like, they seem like they're more related to cats than dogs. Like lazy cats, they're like non agile cats is what it feels like. And the kind of cats that need to be. Dude, I, I saw this one guy lived in the building I was in in a while. He used to always push his little dog around in like a baby stroller. Oh, $2.65. He, 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 like one time he was at the gym and it was just like in the stroller the whole time he was at the gym and he'd like push it over to the next piece of equipment and use it. And I was like, yeah, come on, man. This dog wants to go run, you know? Wants to Wait, oh, congratulations. Five free games have been awarded. Bonus. Let's do this. Howlin' wins. One of five spins. Let's go. Game on. Oh. Come on. Oh, wild. Huge win. Nice. What? 10, 12, $15. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, three of five games. Free spin. That's what I'm talking about. Howling at the moons, wilds everywhere, keep it coming. We are $64.55 with an additional 15. Oh, boom. Oh, big win, coming in, coming in hot. Big, big win, $22. Ooh, throw that on top. We are getting back to our 100. Man, I'm gonna shake this thing down. It is howling when this feels like Game, I don't know. It probably shouldn't have. This reminds me of Disney Pocahontas. I don't know. These games, everything, the Howling Winds reminds me of Pocahontas, or Pocahontas singing that song. Dude, shake it up. Massive win. Three, eight, ten. Oh my gosh. Massive win. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Hmm. $93.50. We are barely down, ladies and gentlemen. The howling winds have been kind to us tonight. The wolves have shown their power. And we are back to $93. Carved Owl, don't I didn't forget about you. Carved Owl and Wilds, yep. Mm -hmm. I didn't forget. And there you go. White Wolf, you're in the pack too. Don't worry about it. You guys are all in. We're all in this together. Bonuses up at the top. Bring it on. Oh, oh, five games awarded. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, we're going, are we going back into another bonus game? Whoa. Yeah. All right, let's see. We got one of five free spins. Let's do this. Hmm. Nice. Look at him holding in place, bro. That's just extra. We know every spin that those are in place. Howlin' wins, keeping it strong. Ooh, matches up with the 10, no. Oh, that can, no. One extra free grain. Uh, I don't know why, okay, we got that. Maybe that bonus gave it to us. Whatever, six of six, let's do it. Nice, throwing another $4.55 onto that. We are really freaking, you know what? I'm gonna, dude, I'm like almost back to 100. And I got a full video of content for this YouTube channel. $96.80? That's sick. Dude, if I if I could just do if I only lose five dollars a video, I could do this all the time. I know you have been saying in the comments like you want me to bet more, but look man, this is real money. Like I just don't 
I just can't do what Vegas Matt does and be like, yo, $50 a spin, let's just do 50 of them, you know, it's just too much. One day, if you guys help me let the channel grow, I can reinvest some of the money I make, but as of right now, <sighs> it's just not there yet. What? Ooh, look at that bunch of wilds triggering with that owl. Give me the $88.35. Thank you very much. Some howling winds over there on the right. We got some wolves in the middle. We got, yeah, howling winds again. Second to the right. And, ooh. Well, I don't know, nothing there. You guys watch the uh, dog thinking about it's like a dog show i guess it's the dog show right like it's on tv and they like take the dogs and parade them around and judges i don't know what they judge i guess like how well they trot maybe how how well their fur is like groomed and like how accurately they can like follow commands i think <laughs> i don't know it's such it's funny that kind of stuff you can just tell it was an excuse to like do it like we had to put some competition around it what was this I just went $10? Oh, oh, weird. Uh, you could just, you could just tell it was like, oh, let's just do this first and then figure out how to make it a competition later. You know, like they were just like, let's just parade these things around. And then someone else was like, you know what'd be fun is let's rank them. All right, I'm done. Smash that subscribe button. Ox, that is Lucky Ox, the slot machine where you can win $1,300 for the grand jack prize. I would love that. That's why I'm putting in this $100-dollarinos to see if the Lucky Ox can shed some of that tough ox vibe and give me some luck, whatever that meant. I don't know. Let's just do it. Lucky Ox, here we go. Let's spin those reels. All right, we could use some, some luck. There's been a lot of, uh, I wouldn't call it stress, but there's been a lot of stuff happening in my life with my girlfriend being a magician, she's getting like all these new props and they are taking so much time to like perfect and like just, you don't know it in a magic show, but so much is like planned out. I mean, obviously it's magic. So it's like so much is planned out, but the process of like building that in the first place and planning out all those little things that have to go just right is crazy. I'm getting firsthand information just every day about how many little things have to be perfected. It's like a fine watch or something they all have to come together so my girlfriend's been very busy doing that uh the magician jen kramer if you're ever here in las vegas over at the west gate you should check her out but uh yeah so i'm just ready to relax a little bit um start my slot machine evening playing lucky ox let's see if we can get some of these ox to line up right now we are down to 89 dollars and 30 cents Ooh. Ooh, I like, that was looking like a nice combination there, but I didn't get anything. Jacks in all directions. Look at that 2,000, 3,000 credits potential for jackpots up in the corners. Uh, I hope one of those comes through. Ooh, tons of wilds, but nothing. Shoot, that was gonna be really fun. Oh, that would've been nice. Oh, wild, yeah, the wilds again. There, I gotta give this credit, uh, or this machine credit for great music, though. I'm definitely loving it. Ooh, Lucky Ox is exploding. What's that? What's going on? There we go. There we go. We're going into a bonus game or something. Oh, giant spin. Wheel of Fortune style. Thank you very much. And... Ah, no, a little further. No, you keep going. I mean, maybe the minor, but... Oh, my God. The... Of course. Of course. $2 plus respin. You're so close though, look at that grand. I don't know if it's, you know, sometimes they mess with you, you know? I felt like if we could have just gone one more little section, we could have got the big grand prize. Let's try it again. At least second time might be the charm. Oh, another respin? No, a minor. Oh, it's still going. Whoa. Wow, double $2 plus double respin. All right, well, hey, look, guys, as long as we're still in the game, man, I'll take another respin, see if we get to that grand. Uh, wheel of, no, no, it's not Wheel of Fortune. Um, price is right, spin that thing. Oh my God, again? No, now you're going too far. Well, you know what? Three respins and now $3, that is, that is crazy. Actually, this seems even like almost harder to get than the grand price. How many respins am I gonna get? But look, I like being in the game. Everyone's another chance to get that grand jackpot. No, 
No, no, of course not. It takes these to do. This thing is lubricated with like WD-40 or something. I think it just keeps on spinning. Seven dollars and fifty cents to add to the pile of winnings for fourteen dollars is nice, especially considering that we're not that far into the game. So I am above one hundred, and you know how I feel when we are above a hundred. I'm excited. Take that big freaking win and drop it on my winnings. Thank you very much. Lucky Ox, so kind, so kind, so great. When I think of an ox, I think about the phrase, tough as an ox. You know, this is what this machine is. I need to come with that kind of ox toughness. I need to sit up, in fact, I'm gonna sit up straight right now. I'm a little more straight, shoulders are back. And I'm gonna tell this machine, hey, you need to listen to me. You need to, you need to pay out a big win right now. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. I'm the ox, you're an ox, we're on the same level, and now we are connected. We both appreciate one another's oxness. What's going on? The thing is gonna break open. It's turbo powered. We got sparks, that's cool. They got sparks flying between the rails. They should use that effect on more slot machines. That's awesome. Whoa, big win. Look at how many coins are popping up thanks to that big lucky ox mega symbol wow back to $97.70 we are we are going for it today i like this we are five dollars in and we have the ox just killing it for us right now i mean not killing it but just you know grinding it out but not down you know we keep fighting our way back up. It's that fight of the ox. That's awesome. The lucky, I'm trying to think, is the lucky ox something that would be resonating to people who are in another culture? Are oxes lucky like that? Like the four leaf clover, the leprechaun in the United States. I feel like the ox might be something, like a Chinese thing or, I don't know. Let me know in the comments below if you know the lore around the lucky ox. I'd like to see and learn about the world cultures through my comment section here on YouTube. <laughs> that's how I do, that's how I get out. I read comments about people who get out and that's good enough for me. It's like looking at postcards instead of going on vacations. It's my life. All right, back to the game, $87.10. Let's see, got some, nothing lining up on that one. Nothing lining up on that one. Come on, let's get something going here, ladies and gentlemen. Hmm. No. Oh, what's that? We got a bunch of those little saucers, little gravy boats. I'm sure they have a better name, but they don't feel like lamps to me. Lamps feel like a very different thing. If you remember that Vegas crazy uh, uh, slot machine content where she was talking about how it looks like the gravy boat. Cracks me up. Ooh, got sparks on that reel. Oh my gosh, I don't, I would not be offended if you are offended by me yawning. That was very rare. I need a coffee. Where is that cocktail waitress? Do you have anything with caffeine in it, please? Oh my gosh, if one came over here right now and had like an entire Starbucks, oh no, it had an entire uh, Dutch, Dutch Bros, if you guys know that coffee shop, depending on where you live. You can get something called the Mafia style mega thing or something, but you're not even supposed to say, you're not even supposed to say Mafia style out loud, you have to whisper it, but that comes with four shots of espresso and it is the creamiest, craziest, deliciousest thing that you can ever imagine. And it's probably got millions of calories in it, but it's so good and it'll hype you up so much. I wouldn't take one even at this time of night. I only do that around noon or if I have to stay up really late for something important. But yeah, there's a tip for you. Mafia style. Don't get a heart attack. Don't blame me if you get a heart attack for it. It's dangerous. Uh, do your own research on what you can handle in terms of coffee. Thank you. $69.40. Lucky Ox. No coffee. Let's do. Let's do this. Can we get a bonus game? Whoa, there we go. Gravy. Not gravy train. Uh, gravy bowls or whatever. Golden gravy bowls paying off. Nope, nothing on that run. Oh, there we go. Maybe a couple wilds. Nope, nothing happened. Nothing happened on that one either. Come on, Lucky Ox. 
Show me the lucky ox. Whoa, that could have been a free game, but it wasn't. It was not to be so close, yet so far. Have you heard that phrase like, dust my eyes deceive me? Or dust my eye eyes deceive me? I forgot what movie I saw that from, but that's somehow that's like in my head right now. Actually, let me know in the comments below if you've ever had LASIK on your eyes. Like, I got that done 10 years ago, and that was really worth it, I would say. Um, I don't know. I understand there's risks. I know it doesn't always go that way for everybody. I know a lot of people even need more LASIK after uh, 10 years or so. But so far, like, knock on wood, I haven't. And everything was pretty smooth, even though it's, like, ultra scary when you go through it the first time. But it worked out really well for me. And that is how I have this... Well, I, want to, I was going to say, like, super sharp vision for slot machines, but you know what I mean. Like, reasonable vision at a reasonable age, I guess. Wilds coming in on the first column. Ooh, I like those little ox coins. Thought those might line up. We got a little bit. Could have got a little bit closer on that one, though. I don't know. I'd still say everybody eat your carrots. They're good for your eyes, I guess. Oh, actually, you know, here's a kind of a fun fact. This just popped in my head. And... Since you're just watching me play slots anyways, I'll tell you, but I heard that the whole thing about carrots and eyes was like like maybe World War II propaganda, and it was actually because we invented radar, but we wanted to kind of tell, I think, the kind of signal to the Japanese that the reason why we were like shooting down a lot of their planes because we had radar was because we were giving our pilots carrots. I don't know if that's like... I think that is true. I think I heard that on like a documentary or something, but isn't that crazy? Like... They wanted that myth out there that that's like how we were getting so good at shooting them down at night, even though it was really just because because we invented radar and we could like see planes at night. Uh, yeah, that if just leave a comment if you find that interesting or have anything else to say about that, because if I, I'm not by Google right now, but if you were to Google radar and carrots and World War Two or something, I bet you find all sorts of crazy stuff. Anyways, back to the Lucky Ox. We were down to $51.25. Oh, we, oh, there we go. Right when I started getting back into it, I got a huge win. $17, $18. Nice. Wow, look at us. Back to $90.75. Wow, I was getting really close to calling it at $50. Good for good good luck, Ox. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. it. Must be excuse me, a little bit of world history there, and then boom, right back into it. The lucky ox, keeping it wild. Wow, wow, that was something. Let's do it again. Let's get another one of those crazy bonusy things. Hmm, nope, just aces. Can we get a jackpot in the top corners? So close. Yet so far. But what else we got? Come on, Lucky Ox. Ooh, some wilds. I see some sparks going on there at the bottom, but looks like not enough to give us any gains. Down to $84.80. Aces every, every which way. Jacks in every direction. Hmm. Nope, nothing on that one. Ooh, that one was a, that was a nice pretty lineup on there. 6,000. Oh, that would have been nice. 6,000 over there, too. Ooh, nothing. Dang it. Oh, wow. Look at how many of those things showed up. I don't exactly know what they're called. They're like coins that are tied together or something, but they're hitting. They're giving us a little bit of profits. Come on, Lucky Ox. Wow. Nothing. But it's been a fun grind. I, if I get down to 50, I think I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna go get that coffee. I feel like that's, I'm smelling that Starbucks. I have to go get that soon. So let me do a couple more in case I get a big win. And if not, uh, hit subscribe. Thanks for watching. And okay, I'm out. I'll see you guys, bye. Found my lucky frog. Let's rub it. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. You know what I mean. Let's do it. I don't know. Is that cheesy? It was kind of cheesy. But anyways, I'm excited. We're here hoping to win this grand jackpot of over $5,000 with our favorite frog, the Stuffed Coins Toad Slot Machine. I have $100 Dollarinos 
ready to go into this machine and I am hoping that today will bring me, I guess, frog luck. Hopefully be hopping, hopping to some wins. Is that how you would say it? I would, why not? Hopping, hopping to some wins. Ribbiting, rabbiting, hip hopping. I don't know. It's starting to sound kind of rabbit on me, but it's because we got this golden rabbit symbol on screen. Oh, Froggy gets fatter, gotcha. All right, well, you know, it's just a few cents over, but we were over $100 for a minute, so we'll just keep spinning away. How are you guys doing? Let me know in the comments below what you've been up to, if you've been playing any new slot machines, uh, if you've been to Vegas and played anything you want me to play, let me know. I've been trying to do fan favorites now that I have, well, I don't really have, like, fans, but I've got a few people that comment so thank you so much and they have recommended a few machines for me so look out for those in the next few videos um all right nothing on that run we got some kings coming in we're hoping for some wilds to show up our lucky rabbit is almost there butterflies nothing or fireflies oh all right feed that frog bigger and bigger and bigger this is cool so i guess it's kind of like those triple bag games but we're dealing with a single bag unless this frog has like three different ways that it can pop i don't know we'll see like these beautiful golden fish though oh yeah there we go feed that frog let me know if anybody knows what that symbol translates to i'm wondering if it means frog or frog food or something getting bigger and bigger taking over that screen let's see if we can get him to go soon uh, all right, what do we have in store for the future of stuffed coin toad? Oh, toads and frogs. Have I been saying it wrong? Probably. I guess I'm going to call this thing. Wait, wait we got a respin. Respin feature. Respin. Oh, nice. Look at how many we already have locked in. $2.50, three or four full dollars and 50 cents. Another dollar dropping in the top left. Ooh, feed that frog in the middle. That toad, excuse me. And if we can get some of these coins to fill up in those last four reels, I would be really excited. Uh, nothing. Oh. Was that like a super one? I was hoping that would make that stuffed toad first. But hey, this is a decent amount of money for a win. Is this going to take us back to 100 at action? Might not, but we're going to get close. $9.56. Plus, anything the center symbol is going to give us might help a little. Nice. We are getting back up there. I'm feeling the toad's luck starting. You know what they say about licking toads. Don't do it. Poisonous is why you shouldn't do that. Stay away. All toads are be considered very dangerous. All toads should be considered armed and dangerous. Okay? Dun 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 dun. Nice win there. That was a fun feature. Thanks for the respin feature, Mr. Toad. You guys been on Mr. Toad's Wild? Oh, let's see. Nope, nippers. Wait. Yeah, nippers. You guys been on Mr. Toad's Wild Ride in Disneyland? It's so old, but it's such a classic. It's one of my... Well, is it my favorite? I do tend to get on it every once in a while, even as an adult, just because it's, like, nostalgic. But it's also... I can be kind of bored while I'm on it because it's really just some, like... Pretty old school robotic stuff happened in there. But they redid the Peter Pan ride, so that one's like, that one's really exciting now. It, it was always a very beautiful ride, but they've made it so it really feels like a, like you're flying way high in the sky and you're looking down at these really massive cities. So, you know, just in case you want to know, it's been revamped. Peter Pan Disneyland, check it out now. Oh, four golden rabbits. See if we can fill up the screen with some dragonflies next. Nope, unfortunately not. Oh, three. Nope, that one's not going to pop either. All right, I'm seeing a lot of aces coming up on screen. Let's see if we can feed our froggy again. Our toad. Mr. Toad. Oh, but Mr. Toad in Super Mario is a mushroom. How ironic is that? Mr. Toad's wild ride and then Mr. Toad. Depends on if you're talking Disney or Nintendo, you know? Definitely different Mr. Toads floating around. Hmm. I have to distinguish that from now on. I don't want people getting confused. Mr. Toad Super Mario, Mr. Toad Disney. I think it's because there hasn't been a Disney like movie for Mr. Toad. For, like I don't even know if there was one. There might have been one before I watched Disney movies even, but like, I mean, I'm sure there is. It must be one of their properties, but maybe it's due for a remix. What do you guys think? 2025 
full motion release Mr. Toad, the movie? Let me know in the comments if you think that would be- Oh, wait, wait. No, 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 no. Man, I really was thinking that Toad was about to burst. You see how big he got? That was exciting. He is getting full, I'll tell you that. Stuff to the gizzard. I don't even know how that fit in you. You should have burst. All right, we got some more of these golden rabbits. Let's see if we can get some wilds. Looks like we get... No, big coin feature if we get multiples of the symbol. Okay, so that cool little uh, character. Oh, oh, wow, that was a lot of golden fish. I thought that was gonna pay a little more. But if we can get multiple of those characters on screen, that would be amazing. No, oh, lots of queens. That's gonna give us a little bit of money. What do we got next? Uh, five dragonflies. Nope, dragonflies coming out. Oh, shot. Yeah, they're flying around today. 80 cents, I'll take it. It's almost as much as my bet. Come on, look at the toad, look at the frog. Let's think swamp thoughts. Is that... Don't know about that, but that's where toads live, so that's why I was saying maybe, maybe he thinks swamp thoughts, but lots of ways to interpret that I'll stay away from. So we got more dragonflies. Ooh, golden lions are showing up for the first time in bulk. I'd like to see more of those. Ooh, no. Come on, come on. Oh, this is really just beating us up today. We are down to $48. I would love to see another feature, another bonus game. Let's get back into that, that respin feature, man. That was fun. Oh, how big is that going to be? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That'll be 80 cents, 90 cents. Okay. Um, got golden fish again. Maybe some... No, lots of, we had no fun symbols on that one. That was just nines and tens everywhere. There, those aren't gonna count though because we didn't get our symbol to also push them into our winnings account. So all of those numbers on screen don't do us much good. Gong, we got one gong. Can we get more? We got fish, we got a lot of lions there. That would be enough for how much? 60 cents, okay. Nice little, little boost there. Okay, look at how many coins we got coming up. Respin! We're in the game now. Let's do this. I want to see this whole screen full of numbers. And wait, one thousand. Oh, it didn't stick. Oh, are you kidding me? So this uh, fifth column, I guess, is going to be some kind of multiplier or bonus that doesn't stick around persistently. But wow, that $10 would have been really nice. Anyways, let's fill this up. Come on. Ooh, is that 10? Does it do as much good? I wonder how that one... Let me know in the comments if you could explain what's happening with that reel. Because... There's a thousand right there. Why am I not getting that? Is it because it didn't match up with something else? I don't know. Let me know if you guys know Stuffed Coin Toad's slot machine better than me. I would love to learn. But I do think that... I'm going to know when I'm out of luck in trying a different machine. I love that this might get me back up above 50. And I am going to take this. Oh, I am so intimidated. Buffalo Diamond Extreme. Let's do it. Okay, this is what the Extreme Buffalo feels like. One of the weirdest layouts of all the slot machines I've seen, but well worth it when you have a potential win of more than a half million dollars. So. There's something here worth playing for. Let's dive into it. $100 Renos into the slot machine. Buffalo Diamond Extreme. Could today be something that could challenge my video from a few days ago where I made $600 off a single $100 Renos. That would dwarf it if we can get half a million. But of course, we're still low rolling. So we're going to keep this in the penny D noms which is actually all I had in there even when I won that 700. And I know I gotta stop talking about that win, but that was such a big win. If you haven't seen that, go to my channel and check out Big Win, which is what I titled it, because it was such a big win. Okay, I'm moving on, life is moving on, I'm off to my new challenges. Buffalo Diamond, let's go. So, okay, so the first time I played this machine, I understand that the line wins don't go like vertical and horizontal exactly like a normal machine that we're mostly always looking at diagonals so I'm just gonna try to get my eyes used to that 
Looking for kings and aces and patterns in the icons that way. Ooh, couple eagles. Oh, let's see. Was that a lame one? See, that seems weird to me. Oh my gosh. No, dollar minimum bet. This thing really... Got 100, 100 spins on this thing. It's a little expensive, but I guess that's what you get when you have that potential for such a high grand jackpot. This is the most grand jackpot I've ever seen at a machine that I've sat at. So I'm sure the odds are astronomically low. Probably like, I mean, not lottery low, but you know, low, low. So that would be incredibly unusual if I won, although that would be so exciting. Okay, got it. Diamond double and ooh, so does that persist for multiple spins? Like, do I get double on other combinations now for a minute? Or is that kind of like a single bag game where it's building up to multiples? Or did it only count for that one? I'm not sure. If you know in the comments below, let me know so I can understand that dynamic better. But I know I would have got a multiplier if that was a combination bigger than those three buffalo. So we'll see how this keeps growing. Maybe something will surprise us here. I wonder if this game has the extreme feature. I know I've seen that on some of the buffalo machines where, you know, once that triggers, you get more of an enhanced chance to get free spins. God, that wheel. Wonder what happens if we get three of those. Probably go into a cool bonus game. That'd be fun. And some multiplier bets. Oh my gosh, and the reels aren't all lined up. What? Buffalo Diamond Extreme, you're insane. This is a this is a little maybe a little bit too much for me to be honest. Like maybe I should have worked my way up to this machine. But let's see, we're in it now. There's nothing like jumping into the pool and just learning to swim. We got tens lining up diagonally, very cool. Uh, some kings, some aces, three buffalo there. That's not gonna help us too much. More nines, a bunch of tens, so we get five tens to show up, gives us kind of a half, half of recurring bet, or half our bet is back, you know what I mean. Mm, queens, jacks, tens, kings, aces, nothing of value. What else we got? Lots of wolves showing up there. What is this, wolf run? Get out of here, you're for another game, save it for later. Yeah, I always know those, uh, the symbol that has the like beautiful landscape is always very, like, worth watching. Lots of big wins from that kind of thing. Mmm, the moose, the mooses, the moise. Queens. Oh, come on. Oh, three wheels. We almost got, there's a third one, should have been on the last one. Okay, come on. I really, okay, so now I think what I'm looking for is these three wheels to kick in. I would love to see three, one, one, two, three of that and see what happens. I see one. They're showing up. They're giving me music, giving me sound effects. Ooh. Now am I the three? Three? Okay. So I get 3x multiplier, but that doesn't win me too much. But I guess th that might have doubled it to a dollar because I did see that I just won a dollar on that. Maybe that would have been. Oh. Where did that double? Maybe it stayed for a persistent for another spin. Interesting, interesting. Now is it gonna go up to the three? Okay, back to the two X. So I guess you gotta get three diamonds on the same spin to move up that chart. Okay, so is it for this spin? Oh, that would've been cool. I think I would've got the double. Now that's a real win. We got a buffalo, $2.25, all right. Hmm, buffalo, buffalo. Okay, a bunch of jacks, I'm liking that. Wheel and ten, just killing it. Just killing it, that's how we do. All right, what do we got here? Come on, let's get three wheels going. That's a double wheel again, we need three. Although, to be, to be honest, I'm not positive three wheels puts us in a bonus game, but my guess is from my one month of slot play on YouTube experience that that'll get us something. But uh, who knows? Let me know in the comments below if it's not three or if something else happens if you get four or five and you get like extra super wheel something. Dang, down to $42.45. This is going fairly fast without too much excitement thus far. But you know, when we sat down to Buffalo Diamond Extreme, we knew Knew it was going to be big. And, you know, of course, we're playing with some winnings. But I said I wouldn't mention that video again. Check it out. It's a big win. Okay, after that, I'm done. 
Uh, no. Okay, I just want to talk about. Wait. All right, I was gonna talk about that big win again. So you guys really like Magic Treasures because that game is so awesome. Oh, that extreme. Oh, oh, I didn't acknowledge. I clicked too fast. Like that extreme. Oh, that would've been sweet to get three of those. Come on, where's our wheel? No. One. No. <laughs> Two, come on, how many times are we gonna get two without getting three? Ugh, queens, I mean, thank you, but still. I want three wheels, or I want that extreme icon to come back. I wanna go into the extreme mode and then get, like, kind of more power to everything. Okay, got the wheels. Do I only need one of the extremes to show up and then I'm in extreme mode? Like, or do you need to get three so it triggers? I don't know. I know about extreme mode, but I don't know exactly what triggers it. There it is. Extreme right in the middle. Put me in extreme mode. Wheel. Oh, got my diamond. Multiply, multiply me. Whoa, it's a 4x multiplier. Oh, I thought we had to earn our way up that chart. Cool. Oh, please be something worth 4xing. Oh, 4x me something. You? No, that's not 4x. That's 80 cents. That's one wheel. Nobody wants to be the, the third. Or wait, actually, you do want to be the third wheel on this game. I want to be the third wheel. There's extreme. Third wheel gets a bad rap, you know, but in this game, we're all big fans of the third wheel here. Maybe not on a double date. It's good to be a third wheel, but, uh, you know, third wheel... In Buffalo Diamond Extreme, I'm all about it. I wonder if this is a crossover with Diamond Hunters. Is this owned by, these are all IGT games, huh? Oh, that's Top Shelf Win. That's Top Shelf Win. That's Top Shelf Win. That's what I'm talking about. $9.35, keep us in this game. I needed that. Let's get a few more spins. Let's get Extreme. Let's get a third wheel going. Let's hear the buffalo. Uh, is it gonna happen for us or is this thing gonna just suck up our money and make that progressive pot bigger? Maybe get up to a million before some other man or woman sits down and wins it. Ooh, there was the extreme. I gotta say, I'm a little overwhelmed by this machine. I think this is more like a veteran machine like one I should be playing after I've got like I like at the six month mark when I'm like starting to feel like mm, yeah I understand I understand these slot floors I know where to go Ooh, what's that gonna be 3x 4x 5 or there's no 5 but yeah 4x blue $2.40 win all right I am down to my last four spins here Still down to my last four spins, not enough to keep me going. Tens are showing up. There's three, come on, three wheels at this point. At least I got another spin out of it. Uh, let's see if we can get something else going. This would be a real Hail Mary. Wheel, 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 nothing. Things are watching. See you guys tomorrow. If SeaWorld made a slot machine, this would be it. Look at that little Shamu guy holding that bag of money. Get ready to play Whales of Cash Rising Jackpot. We have a $10,000 potential grand prize. I am ready to dive in. So let's make a splash with this $100 bill. I am going to be low rolling today, one cent D-noms, but you know, we have seen some big wins from that before. We have had $100 wins, and maybe today we will have that same luck. So let's see what this ocean faring group of icons has for us. First spin, let's go. Ooh, we got our little Shamu, do 2x Shamu. Look at him spinning around in that little, little container of his. Should be out in the ocean free to spread that money around. Okay, these little Sebastian guys. I love how that starfish kind of looks like Spongebob. Like, really a lot like Spongebob. Like, could be Spongebob's cousin or something like that. 
Oh, another 2x multiplier for... What was the line when the kings? Okay, cool. Whatever, I'll take it. Okay, let's do this. Um, nothing yet. Still got $94, all right. Don't get antsy. Don't get antsy, Dylan. You're doing fine. Oh, oh, one dollar. Two dollars. Look at those little dancing crabs. Those guys are ready to just sing some songs here. They seem so happy. Crabs in real life never look happy in any way, but here they look so... Every time there's a crab that's a cartoon on TV, they always look so... So happy, those big smiles. But I get it. You know what? Winning on the slot machine makes you feel good. Ooh, like that sound. Ooh, like that sound too. All right, swim around there. Nice. Two X, two X. We just won a dollar twenty. Put in eighty-eight cents. Win a dollar twenty. Nice spin. Keep that up. Whoa, whoa. Look at that little clam thing. He's cool. Holding his pearl out there, so excited he made that. His little baby pearl. Isn't that crazy that clams make pearls? Is that right? No, it's oy oy oysters are where pearls are made. Yeah, I think clams, clams and mussels might or might not be able to make them or like not as often. But yeah, it's all about oysters. Oysters, look, those things are little money making machines. They say money doesn't grow on trees. Money grows in the ocean and oysters make it for you. That's a crazy thought. Those are little money making machines. We should, should I bring a little fish tank full of oysters next time we come to the casino? That way I can just sell the pearls as needed to keep going in the slot machines. I'll run a little business here on the side. Yo, anybody, you want a pearl? 12 bucks. Take that money, put it right in this machine, you know? I'll keep the uh, whale of cash machine fed here with my pearl business. Oh, oh, what is this? We got a nice little animation here. Our Shamu, our, our casino Shamu just swam by. All right. Oh, cool, we get to pick all these little clams or oysters or whatever we're gonna call them. How about that one? Ooh, we got one of each. Probably want a bunch of one, two miners. I'll take it. Let's uncover these things. The major. We got a grand. We got a mini. We got a grand. We got another mini. Oh, we have three minis. Is that enough? Okay, well, we got the mini bonus, $10. Would have been fun to have the grand, but $10 is $10. Nice. Great little bonus there. All right, back to our little SpongeBob looking starfish. We got our casino Shamu swimming around. We're, we're at $90. I mean, hey, that's not, that's not bad. We've been playing for four minutes. Here comes some more money. Got our dancing crabs. I'm liking this machine. This is good. And we got our new pearl business underway. I would say that we have had quite a successful run so far. Look at that treasure chest down there too. You guys, if you have your favorite pirate movie, put it in the comments below. I, of course, like Pirates of the Caribbean. I mean, I know that's pretty standard, but look, I loved going to Disneyland. I loved riding the ride. Nothing quite like a partially drunk main character running around in pirate gear. It's just, it's just fun, you know? And it's got a great soundtrack. Ooh, dollar, ooh, two dollars. Look at that, a couple bucks going in. But I just love the soundtrack to Pirates of the Caribbean. I can listen to, I can listen to that kind of orchestral movie score stuff all day long. I love it. Like while I'm working to go to bed, I just like how it has a lot of emotions and not a bunch of words to distract me. What about the Little Mermaid remix? Oop, got a little win there. Oh, well, hold on a second. Oh, 80 cents, okay. Yeah, what do you guys think about the Little Mermaid remix? Leave a comment below if you're a fan or not your thing. If so, why? Any ocean facts you might have? You could throw that in the comments. That could be kind of fun. Or if you have a, what's your favorite ocean slot machine? Water themed slot machine? We played Ocean Magic Grand a little while ago, like at one of the first videos on the channel. And that was, I think, the last time I played one of these like water themed slots. So it's nice, nice and relaxing. It's like sitting in front of a waterfall, except you can make money, cha-ching, or lose money, which is what you do on average. But sometimes you have big wins and that's really exciting. Remember, gamble responsibly, everybody. It's not an easy way to make money. It's a guaranteed way to lose money. All right, see if our luck is going to turn around here. We are down to $75. We've only lost 15 so far, which is 
really, once again, not that bad. This has been a fun machine so far, but I would love to go back into one of those bonus games. I'd love to see those dancing crabs again. Got a queen line win. That's worth not much, but something. And, oh, there we go. I got my dancing crabs. Ooh. Two dollars. Nice. Thanks, guys. Nice for that little jig. Use those little pinchy claws to just dance there. I also like this square that's hanging out in the treasure chest. Because you know there's a lot of money in there. But uh, you open up that treasure chest, that squid's going to get you. have to go in there with a robotic arm or something. It's the only way to get it out. In fact... I wonder how you would even get that squid out of there. Maybe you have to tempt it out with food in some way. You could probably put some squid food. I don't even know what squid food, like fish or something, like outside. So it has to pop out, grab it, then boom. When that squid's not looking, you jump in there and grab that gold coin. You swim in there with your... Of course, you're going to be so slow if you're just swimming around in some wetsuit or whatever. I don't know. All right, another loss. Now we're down to $62.20. Uh, definitely feeling like we could use another little boost right about now. Hmm. Stacking up that gold with our Casino Shamu, but nothing that's going to break that bank yet. Nothing that's going to spill over in that bag. Ooh, lots of dancing crabs, though. Five of them? Nice. Do, 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 do. Ooh, three. Oh, that's... Oh, right. That's a nice big win there. Five is pretty unusual. And I'll take that at least five dollars. Whoa, six? Are we going to six? Are we going to seven? Are we going to seven? We are. We're going past seven. I did not know five crabs could be worth eight dollars. I am down with that. Oh, Casino Shamu, thank you for bringing me all of these wonderful crustaceans. Now what's going on here? Those pearls are jumping around. Oysters, clams, shellfish, and 2x multipliers unite. Another $3. Oh, I did not know this was going to pay off so well. Come on, keep going. $6.71. All right. All right. This is what I'm talking about. Playing eight and a half minutes and we're still at $70. I'm really happy with that. That was fun. I also like that, so that sound of the water, like the air bubbles floating to the top. It's like such a relaxing sound. You guys use white noise machines at home, fall asleep. I like that, that you can get those ocean sounds, just like waves crashing or whatever. So relaxing. Oh, look at this little fish over here, hanging out down by the bet section. Big ol' eyes, keeping an eye on me. He's like a security guard, watching, making sure that no funny business is happening. All right, got a little win, a miss. Let's do another miss. Ooh, wait, no, actually a big win. What is that? Oh, three money bags? Oh, it's only three icons. It's probably just a couple bucks, but that's new. I haven't seen that animation before. Oh, 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 oh my gosh, $4. 440, man, can you imagine if we got five or six of those? We got a bonus game? Oh my gosh, look at this. Choose your reel. Uh, let's do this one, five by five. Uh, choose your feature. How about just the middle one? Eight games sounds good to me. Okay, interesting. Bubbles away. Let's do this. Wow, look at how many reels we have. There's so many line win potentials and a forex multiplier from Casino Shamu. I am down with that. <gasps> look at those. The squids are moving around. What does this mean? Oh. Okay, 3x multiplier again on that one. All right. Oh, this is awesome. Look at how big these reels are. Look at how much potential we have for winning. Nope, nothing there. There's so much options here. Come on, something line up here. We've had, remember when we had five crabs before? That is great. We got four. Okay, we got our Casino Shamu back. He threw up some bubbles up to our bag. Uh, oh, a bunch of queens, a bunch of tens. That's definitely worth something. Jacks are doing well. Okay, let's total up these these. These wins, $13, nice. 
All right, back to $75.23. Wow, that was fun. That was a cool little bonus game. I did not expect to go into that. I don't know why, it just caught me off guard. Um, what else we got over here? Um, oh, two dollar win. We'll take that. And another one. Look, four squids on screen. Why isn't the top one moving like the others? I don't know. You guys, are more lazy than the other four. The other three. Mm, nothing. Mm, oh, uh, just the queens. Close to nothing, but not nothing. And not nothing's not nothing. All right. Any more? No. And again? No. All right, maybe. Maybe I should be thinking about leaving. Never mind. It looks like it's giving me more money. Don't leave now. We're starting to win. Oh, all the tens. I see four tens plus the two X multiplier. Ooh. But I am. I am kind of thinking maybe when I get down to fifty dollars. As you call it, quits on this video, so we'll see. Maybe we'll get lucky and just go up. In fact, let me put a top cap too. If we get to 100 or 50, I should quit. And right now, I'm seeing those crabs are trying to help me out. Those kings are trying to help me out. Or maybe they're lobsters. No, they're crabs, right? Lobsters, crabs. Oh, jeez. I got to brush up on my uh, seafood and sea knowledge before I, before I come play this machine next time. Before I go back to Ocean Magic Grand or Whales of Cash, like I gotta remember to like brush up on all my, all my oceanography stuff. All right, let's see, nothing there. Down to fifty-four dollars seventy-nine cents. Might just play a few more here and call it. Yeah, I think I will. Welcome back to Slot Curious. Today, I hope you're curious about cows and, and bulls and all that stuff because today we are playing the coin combo with a 15,000 grand prize and it is the uh, wild cow edition, carnival cow edition. And I am here with Slot Curious and this is my $100 going in. So are you ready to give me some, some cow luck here, please? I don't know, you're here with yourself, Slot Curious. Okay. <laughs> I'm Slot Curious here with Slot Curious. No, I just wanted to make sure I did my normal intro, you know, when I put the money in and stuff. Like, people have to know it's me. Yeah. You're here with yourself. You're here with your thoughts. I am here with my friend. No, you're here with your thoughts. What's up? It's Vegas crazy, guys. What's going on? All right, we're going to play. This is a game I haven't played yet, but it seems reminiscent of a few games I've played, so I think I know what we're getting into. Is this new to you? Or have you played? Ah, uh, this is definitely new. I've never seen an adorable little baby bull like that on a machine. So if you guys uh, know, we just we just filmed a couple of videos for her channel, and they were mostly related to cats. So I thought it'd be better if we went cat cow and started a little playing. yoga. Yeah, started playing the carnival cow. Get that spine going. Here at Santa Fe in Las Vegas, we are ready to, to go from cat to cow. Cat, cow. Are you, you just call me a cow? No, you're a big yoga person, right? I am. That's what keeps you flexible or whatever. Keeps you young. Keeps you patient. You can touch your toes. I've always been able to touch my toes. I, there is not a moment I shined more than in high school during the presidential fitness tests, and it was the sit and reach. Oh. That was my jam. Every time, shoop, straight to the end. Let me know in the comments below if you're good at the sit and reach. Or what was your presidential fitness? Did you even, did you take the No, I have no idea what you're talking I don't remember. <gasps> did you go to public school? Yeah, but. Then you did it. Well, no, sorry, I did, pri yeah, I did do private school, but I did some public school and I never remember the president coming. No, the president doesn't come and you show off in front of him. I'm sure it doesn't. I was it? like, hey, Mr. President, look, I can touch my toe. That's, what else does Biden do all hey, day? Hey, mom, look what I can do. He visits all the high schools, checks to see if people can touch no, their toes. No, it's that's, like a fitness. You do pull-ups and you do uh, mm. sit and reach. I think the mile is included in it, too. I mean, I had gym class. Yeah, it's in gym class, and you, but you, there are these certain tests that everyone has to do. Oh. Got a little bit of a combo there. Nice line win. Oh yeah, we're playing a slot machine. <laughs> but I um I, I had really bad track. Like track was my weakness. I'm not I'm not very good at endurance like that. Oh, I ran track. Oh yeah, I, I envied people like you. I was like, I don't know where all that energy comes from. I can do some weightlifting or play some sports, but nah, man, I just get I get winded. I will say that one time. Whoa. Oh, we got Whoa. a big win. What's this thing? Oh, we got it to burst. We're going into a Whoa, bonus game. Cow. 
Okay, bow save man. that thought. I'm ready to see this mighty Whoa. feature. Dude, look at that bull or cow or whatever it is. He's it's a little dropping baby bull. He takes no bull. Wait, cows are bulls, right? Men cows are bulls. Oh. And if they have no peepees, they're ox. Because the game says carnival cow, but then it seems like it's a bull. I don't know. Anyways, I'm happy to be winning 258 credits already. Woo Let's keep this up. Look, there's some more cows showing up. 66, 68. Bing, bing, bong, bong. No more cow tipping for me. I'm over that phase <gasps> in my Did you life. ever do that? No, of course I didn't. I'm just kidding. Wait, did you? I've always did wanted you? to. No, I never pulled Vegas the trigger. Crazy. Be we honest went. With us. We went. I got this to weird the dairy farm, but they're like, they're locked up at night. So. Mm. Oh, you tried, but couldn't get into we where they were. Went. I don't know if I would be able to muster up. Cows are big creatures, man. 13, 14. Have Woo! you? Have you melted cow? Oh God, no. But I did a pretend one when I was young. There was this museum called the Louise Touch Museum. Very weird to send children to. I, I am being Is very serious. In what city? Is the Please Touch Museum? Google it. No, I'm not. Because growing up, I thought it was called Police Touch, and I thought you would get in trouble for touching. But in fact, it was a museum where you just really went around and touched things. Are you talking about a petting zoo? No! No, no. Look, I'm just happy that we are making $26 on this slot machine. Woo I guess all this banter is bringing good luck. Three free spins remaining. So look at how many we have locked in. Now you're going to be up. Yeah, well, if we can get these three slots here to actually show up with discs, like gold coins, uh, we only have one more chance, though. But we will make big. Ah, oh, nothing. So close. Dang, we had three chances to get that. But that's all right. I'll take it. $26. Look, you are bringing me good luck right now, Vegas that's Crazy. I, I am up above 100. I'm always happy when I get a slot machine day that takes me into the positive so I can pay for a couple more videos. Lady Luck. Yes, that is Lady Luck. Wow, Lady Luck has shown herself. Maybe you're the luck vessel. You're the vessel lady. that Lady Luck uh, funnels her luck through. Funnel cake. Are you really rich? Like, do you make a lot of money? How is your slot luck? I am a single mother, sir. Okay. <laughs> am I rich? I okay, am okay. rich in spirit. I am rich in happiness. I am rich in yeah. in parenting. Parenting. Yeah, that's great. But why do you think I play slot machines? Feed your family? Yes. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. No, you would. Obviously, that's a joke, everyone. Do not ever. The cost of living is up so much. On average, all slot machines lose money, so don't. That's not true. That is true. That is very true. Uh uh You cannot use this to feed hey, your guy. family. Hi. <laughs> you see that? Yeah, we got the Vegas, <laughs> Vegas low roller over there hanging We're out. We're making friends. Yeah, I got a few people on both sides there. Slot machine community comes together. All in one, exactly. Hundred and ten dollars. Um, so I went to India uh, for Magicians Without Borders. What? It's like Doctors Without Borders, but it's for magicians. And the cows, when they would cross the road, do you know they would, they would stop traffic. We would have to go around them. That happened to me on the way to the Grand Canyon. Oh, wait, in the United States? Yes. Or in India? Yeah, oh. wait, no, yeah, the Grand Canyon in <laughs> India. Have you heard? Okay, okay, Beautiful. Okay, but I'm just saying, but then why would a cow... Oh, That's you're just saying thing. a cow wandered into the road and nobody wanted to hit it. Yeah. I'm trying to say in India, cows are sacred and they get the right of way. Oh, oh. It's not that... that no, the what? Cow, no, the cow, you don't eat cow. You don't talk badly about cow. And when cows walk on the street, then you deal with it because they're in charge. Around okay, there. so cows are to India what cats were to Egypt. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That's exactly right. Excellent. Ex Vegas crazy. Very good analogy. What can I say? I know my animals. You do know your animals. My animal worship. They're, yeah, but it made me appreciate cows in a different way. And I never told anyone, you know, when I was from Is America. it because they're cute and cuddly? Because personally, I don't eat cow either because they, they literally are giant dogs. You know what? They are way cuter. And Have you ever seen a baby? Have you ever been on TikTok and seen a baby cow? They're so cute when they drink the little yeah. bottles. <laughs> I know. And baby elephants, too. They're way too smart. I know. I'm... I... Uh, by the way, I am planning to go vegetarian next month. What is least, planning? Just do it. Well, I'm going to, I just need to prep, uh, work up to it. But I read this book uh, from Dr. McGregor and I'm definitely thinking as long as I get my B12 supplements that I should be fine if I go, go vegetarian. And Dr. McGregor, I love his work in the ring. Okay. No, that, it's not, it's a very different McGregor. This, what, this is He's got a, a great walk. This is a peaceful, a peaceful so humble. McGregor. A peaceful Conor McGregor. Yeah, a peaceful Conor McGregor who's focused on healthy nutrition. I Anyways. do. I don't eat meat. 
You eat fish. You eat fish, though, right? I eat fish, but when I originally did it, I did not eat fish because I just didn't eat fish. Oh, look at that! Woo! I know. I've been watching it go up. We are. I know. The, the more we banter, I feel like the more the money just piles up. Because we're talking about saving the animals. <sighs> Probably, but I am. I am really serious about that. I'm gonna do all beans and I'm gonna do all veggies. Legumes, lentils. Whoa! Oh my gosh! I didn't know we were gonna win this much. Ten dollars. Yeah. You're gonna win enough to go vegetarian right now. You know no, I'm gonna say. Oh, you know what? I'm gonna make more money by not spending money on meat. Do you know how much cheaper it is to be vegan or vegetarian? Which Why do you think I I am a cheap date? <laughs> <laughs> this is true, but I just think it'll be so. Like that. Here's the here's the facts though. You will live longer as a vegetarian. That's what the book showed me. It's just, that's open shut case. You want to be healthier, live longer, eat vegetables, whole foods. It just helps you be more mindful too. Yeah, and not the garbage kind of vegetarian where it's like, like Jeez, vegan it's Oreos dinner. and stuff. Like you have to actually eat like real vegetables. What are you going to do? Uh, I guess I'm going to live forever because I'm going to eat right. I'm also going to quit this game, I think, at 100. <laughs> <laughs> do you, are, if you're down, we'll do one more. I, I got 100 since I haven't spent any money. Let's do one more video and then let's go eat some vegan food. Eggplant! Okay, eggplant. Rev up your engines. If we can get 15 golden cups up on screen at the same time, we will win the grand jackpot on this checkered flag slot machine. That is $18,224. We are playing a variant of lightning, which really kicks you into high gear. I don't know how many race car puns I can get, but here in Las Vegas, we just had F1 driving up and down the strip. I didn't go to it personally because it was too intimidating, but it was really, really exciting to watch on TV. And now we are gonna try our luck on this machine. Hopefully F1 brought us some good luck that's percolating throughout this casino. I am ready to roll. $100 is now in the machine and we are off to the races. This is our first spin and we have three golden cups. We need to get to 15 to hit that grand jackpot, but I see lots of kings, so we are already up a little bit. 25 cents, back down to 99. 25, we are doing one cent denom, so we are betting one dollar per spin, but I gotta say, this is some really fun, exciting stuff going on in Las Vegas. If you watched any of the F1, you would have seen how we have the Sphere, which is our newest venue that's just like this giant LED ball, and it had this cool little emoji that would watch the race cars drive around. Um, I, there's mixed things going on about the interpretation of how it went. A lot of money came into the city. Not really sure the money went to the people who were actually working the event, the people who put it on, but somebody was getting paid. Um, that is such the thing. There's also a new law that says you can't... Oh, what do we got here? We got three race cars. That's a cool animation. Uh, you can't actually stand on the walkways anymore. That's now technically illegal, even though it wasn't during the first F1. So uh, yeah, no more like stopping and watching it for free. And it was kind of dramatic. They were putting up some walls so people couldn't see it from their hotels and things like that. But uh, overall, it's probably good for the city. We always do really good events here in Las Vegas. And I'm excited to see once we smooth it out a little bit, hopefully try to help some of the people who were most affected by it, like the workers, and make it worth it for them too, then this could be a great thing for the city. So, uh, Plus, I'm getting more into race cars than I've ever been, actually. Formula F1 is not something I've really watched before, and this year it was just fun to see it zipping around my city. So, All right, so we got five golden cups on that one. Not enough for a big win. We are down to $80.11, so ha haven't really come through with anything super notable yet. You know, the, I'll just throw it back to that F1 thing. The sound of those engines are just so sick. Like, electric cars, as fast as they are, they feel like roller coasters or, or like Disneyland rides. You know, there's something about that F1. You can just hear it coming around the corner, that vroom, that zip. Very, very cool. Uh, I don't know. It's just, just something about it. It just feels great to watch. Oh, three cups there on the right and three kings. That didn't really get us much. We are down to $72. Actually, back to $73. Now back to $72. Oh, hear that? There's that engine I'm talking about. Maybe $72 range is not where we are. Oh, it's $1.20. Okay, hoping for a little bit bigger win than that, but that's okay. Ready, set, go. Look at that revved engine. Got some tens over there. Got got a nice little winner winner circle or whatever you call those things like first, second, and third place uh, podiums or whatever. 
few guys over there celebrating their wins, popping some bottles of champagne, but just two of them. We need to get a whole row, a whole row full of them, and then we can have some big wins. We're getting nice columns of race cars, though. That's always fun. What do we got there? Those things kind of acted as wilds. All right, $1.62. You know, it's a little bit of a win. You know what I say. I'll take it. Oh, this looks great. Ooh, ooh, what do we got here? A full nine race cars? Oh, nice. That looks great. I wonder how much this is going to be worth. Actually, I wonder if this is going to get up to above $30. That seems pretty unlikely to get all nine to have this race car. Look at him just like he's driving. It's the Speed Racer song is kind of in my head, but just like going as fast as he can. I don't know. I can't remember it enough. But anyways, keep going. I definitely think... 10 is what we're going to get at least, but I'm actually hoping we go back up above $100. Calculating a little slow, maybe just bringing us the drama round in first. Oh, just 12. Okay. Hey, I'll take it, man. It's always good when you get nine of the same symbol on the screen. A little line win there for a little bonus, but $80.61. We've been playing for what? Five minutes or so. I I'm down. That's not bad. Race car is doing me doing me all right. Not a big win, but not a big loss either. Having fun. All right, we have there's a race car driver again. Love that animation. We got three of the uh, female race drivers, the lady race drivers on screen. Looks like a line win on top of that gave us a little bit of bonus money. We have oh yeah, a bunch of jacks on that screen. All right, not enough to kind of bring it up too much, but still. What else we got? And, yep, got a race car animation. Queen. Line win. We are at $75.36, making $1 bets. Maybe one day I'll get up to those bigger bets, but for now, I just got to get this channel going. If you don't, uh, if you're watching right now, hit that subscribe button. Um, I'd love to make this into a living, but it's going to take a while to get there, so playing it safe for now, but you know, if you guys support me, keep those numbers up, those views up, if I can make any money from YouTube, then I will keep on making these videos and that'll be really exciting. I'd love, I would love to do that. This is a lot of fun for me. Um, all right, $69.72. Let me know also in the comments what your favorite style of race car is if you're a nascar guy a formula f1 maybe you just like destruction derby maybe you're just into street racing or watching even just if you like the fast and the furious movies and that's the end like good enough for me i'd love to just have a conversation with you see what inter oh wait something's going on here we had a big lightning strike you know this is the lightning machine so we are going into a feature oh nice Mini bonus potential. Two free game spins remaining. Let's see if we got those locked in and we can get some more of those cups. Could you imagine if we got the whole screen full of them? Oh, 15 would win us so much money. But even if not, I see the mini bonus up there. I'm seeing a lot. Oh, there's a five. We got a two. Bunch of ones. That could be a nice bonus. We could be easily getting 10, 15 bucks out of this. Ooh, four. Nice. We can maybe up in the 20s now. Got a three down in the bottom left. Another four in the top right. Uh, two free spins Ugh. if if they even show up okay I, this is uh okay holy crap could you imagine those last that was actually super close to getting all 15. let's let the lightning strike these cups we are totaling up the money and this is a nice win 29 33 35 nice Let's add 35 to our 65. You know what? This game is coming through. We are not going to ride this to the bottom today. We are going to get really close back to that $100. That, oh, we actually are going to hit it. That's right, $100.47. Guys, I'm done. Let's call it a day. We're back where we started. I hope you're feeling the luck of the Irish today because we are playing Shamrock Fortunes. Look at that double rainbow, $14,000 grand prize. I saw that little lucky guy in there in that pile of gold. Let's get this three bag game going. We're gonna fill up those treasure buckets and we are gonna see them overflow. Hopefully all from this $100 bill. <clears throat> all right, I'm loving that music, boom. Fill that thing up, baby. Let's do this. 
Say what you will about Leprechaun. Some people love him. Some people a little freaked out by him. New 50 Cent win. I'm down. But you gotta love and respect the music. Irish music, there's just nothing like it. It's pure dance. It's pure beauty. It's pure countryside. That is what I'm feeling is just one one with nature right now. I am I'm feeling my Irish. Fun fact about St. Patrick is he was born in Britain, brought over to Ireland as a slave, and then became Christian. Yep, patron saint of good luck. <gasps> Wait. Oh my god, did we just have amazing luck right there? I think we just did. Five free spins. I'm ready. Let's go. Oh my gosh, we even get an Irish jig? Is that what that is? I think it's a jig, right? When they dance like that, boom. Turned into a mini major grand. Go, go in there. Go in those little slot things, you little slot things. Nice. Feeling the luck today. So far, this machine has been great. I mean, at $93, we've lost a little, but with all these bonus spins, just filling up those buckets, I am down. <sighs> we just got upgraded. What is symbol upgrade? Nice. We're working with a whole new set of symbols, ladies and gentlemen. I am loving that. Mm, are we gonna do it again? We might be doing it again. Oh, look at all that. 20, 51, 150, 100, 250. That is like five, six, seven, seven dollars. Look, we're back up over 100. You know it's a good day when we've been playing for a few minutes and we are back up over 100 dollars. Oh, even more. Another two dollars and or one dollar sixty cents. Loving it. Loving it. The luck of the Irish. Definitely lucky machine. Lucky casino. Lucky moment. Lucky day. I'm feeling luck in every bone of my body right now. I'm thinking that with that. Well, we had the extra spins and the growth reels both looking good there. Okay. Nice. Yep, keep filling it up, man. Look at that little lucky guy. I will keep wanting to call him a lucky charm. I know I know he's not a lucky charm. That's a cereal. He is a leprechaun. Make sure to get it right, slot curious. You're slot curious, you need to get these things right. Get curious about that. Let's get curious about leprechauns today. So, if you want a nice fact about leprechauns, here's what I got for you. Did you know that the word leprechaun actually comes from another Irish word that means shoemaker? So, when you see those little guys, they do kind of look like shoemakers, don't they? And look, there's the horseshoe symbol. Ooh, nice, 50 cents. So the horseshoe, shoemaker, you know what I mean? Lucky, I don't know where the four-leaf clover fits in, but we all know that's their main symbol of luck, so we'll go with it. Okay, so we're just making a little bit of progress there. 10 cents, I'll take it. $87.25. dollars We are making 80 cent bets today. We are making the luck of the Irish funnel into this machine. Ooh. Oh, nice. Dude, I'm having a great... I am so... This is all because of that symbol upgrade that we got earlier in the game, but it's really paying off now. Oh, my gosh. I almost got that one, too. Ooh, I'm loving these bags of gold. I wish I could... Maybe this is what's at the end of the rainbow. What do you think? Four, five, six, seven, eight dollars, dude. This... I'm... By the way, if you... This machine, I found it by going to a rainbow double rainbow going to the end boom this is where the money is okay guys i'm hoping that this is where the money is because it is the end of the rainbow i finally found it it is right here nice oh five cents i'll take it i like that sorry just enjoying that irish music there for a minute there's something about bagpipes you know it just feels it just feels wonderful Ooh, we haven't seen anything going to that top bag for a while. That's good. Ooh, another 50 cents. Loving it. Ooh, this could be good potential. Dollar 30. I'm feeling, you know, it's like they're, I'm paying 80 cents. I'm getting dollar, two dollar, three dollar, sometimes five, six, seven. Oh, nice. Another big, another bag upgrade. Mm, nope, nothing on that run. And nice. Ooh, look at that. Filling up that other bag. Well, tiny win. Five cents, but still is what it is. Mm, nothing. And nothing. And something that is nothing again. 
No, my lucky moment here, but let's turn that around. You know, we started out big, now we're getting a little bit in the in the lull zone. We're kind of flatlining a little. But still, I got a lot of faith in this machine. You know, the with that with that, especially with that upgrade on these bags. Look at dude, 800 credits right there. I'll take eight dollars. Take thirty cents. Take fifty cents. Thirty plus fifty cents. Boom. Okay, seventy-seven dollars. Let's keep going here. Feeling luck of the Irish. Oh, come on, lucky, lucky little machine here. Maybe we should name that leprechaun. What do you guys think a good name for a leprechaun is? Seamus, Patty, Lorcan, Alden, Emrind, Oshel, Declan. I don't know. Maybe Patty. Pat like St. Patrick. Patty for St. Patrick's or for Patrick. That is the quintessential leprechaun name. What is going on? Music pulled me back into the game and the dollar eighty made it worth it. Thanks for bringing me back. My mind was wandering there coming up with crazy names. Like, I want my leprechaun friend here not to be one of the trickster types, you know, because they can be very tricky. I don't want that. I just want the good-natured, good-lucky kind of leprechaun, the kind that picks the four-leaf clover and gives it to his girlfriend to, like, help her out. I want to be and to know those kind of leprechauns, not the sneaky, low-key type ones. The ones that you see in the cereal, I don't trust those. Those are the ones that, like, you don't know what you're getting. They're like, hey, over here, eat some sugary cereal. But behind the scenes, they're kind of like, we're in it for the money. And you know what? We're in it for the money, too. Let's be honest. We're in it to win big. We're coming to this slot machine because we want to turn this $64 that we have left into more than 100 Maybe hit a big jackpot. Maybe go home with a new car. Or uh, maybe just slowly whittle my way down because these machines, on average, do lose. But today might be the day that we get lucky because we're on the right machine in the right place at the right time that is how we do it come on let's see nothing there not too much on that one still growing our bag oh there we go A little 80 cent jump there very happy with that Seeing lots of bags on screen, but they're not gonna click, are they? Nope. Ooh, and we could have been an extra three, four bucks. No, once again. Boom. Got an extra spin. Man, man. Maybe we'll get back into that that extra spin again. Oh, oh, there we go. Three dollars. I'm happy with that. Let's keep winning. Let's keep those bags coming. Fifty-eight dollars. Filling up our bags, just playing away. Mm, there we go, another little push. Oh, all right. Man, we really, dude, we have really kind of cruised on this machine. It is not, it hasn't been like the big win. It hasn't been like super lucky, but it's been nice and steady this whole trip. Like, we have not really lost extremely fast, and we have had some moments where we kept kind of growing and going up a little bit so yeah i mean there's still a lot of potential in this thing mm. oh what is that one two dollars and ten cents yes let's keep going dun 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 no nothing Five cents. That's not nothing, but that's pretty close. Look, we're like back back to a dollar. Like, if it's not a dollar win, it, it kind of feels underwhelming. Let's be honest. I mean, I'm putting 80 cents on the line every time. What is going on? We have five free spin awards. We are back. Oh, this reminds me of the beginning of the game. There you are. Do the jig. Do the jig. I'm ready for it. Come on. Give me that lucky leprechaun jig. Boom. Spin, 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 free spins. Oh, love it. Growing the reels. I want to see that bag burst. I'm ready for that bag to burst. I'm ready for that bag to burst. I'm ready for all the bags to burst. I'm ready for all the leprechauns to jump out of those bags and do their jigs and pay, the, pay it up. Ooh, dollar, two dollar, three dollar, four dollar, five dollars and twenty cents. 
Thank you, Mr. Leprechaun. Thank you for those free spins. Thank you for that extra money. Back up to $58, $57.25 now. This is great. I mean, this really has been a fun machine. I think I could ride it a lot longer. We'll see. Maybe if we get down to 50, I might I might switch machines just because maybe my luck is going to run out after we've had two different bags break. Mm. But then again, maybe that's how it's getting hot. Maybe I'm cutting myself short. Maybe the luck of the leprechaun like right now is like going to give me even more five more free spin awards. Okay, maybe maybe this thing is trying to tell me something. Mr. Leprechaun, or what do we call him? Leppy Patty. We call them Patty. Patty, thank you so much. Give me that jig. Nice hip movement there. Boom. Get into your extra spins. A five, a three, and a two. Loving it. Luck of the Irish. Wow, I love when it gets extended reels like this. This is sick. Look at how many more chances we have to win. There are bags of money everywhere. There is pots of gold everywhere. There is Lucky Charm coins everywhere. And now we have five five extra again? Did we just win a five on a five and the six dollars and fifty cents? And we got Mr. Leprechaun, Patty, doing his jig. And we got free bonuses. Ah, oh, what is going on? This is what I'm talking about. Seven dollars and thirty cents. Loving it. We are on a roll right now, ladies and gentlemen. This is what it's like to be lucky at the Lucky Slot Machines. This is the Shamrock Fortune playing out for you in real time. 15, 16, $17.20. Oh my gosh, the Shamrock Fortunes are blessing me. This is what it's like at the end of the rainbow. This is what it's like when you have lucky, lucky leprechauns in every direction. Oh. Free spin. Another free spin? Oh, dang. $53 plus we're about to put another 20 on top of it after we get through this bonus. We are throwing that money up. Dude, we're about to pop that bag too. Wow. $19.45. I'll take it, man. $20 back up. Throw it into my cash pile. That brings us up to $72.50 once we start spinning again. And I... I am loving being this close to $100, and we've been playing for probably like 15 minutes or something. This is lucky. I mean, I got my, I'm getting my entertainment value out of it, so I think I'm going to cut it. I'm going to take this money and run. It is cash out time, and I appreciate you guys watching this video with me. If you think I should have named the Leprechaun different, put it in the comments below. Bye. Get ready to experience the hurricane. That is if you are a horse. Because this is Coin Combo Hurricane Horse for $12,000 Grand Jackpot. I thought I'd try it. I don't want to see any horses in a hurricane with this $100 Reno. So I guess we'll just hope for the best that the horses are okay and the big wins pay off today. Go on in there, you little money, and let's giddy up. Coin Combo Hurricane Horse. It is on its way, $100 in, and we're off to the races. Oh, right away, I like that trot. Plenty in that line win to be excited about. Seems like there's a good energy already emanating from this machine. I uh, don't know what I, ooh, I do love that animation. Is that a, like a Chinese character or is that a snake? Looks very snake-like to me. See the little top part there, like one of those Disney animated snakes? But hey, it's got persistence, which is very cool. It acts as a wild, and it got us over the $100 mark, so I am all in. A couple more of those. We also got the three-bag game, so hopefully those bulls will pop. Those coins will go flying out. Some more. Ooh, there's a lot of wilds and horses again. Yes, I am getting a great energy from this machine so far. Okay, what do we got here? Yep, bring me some more of those fancy shadow snakes Ooh, three shadow snakes loving that uh persistent for one more spin and help me get that bonus line win and help that thing pop thank you very much 96 dollars 13 cents happy about that flip over those coins and fill up pot number one come on persistent snake 
Shadow Snake match up with those aces to give us... Uh, did we get 80 cents? I don't know. I clicked the button too fast. Anyways, let's see what's up. Oh, three more. Two more. Going into the pot. Got gravy bowls everywhere. Fancy snake shadows. Gonna not help us on that one. Ooh, look at how many of those golden uh, hookahs or bags or bagpipes there are. I don't even know. God, so wait. I don't know what it is about slot machines, but I have so, so much trouble just explaining what the icons. I mean, I know that one's a. Uh, uh, what do you call it? The sands of time come in a sand clock? No, what is that called? Uh, like in Aladdin, the sands of time. Like, uh, there's just a timer. It's made with a sand timer? I think that's what it's called. I don't know. That, there we go. That's exactly how knowledgeable I am about icons. Slot icons. Slot symbols. Don't even know what to call them. That's why I'm getting curious. I got a lot to learn. Let me know all these things. I do not care if you correct me in the comments. That is how I learn. And yeah, I've only you know I've been playing slots uh, only for a month now, so I feel like there's plenty of room to learn. I'm just joining the community, as they say. Thank you, Shadow Snake, eighty-three dollars forty-five cents, and filling up our coin combo here. Let's get Hurricane Horse. Maybe horse that runs like a hurricane is the way to interpret this machine. And get them running and running and trotting. Trotting and galloping and running. All the different ways horses move differently than humans. Shadow Snake and Goblet or whatever, or Amulet. Maybe I'll call that thing an Amulet for no reason. It's got a little tail on the bottom. Good luck charm. Any luck charm? Shadow Snake and, and Crazy Coin and trotting, galloping horses. What is going on? Whew, so much on this machine. Overwhelmed. Down to $76.57. So I need to kick it up a notch. We started out with a lot of good luck. I still feel like a lot's going on here. So we might be getting into a bonus game any moment here. Let's do this. Come on, Shadow Snake. Do what you need to do. Come on, Shadow Snake. Thank you. Uh, oh, that's... Oh, I don't even know why I called that thing like a... That's a mu musical instrument. Gotcha. It's like a... Uh, uh, what do you... Uh, my brain's not working. What kind of instrument is that? One of those little kind of guitar -y type things that they were used in different cultures. And they're really tiny. Whatever. You guys can see what I can see. Probably even better. I need to get my vision checked. I'm getting old. All right, Shadow Snakes. Help me make some of these coins pop. And let's go into a bonus feature. Who almost willed that one into existence? You kind of felt it. I know you did. Come on. Can we get this thing to go? Three snakes. Stay persistent. Hit those wilds. That'll help the queens at least. Get us a little bit. One more. And... I got a nothing on that. Okay. Listen here. Horse hurricane. You and I are about to take it to the next level. There's no if, and, or buts about this. That would have popped. That would have been great. Shadow Snake, me and you, we've had our differences. But today we are going to align with that musical instrument. Banjo, maybe? Maybe banjo? Yeah, uh, that seems more like a country music thing, kind of similar. I don't know. Ukulele? Mandolin? Have to look that one up later. All right, come on, horses. Let's gallop into winning times. Um, Shadow Snake, Money Flip. Come on, that big one looks like it's gonna burst. Or that one on the side, on the right, maybe? No. That's where my red green thing kicks in a little bit. Pretty sure that was the green one on the right. Red in the middle. Okay. Definitely the blue one. Shadow Snake. Oh, yeah, there we go. Gravy Bull's lining up. Shadow Snake. Let's do this. Ooh, stay persistent. And yeah, nice combo there with Sands of Time. Thank you very much. Ooh, there's three in a row. That could make... Oh, that could easily have helped. Oh, why didn't that stay persistent for one more? That would have been nice. Ooh, lots of horses. 
Lots of galloping horses. That gives us a little bit of money, more than I spent on the bet. Thank you. Oh, that's, that's actually kind of a nice arrangement, too. But I like when they're... Uh, I don't like them so much when they're vertical. like them more horizontal. like them more in the row format than the column. But that's okay. Still, it gives you opportunities. I'm not Five minutes later. Oh, you would think by now that the security guards would know me, but they don't. I... I don't know, man. I'm here all the time. And like, what did he do? He didn't even stop me. He just was like, anyways, whatever. Filming slot machines, you guys probably know how weird that was at every casino, like before the pandemic. And now it's just sort of accepted, I thought. I've heard the Caesars properties aren't that um, friendly to it. I've never filmed there yet. Mostly I'm like off strip sometimes. Like every well, Resorts World, everybody loves that. Now, if you guys ever want to see like Vegas Matt and all those like big blowing up kind of spending tons of money, they're always, it seems like, at Resorts World. And I don't know. I just like Sunset Station. It's easy to get to. Good parking, good food. So they should just let me film. I mean, all I'm doing is like promoting their thing, you know? Anyway, Shadow Snake, thank you, thank you. Let's burn through the rest of this $50. Why not? Show them that I'm spending money on this machine. Oh. What's happened there? Nothing? Oh, all right. Back to the game. Shadow Snakes. Let's get aligned. Let's pull off a big win. Let's see a bonus game. Let's see something crazy from this machine, huh? Coins. Going in there. Bonus blue. Hit that big. No, nothing. Coins, coins, there we go, double on that, that's gotta be enough for something. Grew a little bit, bigger and bigger, Shadow Snake, Mandolin. Hmm, nothing on that yet. Nothing on that. Oh, that would have been good. Nothing there either. All right, got our little horses moving along there. Right, galloping up three dollars. Throw that in the coffers. Thank you very much. Happy to oblige by taking that money. Thank you. Shadow Snake slither on in. Solid wild combo line win. Staying persistent. This could be a good sign. Plus some coins. What do we got? Gravy bowls flashing at me. Oh, gone. Gone are the days having shadow snake wilds but will they come back will that day return will the omnipotent one come back and bless us with his presence oh only there for a corner Ooh, right there in the middle that's a good spot to be i like it more for some reason when it's aligned on the left or the middle on the right seems like man i don't know I, you know a lot, in a lot of machines it seems more important real number one two three less important and then the last two are kind of like I don't know. They're the ones that are just sort of rare and sort of put the whole thing together, but they're not like the core of the good luck, if you know what I mean. You understand the way I'm thinking. Like reading a sentence from left to right, it's like the first words kind of set the frame for the rest of the sentence. I don't know. That's just me. $22.30, two shadow snakes on screen, one coin flip. Try to get that first blue bag to burst and one more persistent shadow snake up there by the mandolins and we get nothing two more shadow snakes can you dig it no you cannot dig it can you burst it is that, from, is that a movie can you dig it some rap song i think Old days, I don't know. thank you come on let's do something here Let's get a big, before the $16 is gone, let's get a big finale, maybe a big bonus game, something to leave the viewers happy. And the and me. And me. It's a lot curious. Leave me happy too. We all happy together. Me and my friends. We all want to see something exciting happen right now. Come on, give me one big bonus and I will be super all right, coin is flipping over. Throwing in our first bag. Snake is not there to help. 
Galloping horses. We got a few on screen, but not enough. Yes, stay persistent. Those two will be there for a little bit longer. Move. Oh, the king in the gravy bowl. Why not just make that go through? Dang it. Six dollars left. All right, this is the time. Leave a comment. Leave a prayer in the comment section. Leave a prayer below. We got a little bonus there. Nine dollars. We can get some more. 88 cents a spin. Come on. We can get like 10 more spins out of this. Let's just. Oh, there we go. Lots of our amulets. Yeah, actually not. Okay. So listen, we got probably 11 or 12 spins. Like we just, we can get a bonus game. That'll be it. Just get a bonus game. Even if it's not the biggest one, that'll make me happy. Nine dollars left. Little, little thing there. Not enough, though, to really move the needle. Lots of galloping horses. I remember that energy. Remember at the beginning of the video how that energy was so good? I want to see that again. Come back. Come back, you little galloping horses. Hmm. Nothing. $2.80. Oh, my gosh, guys. I'm about to get drained, aren't I? All right, such is the life. Oh, right at the nick of time, keeping me alive. Four dollars. We have more spins. Oh, come on, just burst. Spin or burst with the flip around coin and then burst. Persistent snakes. We need coins. Every come on, they're burst. 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 That's it. Ah, love you guys. Hit subscribe. Get ready for a culinary delight of a slot machine. Grand prize on this slot machine is $20,400. I hope the Big Hot Flamin' Pots Delicious Delights pays that out to me today. We have three pots, yummy, upsized, or spicy, that we can be dropping our uh, symbols into, I guess, our food into, pots that we can be filling with food. Let's start with $100 and get going. Big Hot Flamin' Pots, delicious delights. I am ready to go. $100 in the machine and we are off to the races. All right, that middle pot looks like the flames are boiling. Looks like the ingredients are dropping in. And ooh, even more going in. Love to see that thing boil over. Go into a feature, that would be amazing. Yummy feature awards, stack and hit with four spin reset. We are down to $94.72. We're making 88 cent bets. Let's, let's, there's some shrimp on screen, let's go. All right, we got some, I wanna say mussels or something. Got some sushi, we got some ingredients going over to the spicy pot. Hopefully that will boil over, down to $91.20. Upsize pot is also starting to fill up. Let's get to that boiling point a little bit in all three of our pots. I love these three bad games. Yummy would be fun, but I'm ready for spicy to boil over. Oh, uh, what do we got here? Nice little wild animation. Maybe we can get some of those oranges all linked up. $87.83, filling up that middle pot again. Got some queens over on the right. Row of, there are a column of jacks over there. One reel of jacks on the left, but that's not going to do much for us. Got a reel of clams, I want to say, whatever that is, oysters. Got upsize filling up a little bit more too. All right, down to $83.79. Are you sushi fans? If so, leave a comment below. Ooh, double wild. Ooh, and does that wild match up with that parsley? Or the queens? Okay, 99 cents is a win is a win. It's more than we put in for that that run. Uh, but yeah, let me know what uh, which pot you guys like the most in, in, you know what I mean, guys, out of the yummy, upsized, or spicy pots in the game that we're playing. Let me know your favorite pot in the comments below. Which uh, pot of water should boil over with our ingredients in them? Oh, got some parsley. Nice reel number four full of parsley, but that's not going to do much for us. The sushi is looking yummy. Sure, you know, I'm kind of a fan of shrimp, but for some reason, like, single shrimp like that just don't get me the same way a single roll of sushi does. It looks much more delish. Ooh. Ooh, you see that flame bursting over the top. Almost felt like it was almost about to go. 
It didn't, but it could have. Maybe this one will knock the spicy over. Oh, each time, man. I feel it. I feel it moving up. All right. What do we got? Let's $70.75. We are not off to a great start, but uh, I've definitely seen comebacks much from much lower numbers. So it's still very possible. Nice set of wilds there. Show me that dish full of wild. That sounds delicious. Spicy, 125, go a dollar 25 going in there. Spill it over. Parsley, parsley's always, you know, parsley's underrated. A lot of people think, oh, it's just a little side, little side spice or whatever, but no. But parsley keeps it all together. You know, you miss the parsley, you miss a lot of the flavor. Look at those little dancing shrimp. Got some mates over on the left reel. And nothing quite on that one. Felt like the lot was gonna hit, but nothing did. Ooh, spicy is getting spicy over there. Let's see what else we got. There's this great all-you-can-eat sushi place at the Westgate Hotel. It's like 35 bucks. If we, what did I just win there? A little bit. Okay, but if we end up winning, if we end up winning like 135 dollars, maybe I should treat myself. It's next to this gigantic Benihana. It's like so beautiful. It's like one of the best places to have sushi. I might treat myself, and here we go. A couple wilds of queens and eights. That gave me a little bit of cash. Back to $58. Let's see. Ooh, we we would need a big win, though, to get up to 135 So better not get my sushi hopes up too high. Man, I would love to see that thing boil over right now. I am so ready to go into a bonus game. All right, and the mini is giving me giving me some hope. That middle one just keeps on growing. All right, nothing there. What do we got down here? Upsized feature awards stack and hit feature with two grids and three spin reset. Okay, what do we got here? Nothing on that one. Maybe a wild is going to help us out? Nope. Nothing quite there. If you have any family recipes that you want to share with the internet because they're so delicious that you would make in a pot of boiling water, like some kind of a stew, put that in the comments. I'd be curious to read that and I'll respond with with my opinion or if I think that sounds good. Now I'm not a cook, so I have nothing to contribute for that question. And I probably don't even have the skills to make anything you put down there, but I do love food and I would love to hear if any of you are, are good cooks, good chefs, have any information you want to share with the, uh, should I say community? With, I don't think I'm big enough to have a community, but like what would be a community if I had like tens of thousands of subscribers? All right, back to the game. We are down to $43.45. Okay, we're still trying to get these pots to bubble over. We have not gotten into a feature yet. So far, these wilds have not helped. Oh, wait, that could be a good one, though. Is that... Ooh, ooh that was, like, not... Because if you think of those three in the middle as wilds and then eight on the left and the right, I thought that might have been a nice win. All right, bunch of aces. There we go. How much is that worth? It's not that much, but still something. $40.77. Can we get that pot to boil over? Pushing it hard every time that goes up. I'm like, that's got to be, what is it, like one degree or one ingredient? I don't know. Come on, spicy. Pop off. I'm ready for that thing to bubble over and go to a bonus game. Yummy feature award. Stack and hit with four spin reset. Okay. I can't wait for the yummy feature award. Award four stack. Oh. This game's got me hungry and got me nervous. I'm going to lose my money. $34.82. There's a bunch of aces. Nice line one with the aces. Make a little bit back. $34.18 again with an extra spin. Come on. Let's get something going. Nothing. Maybe now? No. Nope. Seems like we're getting some patterns, but nothing that's adding up to being a lion win. So close, yet so far. Parsley, you're doing me dirty. What about that? If that jack wasn't up there, we would have had a whole row of them. I wanted to see five parsleys all in the top row. That would have been amazing. Boil over, you thing. You spicy thing. Should be hot enough in there with the spices and all of this energy I keep giving you. We've got symbols, ingredients, like crazy. 
Ooh, parsley coming through. Yeah, look, it makes a nice triangle there. That's a cool, that's a great shape for a land wing. Parsley going pyramid style on us. Ooh, now lemons going reverse pyramid on us. Liking that. Um, nothing on that run. Let's give it a try. $25.75. Hmm. Maybe? Blow up. I wonder what the upsized pot's all about. Actually, I really don't know what any of these bonus games are. Tell me in the comments below what I'm missing out on. I mean, I'll eventually get back to this game, but I try to switch it up for each video on this channel. However, I wonder what it'll be like. Like, I just want to see that spicy thing, like, tip over and, like, go into a bonus game. Some sort of food wheel or, like, a knife cutting a bunch of stuff. Maybe, maybe it's, like, pots and pans, like, flying everywhere. Or, like, maybe a big pot that makes a wheel. Who knows? These bonus features could be anything. Food, people are so creative with food. Ugh. All right, $18.73. If I get to zero, I'm probably going to end this video. But I've, I've, I've had comebacks from less than this, so maybe, maybe it's possible. Parsley, parsley, please. What does this say? Get four more of these different colored icons to guarantee a feature trigger. Okay, let's get some of those colored plates on screen. I don't think I've seen that symbol come up at all. So getting four on screen might be a tall order there, but hey, you, you never know. Maybe they all show up at the same time and then boom, we're going into feature. But it might be unlikely because at 88 cents a spin, we're down to less than 10 spins. $9, 10 cents, $8, 22 cents. We're gonna run out of money pretty soon, actually. Uh, nothing. All right, here is where let's pray to the food gods that we get something to work here. Think spices, think sushi, think full plate, seven course meal. Um, just think about lots of food in abundance, a farm, a farm that's blossoming with corn and berries and fruit and potatoes. And is it time to eat? Thank you, wild and nothing. All right, three spins left. Nothing. Oh, yummy tip over. I need that right now. That was my last chance. This is... Uh, that would have been so exciting. I'm done. So, Avalon has picked this machine for us to play next, The Wizard of Oz. Why did you bring me over here? Um, it's my dad's favorite movie, so I just had to... I had to come see it. All right. Well, I'm going to be putting $100 in this bad boy, and it is a brand new machine for me. And I, I, obviously, it's a classic movie. I love it. So I couldn't be more excited. After the luck that you gave me last time, I ended up $50 after we filmed an entire video. And at one point, we were double. So I'm expecting... I'm expecting big wins. I hope you can deliver. All right, I hope I can deliver some luck. <laughs> That's okay if you don't. I'm just happy for the, the friendship and the good conversation. Let's get going. Let's go. All right, so first spin. Has it want to say anything? Oh, State Fair. Uh, so is this a three-bag game? How does this work? No, it's not really a three-bag game. Um, I think you're looking for more line hits and, like, wilds and... Um, like there's, I know there's a Glenda the Good Witch, um, like feature, mm. uh, where she like pops out of a bubble. Um, Cause I've played this a few times, um, and I think that's like one of the only bonuses I've gotten. Okay, yeah. Just, yeah. Oh wait, this wait. is it. This is it. Wait, this is the. This is the Glenda the Good Witch. Oh, yeah, there's Glenda the Good Witch. There oh, she wow. is. Okay, yeah, straight. Yeah, she comes in with her bubbles. Straight from the movie. Literally straight out wait, of the movie. This is we had, got, we had such good luck on the second spin last time. You are insane. Wild! With your luck. I cannot believe how... All right, we, we got to, some wilds. If, if this mimics last time, I am going to freak out because we've had such good luck coming together. We're right over our original 100. Oh, that's cool. I like that. I like that snow overlay. Okay, so the main character... Like, let me just get my bearings. Like, there is the Tin Man, which I remember. There's the Scared Lion. What's the other one that we're looking the for? The Scarecrow. Scarecrow. And then the good witch helps her go down the yellow brick road. And then the bad witch. There is no bad witch. Well, there is a bad witch. Yes, of course there's the bad there's witch. The, there's the fake guy behind the thing. Is that the bad witch? Or maybe... No. Uh, oh, so there she is. Look at that. There, that's the bad witch. The back, okay, yeah, that is the black <laughs> witch for sure. 
Wait, so there's a good witch, a bad witch, and there's a fake person who's Oz. Yes. Oh my god, Absolutely. so many characters. I don't know how people keep track of everything. And here. then there's Toto. You can't forget Toto. Do you see him? <laughs> yeah, of course. I can't <laughs> believe I forgot Toto either. Toto's the big hit, man. Dorothy and Toto. Did you know that the original Dorothy shoes were not red? No. Yeah. That's blasphemy. What did they do? Fix color corrected in post or? Um, I think it was like something kind of kind of along those lines, but they were silver in, in real life. And I think it was just like the glare or something oh, something like, like in that. Like the way they filmed those old movies or something. Yeah, the way they filmed old movies that something turned them red. So Alright, then they went down in, in folklore and history ever since. What's with that candy, like the lollipop? Is that part of the movie? I don't remember that. Oh, the lollipop uh, munchkins. The lollipop guild. Do you remember the little mm. scene where they sing? Now that you say it, it did pop into my head, but I couldn't, until you said that, I had totally forgotten, but yeah. I definitely won't sing the song though. Why not? <laughs> that'll help, that'll, come on. It'll jog that'll, your memory. <laughs> yeah, like help me remember, like I have good memories of this movie, but it was from such a young age. I'll need you to sing to bring that back. Mm, maybe another time. I'll take singing lessons and then we'll come back to it. <laughs> okay, sounds good. Oh, and remind me, what's the sand timer? Is that did they have like a certain amount of time or something until? Like, yeah, was... I don't. I oh, it's been so long since I've seen until the movie. So she like transported or something. I remember she was like locked in the tower somewhere, and she only had like a certain amount of time for them oh. to save her. Oh. Yeah, we just got a few dollars. Okay, I thought that might have been even bigger, but yeah, we just got a few dollars. That's yeah, good. just a few bucks. Okay, okay. I got distracted. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Over the rainbow. Yes. Yeah, so many classic, like memories and memes and iconic. It, it, I think there's something else about this movie oh, too. That here's we, Glenda whoop. again. There's our good witch. Good witch. Bring us good fortune. She loves slot machines. I'm sure that's not what they intended when they made this. <laughs> Oh, I thought in the instructions Three. it said the wild couldn't be in the first reel, so I'm shocked that we have one there. But I guess I just remembered that wrong. But look, we just got three entire columns of wilds. That was amazing. Yeah. Let's keep I, it up. So I get thrown off a lot because sometimes I see like columns like, and I'm like, ooh, I'm going to win something. But it, it's really all about ropes. Yeah. Machines, Lines you know? and diagonals like yeah. that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's all about diagonals. all about the line win. Wait. Wait. Are they again? Look at how fast they're going. Go good witch, witch, good again. witch, bring me your bubbles. Let's get bubble, good witch. Wild, Oh wild. my gosh. And line win. Ooh, it's a good win, yay. Look over the rainbow, Toto, bring in that money. Look at our wins. Oh my gosh. 1,300 credits, 1,475. That brings us back to 100 bucks. Look, we are, look, we've been filming for like five minutes and we're, we have not really lost any money. I love, that's good for me, man. We if haven't break, budged. If I can get a video and end up with the same amount of money I started with, it's a good video. Definitely. Oh. Well, so tell me about some of the biggest wins you've had with uh, Vegas Low Roller Mom. Um, one of the biggest wins was on the uh, Everlasting Gobstopper video that we made. Um, $900. Whoa. Oh, wait. What wait, did we just I win? Know. Maybe, yeah, maybe that $900 is like, maybe we're going to beat it right now. Oh. Probably not. Oh Maybe. yeah, not quite. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. Eleven dollars is still a lot. Of, it's still dollars. <laughs> but yeah, that sounds like a huge win. Three fifty's been the biggest on my channel so far. Oh wow. Yeah, but I only play. I know you kind of. I know when you're dealing with uh, with um, a Roxy, you can go a little bit higher than the penny denoms. But for me, I've, I'm, I don't have that much money. Your channel's not growing yet, so. Well, it's going to grow now. Yeah, maybe, maybe. After there. this video, after this winning video. For sure. People love seeing Toto happy. And there he is on screen. Look at his little paws up there. He's just waiting for the cash to come in. We just got to click our heels together, and that's how we're going to win. Oh, uh, I didn't wear heels today. I'm oh. just wearing sneakers. Oh. You didn't come prepared? Well, you didn't tell me that just to play this machine, I needed to wear high heels. You think I'm going to walk into this casino with high heels on just because I'm playing the Wizard of Oz slot machine? Well, I thought you might come in costume. Maybe I mean, even a scarecrow costume? I don't know. I mean, maybe I'll try it just once. But if it's not a big win, I'm never doing it again. <laughs> Do you have some superstitions for when you play the machines? Absolutely. What it, wait, something's happening right now. Something's happening. We got super spins. Oh and my Glenda goodness. the Good Witch is on. She just loves us today. Look at this bubble. I love wild. Bubbles pop. Ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. Wow. 
what? That's a good line Green. hit. Columns of wild. Big win. We got rainbows everywhere. That big win is bursting out of the screen. $20.10. That brings us to 118 and 60. Wow. Nice. Another winning video. This is two in a row. This is awesome. This is awesome. Oh, man. I love also, it's, it's just kind of fun filming with you, too. Like, when I'm talking to myself, sometimes I feel like I'm crazy. <laughs> it's, like, a little bit better having someone that's, it like, another human. It is fun talking to someone. <laughs> yeah, I love talking to a Roxy, so I definitely get it. Yeah. Do you think you'd ever go off and do your own channel at some point? Uh, maybe. Or are you pretty busy with Vegas Low Roller Mom right now? Um, I would definitely give it a shot. I would try doing it on my own. I think it'd be fine. I'm sure you could. Look at all. Oh, we got so many of the state fair balloons. Why Look, didn't there's happen? Dorothy. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Dude, there's eight on screen. No, that's not a win. That should be a little minor win. I don't know. <laughs> one time I had, uh, was it Crazy Chickens? I think I got almost the entire screen full of one symbol. It was amazing. Oh my Everything goodness. except two were missing. And oh. I, it was worth a lot. Like, I think 20, 30 bucks. Wow. Yeah, for penny on a, slots. That on was one cent? Yeah, I was going to say that's pretty good. Yeah, yeah. It was, it was like... It, it was crazy. It was like the first reel was all, I think it was just, yeah, one of the chickens or whatever, like the first reel, the second one, the third one had like a spot in it. Then the fourth one was full and the fifth one had a spot in it. And I was like, oh my God, that's almost all of them. <laughs> yeah, it gets crazy. Wait, who, who's that guy at the top hat? Is he the guy behind the curtain? Oh wait, I did I don't know which guy. right there in the bottom right? I think so. Yeah, that's him. Yeah. The man behind the curtain revealed on our slot machine. Don't mean to spoil the movie for you, but if you have, but honestly, if someone in the comments, like, it, actually, if you've never seen The Wizard of Oz, leave a comment below. I would love to know how you went your whole life without seeing that movie. Yes, please comment below. I want to know. It's just like too busy. It's like one of those movies that somehow nobody has it not seen. Exactly. Kind of like Titanic. Everyone has yep, seen it. Exactly. And everybody knows that that board was, was, could have made them both float. You know? Yep, it, it, they could have fit on I there. I saw that on Mythbusters. They could both be alive right now. Poor, <laughs> poor, poor writing. They leaned on the true story of the Titanic too much. Uh, what do you think we take this $100 and move on to another machine? Sounds great. Another to video me. out of it? All right, let's do that. See you guys in the next video. Bye. Get ready to feel the fire of Dragon's Gold slot machine here at Rampart Casino. We are going to feel the heat. I can already tell. $100 in the machine. I am ready for everything these multicolored dragons are gonna give to us. I see the golden lion. I see um, that coin at the bottom when it gets adjacent to another coin. I think that's when we get something. I know there's something about that one, whether it's like up, down, left, right, that triggers something. So keep an eye on those golden coins with the square in the middle and those little uh, icons next to them. Ooh, right in the middle. That could be a good one. Down to $98.05. We are off to the races. Uh, have you played this game before? Because this is my very first time. The dragon theme has come up multiple times, but not dragon gold. This is a pure dragon play. Uh, very different from dragon link also, which I'm... I'm, I'm, it's so fun learning about all these different machines, but this one is giving me some really good energy right now. Uh, 2x multiplier, that could be a, a nice win there. All right, let's get some more of this golden luck. Tens are paying off for us a little bit, down to $94. We have our square coin, well, it's circle, but like square in the middle. Fish are starting to line up. Ooh, look at that thing. What's that, Phoenix dragon or something? What's with all the extra heads? Uh, Maybe it's one of those like multi-headed dragons, you know, like I don't know where those come from, but maybe Greek mythology something like that Golden fish golden turtle golden numbers plenty of gold on the screen. We just need this to line up What's this say multiply wins by up to 40 with that? Orbit thing with the flames coming out. Okay. Oh, there it is right there in the bottom the orb with the dragon flames Hey, hey, that's what I'm talking about. Three of our square gold coins. Oh, feature. Oh. <laughs> All right, feature has been won. Let's get into this, guys. Let's go. All right. I am I am hyped. Look at that. I don't even know which one I want to press, but I'll do the 13 free games. So many choices. Overwhelmed with choices here. Let's get into this bonus game. We have some extra reels to work with. Got... Our coin coming up right in the middle, our gold fish is there, 8x multiplier. 
and our dragon orb is spitting fire down in the bottom left. We've got aces showing up, and I am loving watching that win column total up. We are already above $5, and we have more to go. Oh, oh, maybe much more to go. Wow. Okay, I'm still trying to figure out what that 8x multiplier is, but no matter what number it is, if it's 8x multiplying, even two, three, four bucks, that is quite a bit. I might need to take a victory lap here for a second. Oh, $17 win. Oh, cool. Look at that blue dragon up there. Just like the, I guess they're whiskers or something. I don't really know, but that like really long mustache thing coming out of the nose looks awesome. Whoa, another 8x multiplier. Uh, and we have three kings. Okay, so that didn't trigger the way I thought it might. But still, $18.65 winning in the bonus. That is already putting us way above, or at least above the 100 we started with. So I am very happy about that. We got three golden coins spinning over there on the last reel. And nothing on that one. But I'm seeing gold everywhere. Gold. There's, a, there's a bunch of kings. And we have our gold coin. We've got our phoenix looking dragon thing. Our multi-headed dragon with some aces underneath it. Uh, ooh, three coins on that. But if they were adjacent to each other in a row or either like right angles, we would be killing it, but they're not, so that one doesn't trigger. But 8x multiplier, a bunch of 10s, and we've got a Dragon Orb fire thing killing it. Does that... Oh, we have another choice? Yes, let's do even more games. 20 free games. Let the fire dragon unleash his power. I am already at $25. Oh my god. 8x multiplier on all those golden fish? How big is this gonna go? <coughs> oh my gosh, I'm starting to lose my, my voice from all this. Okay, I gotta, yeah, I gotta just calm it down a little bit. Gotta say, gotta preserve my voice, this channel. Hopefully I'll be doing this channel for a long time. So, it, you know, it takes effort. You gotta grow it slow. Up to $50 already. We are getting to be massively in the winds. I am, I am really excited. We could be I'm not gonna say doubling our money, but like we're kind of getting close to doubling our money, especially if we have more, more room to grow on. Oh, we, dude, we kind of are 90, and then almost another 90. This machine is amazing. The dragon heat is real, man. I feel burned. I feel scorched. I feel burnt to the crisp by this fire dragon. Uh, let's see if we can keep getting some wins. Nothing on that run, but man, we have a lot of wins so far to celebrate. Nothing on that one. Come on, let's see if we can get a bunch of nines, a bunch of dragons. Is that gonna do anything? 3x multiplier, eat that up. Nothing on that run, but let's try. We got a fire dragon over there, but 3x multiplier on what? On the tens and the nines? Okay, maybe the nines are gonna give us something worth it. Looks like we're at $89.45 now for our win total to be added to at least to the 90. So, and it can still go up from here. We have 12 of 20 free games used so far. So there is plenty more spins. This is all freebies. This is all bonus territory. What happened there? Okay, we have, oh, we got three of the fire orbs and some kings to multiply. Oh my gosh, what is that gonna give us? Are we, are we, uh, what? 129, $130 on top of the 90. We actually have doubled our money. We have doubled our money on this machine, everyone. Thank you for watching this with me. I am on cloud nine. It is not easy. It is not often, I should say, that we get a doubling and we walk out of here with twice the amount we started with, but I could even play, I could play this down to another 50. Look at that, $130.25. Tack that on, we are at, let me say, let me say this clearly, $220. Wow. Oh my gosh. Dragon Gold is seriously paying off today. That, oh. I kind of want to go on my head, but I know I haven't even played that long yet. So let's let's play for a bit longer, just so we uh, have some good YouTube content for for everyone. Uh, that was great, though. Holy cow!
$217.95. I got to can't keep my eyes off that. That's crazy. We had 23 games and we got multipliers everywhere and we even got a bonus game and a bonus game. Um, I don't know if that happens very often. If you guys had good luck playing Dragon Gold, let me know in the comments below if this is a game you're familiar with. Yeah, because this game is playing it's fire for me today. This game is fire for me. Dang. All right. Okay, back to it. Um, head in the game here, Dylan. We are doing fine. We are getting slot curious about two more orbs and glowing turtles and glowing multi-headed phoenix dragon type things. Uh, what is this paying us? An extra four bucks? Yeah, throw it on there, man. I'll take it. Um, ooh, almost got some uh, lions lining up there. One off, close, but no cigar. Kings not lining up either. Uh, gold coins, looking for anything adjacent to those. And we're seeing aces. They seem to they're coming up over and over again, but nothing quite lining up for us. Uh, we see the orb in the top left there. 2x multiplier on the 10. Mm, just dragons, dragons, dragons. But none of them are spitting the same kind of fire that they were before. Let's see if we can keep playing this down. I, it's crazy. I have $210. I'm gonna, I can use this for a couple more videos. Uh, that's awesome. That's really good. I don't want to spend too much on this channel until we get a few more subscribers. I will. I, I have seen the comments. You guys are like, you bet more than a penny or whatever. But uh, I have to low roll for now. I just, I'm not coming in here like Vegas Matt with like big bucks to, to blow. And uh, if I did it, I don't know if I'd get the views to make the money back the way he does. So um, that would be the dream though. That'd be the dream. So hit subscribe. If you like watching this, a lot of content like this, be a feedback for me. Uh, leave that in the comments below because I'm definitely trying to get this channel to, to you know, to be something, something I can do daily and, and maybe make a living off of, which would be awesome. Okay, $207. We haven't had anything hit for a minute here, but of course, this has been a great day and a great machine for us. Oh, there's two. Oh, I saw the two coins line up. I was like, dude, if that third one comes adjacent, we would be getting some money, but it didn't. Uh, golden fish got our orb lots of good stuff showed up on that reel just none of it in abundance which is really what we need to make these games trigger make some of these wins happen 20 cents from some aces not bad but you know also not huge numbers down to 202 dollars 40 cents i'm gonna play just a couple more spins here if we get lucky uh, that would be great, but if not, I will see you guys in the next video. Um, thanks for thanks for hanging out with me. I had a blast playing this game with you. 200 and... Is this it? Anything here? No. What? Okay, just... Go oh, the turtles! Get that... Yeah. I was like, maybe we'll get turtles at the end. But we won't. Hit subscribe. Thank you guys. Bye. Okay, we are back. I have played this game a couple times before. I worry about how I'm going to say the top bar, but let's just call it Grand Fortune. $10,000 is our potential winnings on this machine. I remember these icons. I remember putting this $100 bill in last time, and it didn't go that well. It was sort of a slow grind down, but today it's calling for me in sort of a different way. I feel an energy with these drums, with these uh, coins that are all tied together that just brings me uh, peace of mind, makes me feel comfortable, makes me feel one with the machine, so why not give it a try? Off we go. Oh, already starting to fill up those bowls with cash. Let's see if we can get those to spill over, get into a bonus game. That would be wonderful. What is that, what is that icon? Like Chinese food boxes? No, like tickets, probably tickets to a movie. Uh, if you're into any of the, like, overseas cinema, um, I'm really... Oh, wait, what do we got here? Wait, what is this? Three? Oh, if anyone knows what that icon is, actually, tell me what that means. It looks like a T and an I in English, but I'm sure that has much more meaning to the developers of this game. Wow, nice. $97. We're, like, starting, starting off with a little bit of energy here, a little bit of luck. Keeps on moving. Yeah, definitely felt attracted to this machine. This must be why. Look at that. Drums everywhere. Oh. Oh. Money flying to the beat of the drum. Listen to that. <gasps> what? I feel like, uh, like that Aladdin where like the king's coming through. 
gather around my subjects. The king is making his grand entrance. Oh my gosh. What? How long is this going to win for? There's so many drums on screen. Six, twelve. Wow. Twelve out of fifteen of our symbols all showed up big. And this... Oh, there it is. Five of these pays 1350. All right, guys, we are back up above 100. I am very happy with that. That is that is great to know. Uh, anyways, but yeah, I was curious what you guys thought about the um, like just overseas movies. Now, just being honest, I'm like one of those people that just see. I want to see where that goes going. Wanted to. I just like to see Marvel movies and like usually the big like American classics. I saw Mission Impossible like on the airplane a couple weeks ago. Uh, oh, how many do we got here? Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten of these uh, tickets. Wow, I can't. What is going on with this machine? I can't even like get through my story without just making more money. Moving up, moving up. Every single reel, it feels like we're there. Nice, nine dollars, hundred and thirteen thirty-eight. Uh, but yeah, so I was gonna say, what is it? I, I, like Bollywood or. I don't know what you call like the cinema that comes from like China or any of the ones that come from Australia or any of the can I mean can Canadian is probably like the same as American you know but if you like any of those foreign flicks um, any of the independent stuff like let me know in the comments below um, my girlfriend and I went to a theater and watched one of those independent films like a month a couple months ago and I remember being so lost I was like what is this movie it's just all like people thinking. It was half the movie was zoomed in on somebody's face as they did nothing. Like they just were thinking about a loved one and it was raining around them or something. And I just thought, gosh, you can make this movie half as long and just get to the story beats, you know? But I guess that's part of it is like you just take time to just think for yourself. But I don't know. I don't know if that's the way I want to experience my movies. Too much work. I just want some popcorn and some superheroes sometimes. On my other YouTube channel, I do like AI stuff, which takes a lot of research. And then I sometimes just react to like cat videos and it's the best. That's like why it kind of led to these videos is they're just so, it's so nice to just like unwind basically. All right, back to the game, $109.24. We are doing pretty, ooh, what, look at this, two 400 showed up. What, what does it take to drop those into my winnings? Oop, lots of, lots of the cool hats are coming in. Hmm. I don't, I'm not really a hat person. I mean, I wear a baseball cap sometimes because it's Las Vegas and you gotta keep the sun out of your face, but I really don't see myself wearing a hat like that with a tassel on it or, you know, I mean, I've only put on a cowboy hat a few times for a photo or something, but, uh, those hats do look pretty pretty in theme, you know, thematic to the era and the time of the culture that this machine is meant to represent, which I appreciate. Okay, $97.48. So we have burst that barrier now. We, we are below $100. And... Oh, I guess not the next one. Um, oh, but yeah, I forgot. kind of forgot we've been filling up those, uh, those two buckets there. Oh, yeah, there we go. Let's see if I can get that to burst over. Some queens for a line win. Okay, and off we go. Oh, bunch of kings there. Not bad. Okay, nothing on that reel. Nope, nothing there either. Let's see if we can get... We, the, the, we've had the most luck so far in this machine when we've got not one of the bowls to spill over, not one of the bonus features, not even the line wins. It's been like that. Like what, see like how many of those bowls showed up on screen? Oh, there's the drums again too. Those were the way last on, that's what we won on last time. Like maybe that's the kind of luck I should be trying to channel into the machine. It's like how many, like, like when we played, do you guys remember when we played Diamond Hunters, how it was all about like filling the screen with diamonds? That's the kind of luck I think I'm best at. I mean, I'm obviously it's all just mathematics and these machines lose money on average, I try to remind you. But um, it feels like that's the kind of luck I end up with when I play slot machines most of the time. Like even right there, there was a nice pattern. But you know, sometimes we get those big, the biggest one we ever had was on a big bonus. So it does, it does happen. Okay, back to the game, $78.82. Oh, 
Look at that. Plus, oh, those are wilds kicking in too. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nice. Take those wins. I need more of those wilds to show up. All right. Off we go. I don't know if you guys are watching any football. It's uh, getting to be Super Bowl time, and it's going to be here in Las Vegas this year. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, which is exciting. I actually own some Raiders tickets. Uh, I do not get access to the Super Bowl, so I will not be going. That is way, 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 way too expensive for me. But it is cool that it's going to be here, so I've kind of been following it a little. Uh, I don't really have a team that I'm like rooting for in particular, but it was fun this weekend to watch a little bit uh, while I was on the gym. Like I don't, I don't like sit down and watch a full game. I just don't have time for it. Too busy over here on the slots making YouTube content, uh, researching for the AI channel. But I did find time to see how incredibly close the games have been, and they were exciting. So. Yeah, this week, if you haven't caught up on football, it's one of those weeks where you, you won't be disappointed. It was quite quite the battle out there on the gridiron. All right, down to $66. Wow. I need something else to hit. Like, look at this one on the right. That thing should be ready to burst. We've been, we've been, dumping, we've been dumping coins in there. Hmm, nothing on that spin. Nothing on that spin. All right. Oh, oh, we're getting so many if they just burst. We just need that thing to go and go and go. Okay, maybe that'll be the one. No, nothing on that. Oh, it just gets so nervous. Just go in there and burst. Oh, look at this wilds everywhere. Plus the hat tassels. What's that, six, seven, eight, nine? And we get that queen and king combo. Oh, I thought that could have been worth more money. That seemed very rare. That was that was exciting. That was an exciting moment there. Okay, we got decent amount of uh, credits on the screen, but they are not going to drop. Let's see if we get some of those to funnel into the bowl. Not enough to let it burst yet. Maybe there. Nope, not enough to burst yet. Oh, they're solid. These are persistent uh, symbols. Nice. I wonder how many spins we get this for. Oh, I guess three was three was the magic number. Oh, go on into the next one. On, on to the next one. So I was just learning. I didn't even know this, but I guess for some people who really know these slot machines, what they can do is they can wait. Like how we had that persistent, uh, that persistent icon on the screen for three spins. If I was to leave this machine after one spin and somebody else who had a really keen eye noticed what was going on, they could actually come play this slot machine and have a have more of an advantage right because like we're in the middle of an advantage play and if they always play sort of optimally like that they can sometimes i guess maybe beat the house or have a small edge every once in a while in fact i want to be done at 50 anyways we'll see if anyone else that we were able to collect the last time i played this machine if you've been following the channel which probably not too many of you have we're still growing but i think it's time to revisit this because those bonuses were quite the experience so let's do it another hundred dollars back in this bad boy and see if we can get some of those bonus games let's see if we can get some of those turtles to line up and go in there what is wrong? yeah there you go take my money all right let's see if we can get some of those ships to line up and off we go i don't know why sometimes i i don't feel like playing these kind of machines but today i just thought all right let's do it Remember these things totaling up? They, we got so many on screen last time. I guess I just have some good memories of it. Of course, golden bats. Oh, there we go. Turtles right off the bat. They say it's turtles all the way down. 38, 88. Let's take some of those credits. Get them piling up. Need a few more on screen to make that worth it. All right, golden bats. Off you go. Golden ships. I rem oh, what is this? I, we got four of those on screen. Is that worth anything? I guess not. Let's get some of those collected. Hmm. Okay, well, it's piling up, man. Let's get those coins to overflow out of that bowl. Plenty of ships, but nothing hitting just yet. It's all right. We still got a long way to go. Back to ninety-three dollars. That's plenty of plenty of runway. Make this machine pay off. Hopefully, we'll get a big bonus here in a minute. Hopefully, get some special features. We are getting nice groups of icons to show up, which is always, always a good thing. I feel like there is some good energy coming from this machine. That's what drew me over here in the first... As you guys know, I'm very uh, energy-oriented. 
Uh, like I, you know, I almost close my eyes like Daredevil and feel which machine I should go to. But also, I like diversity. I'm still a little new to slot machines. I've probably only done a couple dozen videos so far, so uh, there's a lot to explore. And every once in a while, I just want to come back to where I where I've been before. Oh, oh, wait, is this a double? Yeah, that's paying off more than I expected. Back to ninety-four dollars and seventy-seven cents. Nothing wrong with that. All right, let's see. We get some more. Oh, double golden bats. Bunch of stacks of gold. Ooh, nice. Let's make that thing tip over. Go into some of those bonus games. I want to get all of those money coins collected. Oh, I almost felt like that was going to take me there, too. But we're still at $91. Not bad. When was the last time you had a dinner with those kind of dishes, you know? Seven course meal. Write in the comments below the last time you had a real seven course meal. One of those that's just way over the top, you know, multiple layers of forks and knives. You don't know how to use anything. Let me know if you enjoyed that dinner too. Maybe even how much it cost if you want to share that. Because I'm sort of curious how much it even costs to do those fancy seven course dinners nowadays. In Vegas, it can really get expensive. I've seen like $500 meals for four or five people easy. So, uh, and that's not even seven course meals sometimes. Sometimes that's just like sushi or something. All right, so, well, there they are stacking up right there. Maybe that's a symbol. I need a seven-course meal. Maybe if we get to $1,000 on this machine, I will go celebrate with a seven-course meal. Maybe take take the old girlfriend out for something super fancy if we, if we hit a big, okay? So there's that energy out in the world. Funnel down the seven-course meal energy into this slot machine, and here it comes. No. Maybe here it's coming right now. We're go whoa, whoa, was that it? I hope that's a thousand. Look at how many golden ships we got. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven golden ships. Okay, maybe I do need, maybe it's all, uh, only 10 bucks. I'll have to put a couple more zeros on that, but still. Uh, I need a whole screen full of those, I think. Going to, uh, come on, let's go back into these bonus games. Sometimes a machine can be tainted. You come here once, you have like an exceptional experience, and then you come back to it and you can't have that again, and it just like, I don't know, maybe I should leave well enough alone next time. Oh, we got some, uh, whatever those Dow things are. Oh, there we go, a couple, couple columns that were lining up, but nothing that triggered, so getting close. God, there's another column of aces over there in the fifth reel. Look how many, yeah, nice. 82 bucks, not too bad, but still. Let's go for that big win. Let's get into a bonus game. Let's let something rock our socks off, you know? That's what this machine's all about. Golden turtles, golden ships, golden bats. Flying up. Look at how many times we've put something in there. That's gotta spill over soon. All right, little row of turtles. Quotas. Nope. Not enough to break through. It's got to be getting close to that tipping point. Oh, wow. We got six on screen of the Golden Dragons. Gave us a little boost there. Not too much. All queens over on the first reel. Lots of turtles on that one. See if that adds up to much. Not any extra money going in. All right. Let me just reposition here. Sometimes I sit on the machines in a weird way where I like kind of bend my leg in a strange way. So I just got to fix that up. I, uh, when I was younger, I used to be able to sit um, Indian style. I used to say that like that. And I used to put like both ankles up on both knees. It was very, very flexible. It's been a long, long time since I've been able to do that again. But the way I was sitting was like kind of on one of my legs that way. So maybe, maybe I'll get there if I play this machine long enough. Should I start sitting Indian position? That would be great. Give me a... Uh, yoga posture while I play slot machines. Oh. Oh. Oh, that isn't enough. I thought because we had five on screen, we were about to collect on those coins. Now well, turtles. Lots of turtles showing up. Come in, it's like Turtle Festival. It's like the Ninja Turtles or... Have you ever seen those videos where they like all come out of their eggs on the beach and all make their way to the water? And like really nice people help protect them from birds and stuff because they're endangered. That's basically what this machine has been like so far for me. All right, back, head back in the game. There we go, bunch of gold coins. 
Nothing big. Oh, I'd love to see that, but nothing's triggering. So we got some ships. We got a little bit of turtles. We got a little bit of seven course dinner. Wait, why is everything changing? Are we getting close to that thing bursting? Something's going on, I think. Hmm. I'm feeling an energy. Something is building up right now. Four kings on that roll. On that spin. Ooh, lots of turtles on that one. What are we, six there? Nice. Let's make that happen. So, five more turtles. Oh, my gosh. Uh, what happened to that energy? It felt like the screen was starting to change on me. Hmm. All hype, all hype. It's okay, maybe that's part of the thrill. Sometimes this machine gives you something exciting, but you gotta fight for it, you know? Like, as soon as you think you're down and out, that's when, boom, you get your opportunity to come back, make, make a mark. Wow, eight turtles, one screen. Eight turtles, one screen, that's insane. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven gold dishes. All right, time to get serious about these winnings, okay? We're approaching the $50 mark, and I would love to see this thing burst back up above 100, back into the thousands. Okay, those gold dragons are paying off. I'm back to 60. Or it could be a slow grind for a minute, buy some more opportunities for the big jackpot. Mm, nothing on that spin, and nothing on that spin, but... I'm seeing turtles and turtles everywhere. That was nice, but I guess that didn't add up to much. All right, so seven, eight, uh, four on that. Okay, hmm. focus in, channel that energy. I need to think gold thoughts. I need to think fancy. What's the What's the last time I was in like a really fancy hotel room or like restaurant or something? No, oh, gosh, there's probably no memory like that. Maybe this isn't my machine. For today, I think I might call it a 50 because unless this one does it, I think we'll come back to this machine another day. All right, everybody, today I am being seduced by the wish mistress. She has a very confident demeanor, which I am also feeling today. So we were simply attracted to each other. Uh, she seems to be a big fan of money, so I got $100 that I am ready to drop into this machine. Let's see how she feels about it. I submit to you one Benjamin Franklin. All right. Game on. So my friend, who shall Renee remain unnamed right now, is going on a date with, uh, or later tonight, with his... X fling and uh, he's like not really sure if it's gonna be like a rekindling or if it's just gonna be a hangout he's not sure if she started dating someone between the time they hung out and now or if she was just kind of off the radar so I was talking to him about that on the drive over and I was thinking you know what maybe the wish mistress here at Sunset Station could be you know, a helpful, um, what do you want to, what do you call that when like a girl helps a guy like with girl problems, like a wing woman? I don't know, if you already have the girl who's still wing woman, you guys tell me in the comments below. When is it a wing woman and when is it just helpful advice from a trusted friend who's female and has insights into the female brain? Uh, and what is the, what do you call that? Is there a name for that? I don't even know. I have to ask the wish mistress when we get some money. Maybe we get a bonus game. We got lots and lots of chests showing up all over the screen. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh, yeah, chests everywhere. What? Oh my, oh my. I didn't know it was gonna burst into a super something. Super what? Super 520. Ooh, $92. Still in the bank, only lost 10 so far. Not great, but at least we got that little super deep. Well, look. Wow. Okay, one chest and then nine wilds. That's crazy. That's crazy. There's a lot of wilds to make a. That's that wild. Those are just wilds looking for any kind of combo. 
I wonder what happens if you get a whole screen of just wilds and there's not even one other symbol to match with them. Do they just like pick the weakest symbol? I don't know. Never had that happen before. Let me know if you've ever seen 15 wilds show up on the screen at the same time. We are getting a lot of wilds today. Though. We're bringing in lots of chests, lots of wilds. Ooh, now we got our key and book. I I do really like the icons on this. It gives me a very like video gamey Lord of the Rings kind of thing. Yeah, there you go. Wilds everywhere. $90 still, not bad. We had our, our lady showing up there. Got a bonus symbol. That would have been nice to get a few more of those. Lining up. Ooh, gems and jewels. Love it. Mm, no, nothing over there. Ooh, the ruby. Rubies are wild. There we go. Rubies are wild. Crazy redheads. Ruby wilds. Love it. Let's do it. Nice. I actually got a friend that just came back from a gem, a gem conference also, like gems, like rubies and rocks and all that stuff. And I was like telling me about how beautiful Opal is. And I was like, whoa, okay. But like, you know, I'm, not that I, I can even tell the difference between it all. It all just seems like rocks to me. But he's like, look at Opal. And I was like, yeah, you know what? Opal is pretty beautiful when you actually take time to look at it. But I don't know. Gems and stones and stuff. Some people just, they just thrive on them. They love gems and stones. I'm not that person. I feel like I could, maybe if I had enough time and money or something that like that could be something I could get into because I do have the ability to get into like really weird obscure things and get like super deep into them and be like I love this. I'm, I'm consumed even though it makes no sense but so far it hasn't been the gems and rubies but there is a beauty to material science and they are cool because they're just so perfectly aligned atoms you know it's just you can just dig into these materials. It's just so beautiful and organized. Unlike my life, which is full of just wilds and risks and craziness like this slot machine. $78.70. Can we get a few more of these line wins? Can we get a few more of the icons to show up? Oh, okay. You listen to me. The bonus on these three bad games. Let's see if we can get some of those diamonds to hit. Oh, 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 there goes the wild. The gems are hit today. Wild gems, thank you very much. That brings us to $76.75. Ooh, look at that fire coming down from Our Lady, the Wish Mistress. I am wishing for more wilds, and that is exactly what I'm getting. She's like the genie in the lamp, but she grants wishes of rubies. Oh, two bonuses at the same time. Oh, I love when it does the hyper spin on that column. Column number five. Oh, one more bonus would have been so fun. We got so close. So close, yet so far. So far, yet so close. You can really use that metaphor either way. It's kind of uh, interchangeable. What do they call that? Ambidextrous? No. Uh, reversible? No. Mirroring? Something like that. More chests on the screen. We've had plenty of those today, but none have really given us anything except that big wild at the very beginning. Oh, there we go. That, ooh, that could have been it. One more bonus. Come on, wish mistress. Grant these wishes. Ooh, there we go. Two columns of wild. What's that going to do for us? Oh, that is going to give us a few different line wins. Back to $73.75. Mm, nope, nothing on the bonus there. Mm, we got a few. Oh, so close on that. Oh, the rubies, though, would be nice. Boom! Where did that come from? Wilds everywhere. Great win. Filling up the screen. Are you kidding? This is what I was waiting for this whole video. We are waiting. Oh, it's not quite as big as I thought. Seven bucks. I'll take it. That gives us $78. Somehow, with that many wilds on screen, I was expecting like a $15 or $20 thing. But, you know, you get, your high, you get so hyped up. You get so excited. And then, you know, it doesn't pay off sometimes. Such is the life of a YouTuber who films themselves playing slot machines. Uh, wish mistress. Come on, let's see what you got for us. Maybe I need to wish more often and she will help me out. I wish for a really big bonus game line win with chests everywhere all over the screen. What? What, what, what did I do? I wish wrong or something? Hey. There we go. Flames are coming down from her magical spinning orb. I am uh, Triangle Dragon. 
Illuminati thing that's in her hand, kind of Doctor Strange style. Come on, what else we got going on here? We have no bonus on that one, but right in the center teasing us. You tease, you little bonus tease. Um, nothing on that either. Come on, can we get some good luck going on here? I am digging it. Rubies, gems, rhinestones. Diamonds are forever, they say. Remember we played Diamond Hunter? Were you guys here for that? Wait, whoa, well, there's a lot of wilds on there. Sorry, I should have acknowledged that. Uh, were you guys here for the Diamond Hunter game? Uh, it's always one of my favorites, but that's like, that's the that's the machine that makes me think gem. That's the one that thinks ruby, rhinestone, gem. I'm like Diamond Hunter, that's it. This Wish Mistress obviously has a lot of rubies and stuff, but these are more like Lord of the Rings style crystals. Whoa, that, well that fire on the bottom jumped up into all the columns around it? That was nuts. Adjacent wilds in all direction is gonna give us how much? Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven plus? Thirteen dollars and thirty-five cents. Wow. I'll take it. Seventy-seven dollars even. That is not too bad. I'm glad we got that little kid that little pick-me-up there. That means we're only down. $25. I have definitely done more damage on a slot machine after nine minutes of play. So Wish Mistress has uh, not hurt too bad. She's made the pain bearable, which is uh, maybe you just wish for bearable pain. For a lot of people, that's that's a big win. <laughs> bearable pain. Can you imagine if you got a genie and they were like, you have one wish, and you're like, I just want the pain in my life to be bearable. Be like, yeah, it's realistic. Wilds everywhere. Oh. And it's multiplying out the Wish Mistress herself. $4.50. Very cool. I'll take it. One bonus, but I need three. I would love to see three bonuses hit. Love to see three bonuses hit. That'd be great anytime now. Hey. Hey. Oh. Wait, did you see... Did I fill up all the diamonds in the top right, or did they just disappear? Is that what gave, oh, that's what gave me all those wilds, and that did give me a little bit of money, but I thought I might jump into like a big old bonus game or something crazy. Okay, talking too early. Please, look at that hype. Bonus, bonus. No. You are a sneaky one, wish mistress coming at me with that energy and then you just don't just don't give it that that, that was so close uh 